Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Zelathon Daybreak. Hey. Howdy. Hey. Hello. We have a new coach, a new game player. That's me. Uh, we're here raising money for Direct Relief. Direct Relief is a fantastic humanitarian organization that helps not only in disasters, but also all 50 uh, states, country, and over 100 countries around the world. Uh, I'm here to play Phantom Hourglass. I am not the original runner of this game. As you see, there's two people splitting this game up. We both haven't played it in five years. We had, we had, a, we had a scramble together in two days to try to get a run together. Um, so I apologize if we're unable to completely finish the run all the way through. We do have a safe file, as you see, 100% kind of, and we can go to the final boss. So I do apologize about that, but we're gonna get this started. I believe the file name is Rat. Rat. Is that it? Is that, is that what it is? It's supposed to be Rat. It's rat is two for two now. Rat. Did Rat win? Not MC. MC? <laughs> Why does it default to that? <laughs> because it's his account. Like, oh. I'm under his oh. Yeah. <laughs> um, so is it all lowercase rat? Is that is that it? Lowercase capital? Is there anything? The last one was capital. Was the last one capital? Yeah. Okay. Hello, everyone. All right. I expect perfect speedrunning game. Absolutely from not. Uh, I play left-handed. In my left hand. You use your left hand? Lefty. So I'm lefty, but I play right handed guitar. Okay, well, can they donate for you to use your right hand? <laughs> All right, we're gonna start the game. And three, <laughs> two, one, let's go. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. You okay. got this. Oh, oh, right. you, didn't, you didn't push the button yet. Battle mode! Yeah, yeah. Let's, go. let's go! Seven hours of battle mode. I don't care about story. <laughs> Get look, look, me look at those cards, though. Imagine skipping cutscenes. There was a young girl. The savvy season. They all look very happy. They're yeah. not happy. They're having a horrible time. They're stuck like that forever. I'd be oh. pretty sad if I looked like that too. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I am a potato chip. <laughs> <laughs> so I hope everyone in chat's had a good time with the first run and are getting all comfy for the night for a lot of our other runs coming up. Yeah, Dan will be jumping in. I'm gonna get to the ghost ship in this game. Uh, which is around the halfway point, um, which is fun. So yeah, I hope everyone's having a good time hanging out. How's everyone doing on the couch? Let's go through a roll call real quick since we got the stupid cutscene going on. <laughs> What's going on? Who's sitting here? Let's get some introductions. Uh, this isn't a stupid cutscene. Look at that. Look how riveting that is. Anyway, I'm Ross <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm doing all right. I'm uh, pretty chill. I just had some coffee a little bit ago, so I can oh, actually wow. make it through this. So. Might might be a little amped up in a few minutes. <laughs> awesome. Cool. Hi, I'm Danny Music. I just had food and I am raring to go. Raring. Good for oh the God. hour of the glasses. Sweet. Who is in the back? I can't see you. Hi, I'm Big James. Oh no, get me out of here. Ah. <laughs> get me <laughs> out of here. Runs over. <laughs> you done? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like story? Skipping. Yeah, okay, okay. Uh, hi, Navik here. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. I, I was gonna make a joke. Are you done? <laughs> Are you done? You later, done. Nerve and then done. We have on donations. Hi. Very importantly. Hi, Marissa. Hi, Marissa. Hi, Marissa. I got a couple donations to read if you oh, don't mind. Please Ooh. read them. Oh, We've my got, goodness. and these might be old and they just weren't uh, red, marked as red, but I'm gonna do them anyway. We got twenty dollars and ninety six cents from Deskippy. No comment. We have five dollars from Lady Zora Sword that says, "Bad middle school situation turned awesome. In science class, this guy bullied me. I, I tell him to stop, and he'd just say, do 'Don't get mad, get glad.' I finally got my revenge when we were partnered together for an in class project. He goofed off with his friends the entire class while I did the work. I turned in my worksheet without letting him see it. At the end of class, he said, 'What am I supposed to do?'" And he just said, don't get mad, get glad. <laughs> and I grabbed my bag and left the classroom. That was probably the bravest moment of my entire childhood. 
I'm very proud of young me. I'm proud of young you too. Oh. Are we, are we continuing the trend of, of middle school trauma turning as a success? <laughs> I guess so. We're doing that at the end of Link to the Past, and I guess we're just going to persist that. Either <laughs> that or these are the dying remnants. You know what? I'm, I'm here for it. Let's keep it up. Either Let's way. Keep it going. Oh, we got it. We got it. Oh, yeah. We got it. Kiffy, what's your tragic middle school story? <laughs> yeah. yeah roll school. call slash roll call trauma. trauma. <laughs> what a combo. <laughs> Um, middle school, so ending. my entire like middle school, elementary, middle school, and high school, I just switched schools because we moved to different states. Um, so every time it would be like a different curriculum, and every time it was the worst because I would always be a grade down because the classes I did were always like a year or two above ahead and then I was like on like earth science and that was like the sixth grader class. So in like eighth grade I was in sixth grader class so that was always fun. Um, I saw someone pee their pants they and looked right me in the face and I didn't say anything. Hey, no that's one... that's being a friend. <laughs> I didn't say anything, I didn't say anything, and we just sat there. So shout outs to you. But yeah, that happened. That, <laughs> that, well that I, I, That was an ultimate bro move. Like, I just looked, I, I would want to hang with you and yeah. I was like, okay. Normally I would have laughed hysterically, but at that moment I knew it was a uh, compromising situation. We will both take this to our graves. <laughs> yeah, that's not, not a thousand people on the Yeah, that's true. Shout Oops. out to John Peter Pants. Well, it was fine until you <laughs> named him. Oh no. <laughs> An unfortunate name. John Peter Pants. John. He, he, he had to live up to his destiny. Yeah. Yeah. His, his parents loved him though. It's fine. I have $5 from random person 2021 that says, and now a fact. Fact. There's a uh -oh. certain amount of potassium that is radioactive. Mm -hmm. If you ate 40,000 bananas in less than 10 minutes, you would die of radiation poisoning. And banana. Oh. Wow. And banana. Consider your pants peed, Swimple. That's a lot. <laughs> Let me out of here. Is that a lie, though? Let's test it, I guess. Yeah. Only so one this game, as you just noticed, if you roll too many times, you just have to puke. <laughs> so if you spend just too like many times, you gotta puke. <laughs> They, they made this too real with the like, touch controls. Finally, Legend of Zelda throws in some realism for once. <laughs> they probably didn't want you to break your touch screen yeah. by just mashing and into it. Oh my god, that's so aggressive. That's Grandpa, he's Where mad. you think you're going, rat? rat. <laughs> you're mishandling your sword, rat. <laughs> Eight dollars from Gallery Rihanna that says, Sorry, Frosty. Frosty's no longer here. Instead of high school memory, you're getting high school trauma dump. Uh -oh. To set the stage, my freshman year, I joined Color Guard, uh, the dancing flags, not the military stuff, and did it until I graduated. My first marching season, there was a maneuver where you had to quickly grab flags and walk backwards. My very first performance, I grabbed the flags and then completely fall backwards and rolled over. I got up quickly and tried to recover, but I definitely got teased about it, mostly playfully, for the entire season. It's so weird looking up and down, at the, and this is the same thing. Why are you have to look down? My neck wants to look down. I don't oh. want to look Instinctively. down. Instinctively. <laughs> sure. Yeah, I'm like, hello, I'm going to cuddle up on this. <laughs> Here, we'll, we'll, we'll just get you like a music stand. You can put the, like, the pad oh, yeah, on. There you yeah. Yeah. Hello. Yeah. I'm playing now. <laughs> so, we're playing the video game. Boulder. Make sure to look right into the camera as you cover yeah. your face. 2291 from... LZ Moto with no comment. Thank you. Get out of here, dog. And fifty dollars from Broken. Let's go, says... Broken. Hi, Couch. Just wanted to say thanks to Brooke and Dan for picking up this game so last minute. I wish I could be there with y'all this time. Good luck with my favorite installation in the franchise. Heart. I love you, Broken. Broken. No problem. I miss you. The only thing that's broken is my heart because you're not here. Oh. Aww. Let's see if I remember this. Oh, look, I'm, game I'm gonna run to the bathroom, so definitely don't donate, it. otherwise. Let's clap. Let's go. <laughs> I would do a read around. Don't, don't donate on whatever you do. Is 43. Don't, don't say donate. that. Please clap. <laughs> it's reverse psychology, Shadow. Oh, I see that. Um, so there's a one thing I want everyone to do for me. Every, uh, you know, $25 donation or above. Please uh, donate saying, save the game. So there's a really <laughs> weird thing about this game. Uh, it just hard crashes uh, 
for oh. no reason. Yeah. I that's... think it's known why, but it's just a, you know, a pain. It's a weird Wii U bug. Yeah. Like a... that sounds familiar. Uh, it's happened at the marathon before. Oops. So a, a, every time you donate at least $25, uh, Campy will, in fact, save. I'll try to save. Every, uh, I'll just, just please remind will, me to save as much as you can. However, will, if will you, you do only, not... Will you only donate if... Will you only save if there's a $25 or more donation? Yeah. That's yeah, what I'm saying. I think that's where oh. this is going, yeah. Okay. Where, where, where's this? Oh, it saves right there. I gotta remember that. I'm gonna save already. But for so, some that, reason, so that one's for free. That's a <laughs> yeah. free one. But we really do need people to help me save. Because uh, <laughs> I do not want this game to crash. And I know we're, we're just vibing here. We're picking up the game. But we don't want it to crash. <laughs> I've had too many games Zelda crash on me and I lose two hours of progress. On the how, how much for a save state? One hundred dollars, I'll save. <laughs> <laughs> one million dollars. The more guaranteed safe. <laughs> the safer one. All right, so I got to see Lineback, everyone's favorite man who has a boat. Known what? for things such as having a boat. Having a boat and being a fraidy cat. All right, so he's not here, obviously. So we gotta go to a bar because that's where captains go, right? It's a go milk there. bar. Good time at a bar. Where's the bar though? Over here, right? Yeah, there it is. Oh, look. You can tell it's a bar because it is bread at the front. True. <laughs> a sandwich bar. All right, get me out of here. All right, so we're going to a place that we're going to be repeatedly going to this entire game, Temple of the Ocean King. It doesn't exist, apparently, to that old guy. What a great dungeon it is. Yeah, you just gotta repeat the same puzzle four million times. I was saying, it's so great you get to repeat it how many times? I think it's four, five, six, seven, like five or six, <laughs> something like that. It's really up there. Because during my part, I think I do it three times. Well, I do a bunch of different dungeons when you can just do the same one. I mean, it's I... not a bad place. I think if they ever remade this game, Temple of the Ocean King could be awesome. I think they could do a lot of cool stuff with it, but you know, it's stuck on the DS, aka the Wii U, on two consoles that no one wants to play. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so it's Tiny Link. Yeah, it'll probably all be on Switch eventually. It's gonna have the entire Nintendo library on there. At some point, you know, oh. whenever we get GameCube, that'll be great. Hello, I'm back. Imagine, and he can buy it all again. Twenty dollars and one cent from oh. toilet emoji that just says plush. I even summoned it really quick. <laughs> Do you guys remember when emojis in the donation system just completely broke it? Oh, it's this guy. Look, I'm Rom Scout. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Hi, howdy, Rom Scout. Howdy. Who was here the entire time? Castlevania. <laughs> <laughs> My hands, persona, persona. <laughs> Oracles. <laughs> My first time on, on Zelda Fun Couch is on Monday break. This is what a yeah. dude. I, I have wow. lost run already. Wait, no, I kind of want to see. You've gone this far without MC on camera. Yeah, huh. I, I I did not have to make a mid marathon. Don't worry, statement. We're fixing it. Statement. <laughs> not yet. In, instead, we just added a video delay. Yeah, let me start up plugging stuff mm, and see how long. Dude, it I, I can't. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's gotta be at least one plug here that'll take it all out, right? Yeah. One single point of failure. Uh, there is it. a single point of failure. It's called the main power. Actually, the UPS might be able to sustain it for a little Dang bit. Dang it! All right, but what if I, what what if about I the unplug it from the UPS? <laughs> yeah, if you unplug it from the UPS, then we're done. <laughs> well, don't yeah, do that, please. Just disconnect United States Internet. Postal Stop. Service, please don't. <laughs> <laughs> Not the USPS, the UPS. <laughs> oh, oops. Yeah, Not the, 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 Not the, the Brown Service. Truck. Is that what it stands for? Uh, UPS? Yeah. Uh, is, United is, par par Parcel Service. Yeah. What does FedEx stand for? FedEx. Federal Ds. Express. FedEx Ds. Oh, I see. Wait, FedEx. FedEx Ds. FedEx. What, what's FedEx Ds? FedEx Ds. No! Donations. Yeah! Yay! What a roller coaster that was! <laughs> Please do not send them in the mail. Please send them electronically. <laughs> <laughs> He was really thinking, I was gonna say nuts. Still <laughs> <laughs> got it in. How's Lineback doing today? Uh, angry. He's, he's having a time. <laughs> he's mad. 
<laughs> Same, dude. <laughs> that's having a time. That, 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 that's me starting the marathon. Da, da, da. Oh, jeez. Oh, 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 man. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, school. Zoinks. Thanks, everybody, for donating to the charity. Speaking wow. of donations. I, I really haven't done Zolathon in a bit. That was so <laughs> stiff. <laughs> Thanks, everyone, for donating to the charity. We have $1.13 from Fun Facts with Sylveon that says, Fun fact, in high school, I was in first, first tech challenge. Hey. We were doing a demo at a middle school of our robots, and I was driving it around, waiting for the kids to come, and managed to knock down several stacks of chairs on the Woo! robot. Oops, see ya. That's an Oops. Let's go first. Oh, you're dead. First. Yeah. First. Yeah, I need to Darn you, several stacks of chairs. First robotics, am I right? Just doesn't even close I'm his having eyes. a hard time <laughs> transitioning with that. Yeah. He gives up. Oh. Just sunbathing. Oh. Yeah. I want to look just up like and me. Talk, He's like, I'm done. Yeah. But it's very <laughs> hard. Yeah. Watch out there, bud. There is a tree. There is a tree. Can we just punch the tree? Are we playing <laughs> Minecraft <laughs> on the back <laughs> 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 Oh my god. Classic shadow, dude. Yeah, finally. <laughs> Do you think I punch trees anymore? Pierce moments. Just oh, Pierce no. moments. <laughs> Pierce moments in history. If you know, you know. If you don't, stay that way. Don't one. ask. Can I do autograph? Cool. Okay. Uh, sorry, I don't We're take fan requests. Now. What do you mean? <laughs> I really like that part. <laughs> and then you walk away. Yeah, we kind of want it. We wanted to be low health here, so you can perish quicker. Yeah, die. Get low. Get low. <laughs> the game that, thanks, Morris. <laughs> so you can perish quicker, so you don't play this game as much. <laughs> but it's fine. We're gonna not die anyway. We're just gonna walk out. Calm the quarter heart. Walk it off. Look at this guy. Hey, hey. Where where's Lineback? Hey, can't believe this guy. What a wise guy he is. What does Pierce sound like? Sounds it like literally sounds like his voice. <laughs> okay, I, 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 I've, 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 I've heard Pierce, but I also don't I know. like remember if there was a like a an inflection. It's There's just an inflection. It's a little higher. It's it's, it's, it's higher. higher. It's a little what, somewhere between like Bronx and Jersey. What would bit. you have to do? What would need to happen for someone to? Get their donation read in Pierce's voice. Fifty dollars. Fifty dollars. <laughs> this man knows his price. You hear? That also, that also gets like a save. cameo. That also gets can't be a save. I know there was oh, no delay true. there either. No, I because I knew where you were going with it, and I was like, I was trying to calculate, and I was like, fifty bucks. Then you have to say that you want it. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna be like you know. Someone who's been scraping their pennies together to donate fifty dollars to the marathon so they get the, the grand prize giveaway. And I was like, ah, I'm so happy that I mean this. <laughs> ten ten from Hypercool that says, Hi. Hi, Hypercool. Hi. Hi. Oh. Uh, it's it's time it's time for me to transition out of this chair. Or is it hyper? Because Castlevania is back. Alright, see you later, Realm Scout. Castlevania. Bye, Realm Scout! Oh, this house is so low. Get low, get low. Get low, get low. To the window! To the wall! To the wall! Welcome back, Ron. Good thing I have a doppelganger. Looks just like me. My favorite fight. What do you mean? You never left. Oh, true. Sorry. Why'd you change your clothes? What the heck? Hey, weren't you wearing a black shirt a minute ago? I'm on the beach. You're on the beach? Beach? <sighs> Alright, so we're out of here. We got out we okay. first Temple of the Ocean King, done. Now we're gonna avoid Beetle. Because no <laughs> one wants to hang out with Beetle right now. I kinda yeah. do. Didn't Didn't realize the it. first boss of this game is Beetle. <laughs> and the final boss. And every other boss. So funny <laughs> enough, this is the fastest form of movement. <laughs> <laughs> <It's funny laughs> <enough. laughs> no way. <laughs> 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 No matter what the Zelda game, there's always got to be something weird about how you move, right? right. You just <laughs> mash this. Like back walk, spam the quick sail, or just hop around in the sea. At least the quick sail is like, oh, I, I, I kind of get it, you see those little bursts, but this is like... I don't think it the is. The physics never would have to saw, begin with. No, I yeah. saw the world record, the former world record holder just constantly do this, so you know, we're gaming. Yeah. Have, they, have they like scratched a hole into the surface of their touch screen, whatever they were using? 
I'm sure that, that's why not. they're the former world record holder because uh, we yeah, used yeah. to working. <laughs> maybe, maybe maybe all of their holes are just there, so then whenever they need to play another run, they just get their stylus in the right spot because the holes already exist. Oh no! <laughs> my 3DS looks like Swiss cheese. Okay, well, I'm far away. I'm from my screen. Where are we going? Into that. Do they make like grill glass for Wii? You do that. Uh, they do make the, the yeah. <laughs> Sorry. The just scratch pad. <laughs> I'm just trying to think of like someone trying to get like a custom like glass job on their <laughs> glass work Dude, on I their Wii U game. Do you, do you know what speedrunners do? I, yeah. I agree. Really oh, question. <laughs> I think my favorite form of like fast movement in the Zelda game is in Twilight Princess. Technically, if you're turning, you move faster. Sure. But it's task only, so. You just watch the Twilight Princess Ash, you're just constantly turning back and forth. Mm -hmm. So Link is just like wiggling really fast. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. I don't know what this guy's story is, and I don't care because you got a weird hair. His name is Kao. And he's dead. He's a girl. Whoa. I'll see you missed. So that's the name of that okay -o. Also, oh, no. shot this, this man. Nope. <laughs> you missed the fact that he said on a graver concern, which is a great joke. Thank you very much. He's dead. <laughs> All right. Well, Mr. Deadman, you suck anyway. I'm out of here. It's true, though. His name's Ko. It's also a pretty good joke. Yeah. He's, yeah. He's, he's, yeah. he's maybe not Okao. Yeah. He's a niche slapper. He is not Okao. <laughs> okay. Uh, there's a lot How many of layers? Is this a scary game? Ow! Now it is. Why did anybody tell me it was a spooky game? Right, so I actually have to like yell into this stupid That's microphone right. Do it. a couple Do it. times Do it. at this, so... Donate to, to pick whatever PG word that can't be <laughs> <laughs> screams into the microphone. Please. Please. He, he was practicing a little bit earlier, and like, yeah, he totally threw me off just we were having a conversation, then he just starts yelling at me. <laughs> <laughs> How, how often do you need to yell into your Wii, Wii U uh, gamepad here? Here? I don't know, man. Couple I mean, like, times? in general, the whole run. Like, oh, a lot? maybe a couple? Like, four times during my Four portion. times? Okay. I feel like we could turn this into a donation. Uh, yeah, all right. Next donation, over $10, I'll yell into the Wii U gamepad, whatever you donate. Wow. Word. And we're Single. not progressing the game until then. I yeah. guess. <laughs> Seven, <laughs> eight, eight, eight. Ten dollars. <laughs> Ten, Ten dollars to keep playing the video. Oh no! It takes me off! Alright, for the next one. The next one, the next one. Okay. Let's see if I remember where everything is. Uh, nope. Alright, it's uh... Mark the locations with the three torch. That one. Uh, that one. And uh... That one. You got it? <laughs> Yay! Yay! Too wow. big, me brain. Hey, you touched the right places. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> me brain not small. <laughs> $25 from Vidya James. That says, can't be save, and also yell fart. Okay, I'll do that <laughs> the next one. Uh, nope. $10 from Soup that says, soup. Uh, soup. We're on a vacation. Sorry, you're too late. Can we, can we shout fart soup? Might as well. Give me out oh, of here. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, nope. What? Can, can I just skip all these calls? Guy, what's up, dude? Confounded. How dare there be story in this video game? Don't you know we're trying to go quick? <gasps> oh, my God. You can see your outline in the magic ball. Whoa. 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 Code 7. <laughs> You, we want to find the ghost ship rat. <laughs> Knowing that, do you still want to rescue her? Yikes. 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 <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Get me out of here, poopy. <laughs> do I Just... plan on saving? Sure. Oh, very nice. Is this... Saved. So, did nice. the Cocoa Pebbles fall down from the sky yet? I think that's this next part. There's just fire cocoa pebbles coming. Okay. So, um, wait, I should go and get that. You should boss. also save. I guess. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> there was, yeah, there wasn't a There was, was, there was a 25. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm saving. Okay, please be a heart. <laughs> All right, now this one will be a one rupee. See, I psyched it out. I needed hearts. <laughs> 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 this is speedrun strat. Mind games. <laughs> 
Get out of here. Okay, thank you. All right. So how many rolls do you have until you puke? I think it's like, if you consecutively do three, you just puke everywhere. So there's gotta be like like basketball, right? Where you like you have to like take like two steps before you have to yeah, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you start throwing the elbows out, looking for your yeah, teammate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and then you complain to the refs. That you must do! <laughs> I didn't travel, but everyone travels in the NBA anymore. <laughs> they call it Euro steps now. It's insane. <laughs> How dare you Euro insult steps, Giannis the this extra way. two steps. <laughs> no, no Euro step. <laughs> they just run to the basket now. They're just like, hello, oh, I took 400 yeah, steps. Yeah. Traveling? That's a thing in the 80s. They wouldn't call traveling on me. I get 29 points a game. And $29 million a game. Yeah. <laughs> Right. We have five dollars from soup that says, "Is melted cheese soup?" Depends how melted. What did I have to yell? How melted is it? Fart, fart soup. Fart soup. Oh, fart soup! The notion killed Blake. <laughs> You know what we should say. <laughs> oh, for oh, two. Oh. 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 There we go. Instead of yelling fart, you just made a fart. Right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> $10 and 20 cents from Kiros that says, Happy Zeldathon. Yes, Can't wow. donate as much as usual as I'm getting ready to go into grad school, but I'll oh, be yes. happily watching all the shenanigan. Oh my. Oh my. Shenaniganery. Shenaniganery. <laughs> That's going to happen Get this week. Okay, where are we going? Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Good luck in grad school. Oh, yeah. Door shut behind me. Oh no. Marissa. Hi. Is lasagna a soup? No. Wait, that Kimmy didn't die. That was insane. Why not? Good job at your job. Cause. Got. You've got a soup base. You've got your tomato. stuff in the soup. Lasagna? Yeah. What's the base? The, the, the tomato sauce. That's I'm, disgusting. Tomato sauce you put is not tomato sauce? I, I think the trouble is the fact that you said sauce ceases yeah. it to be a soup. Yeah, no, <laughs> that's a liquid. Yeah. It's not a base. So it's but, but if it's sauce, then it implies <laughs> that you're putting it on the base of the meal. Yeah. Yeah. Marissa, if you have one Wait, soup, I not get the if you have one soup and then I'm you saying. have another soup and you pour them together. Do you have one or two soups? You have a salad. Oh, you have one bad soup. You have one soup. Oh. If you take a lasagna and another lasagna and you put one on top of the other, how many lasagnas oh, this is do you the have? Puzzle. One oh. lasagna? There you go, it's the same thing. No! Oh, you can't say that just because <laughs> two things have one thing in common that they're the same. Pass! Oh no, there you go. <laughs> I'm sort of just thinking about trying to drink like nacho cheese. That's. I've seen a okay, kid. Okay, okay. I've but, seen a kid do that in high school. What about a but, beer cheese? I was gonna soup? say we're playing out here, but I, there are actual cheese soups. There's broccoli cheese soup, which is mostly Very good. cheese with some broccoli in it. You're, you're, so you got the Wisconsin going. Yeah, and then, yeah, yeah, you got, you got we, we got Wisconsin on the donation mic, and the Wisconsin over here. Yeah. We we're gonna we're gonna come up against you here. We got beer cheese soup. Yeah, That's a real soup. And it's beer and it's cheese. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> is it a beer? It. Is it a cheese or is it a soup? It's everything. Or is it beer? I, can... I have a question for you, Jamie. I hope. Okay. If you have a soup uh -huh. and a chowder uh -huh. and you mix it together, what is it? Well, how is a chowder different from soup? A chowder is. Uh, like a thicker, creamier. Bake. That took so much longer, but I was just wondering. Is it a to... soup or a chowder after that? I think I think you're just telling me that chowder is just another soup. What white chowder, red chowder? I think you're telling me that chowder is just lasagna. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> All will become lasagna as we do. That's like the worst Sorry. logic I've ever heard. <laughs> you stack them on top of each other to one lasagna, and therefore it's soup. <laughs> Cr cream of mushroom and stuff like that. I think <laughs> that make an appearance no too. Sense. Cream of celery. What a tragedy. Cream thing. of that's a thing. Yeah. Celery. That oh. sounds disgusting. Yeah, no, it's a tragedy. <laughs> <laughs> stew is a soup. Stew is stew. Stew pickles. Mm. All right. 
I can't believe we're only like a few hours into the marathon. We're already here. We're into <laughs> it's, it's not even the marathon. Yeah, we're here soup. on the first temple day. It's not even it's graveyard. Gorgeous. It's like it, 10 o'clock. It, it's because you got the, the 4 a.m. guy to do a game. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> Get me out of here. Hey! Hey! Calm hey. down, homie. Oh, wait, I was supposed to do that thing. There we go. Here, check this out. Yeah, ne neither of us even like exists before 3 a.m. Usually, I don't think. Scrooge, Scrooge. You just cease to be. God, you're like really this good. weird reverse Cinderella thing. <laughs> <laughs> They're a pumpkin until 3 a.m. We have nine dollars and twenty cents from Argitlam that says Jess got back from my sister's house, where I had dinner with her and her husband. Then we watched some of Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. I realized that in my nearly 37 years, I've never watched the first 40 minutes of that movie. To be fair, of the of that movie, the first 40 minutes are decidedly not the Chocolate Factory. Really? So I get it. It's just him getting to and, the and was it factory. Charlie in the Chocolate Factory or Willy Wonka in the Chocolate Factory? They, they're two very different movies they're there. They're different. Okay, so I need to go back One of them sure. is... One of them's good. One of them? I'm not yeah. gonna go there. <laughs> One of them's bad, one of them's good. <laughs> Both of them feature grandparents that really should just go get jobs. <laughs> get a job. Ooh. Get a job. You, they can, they can totally walk. Never retire? Yes. Wow. Because I'm never going to be able to retire. <laughs> if I can't retire, then neither can they. Yeah. Brilliant logic, you boomers. <laughs> hey. They. <laughs> the the fact that Grandpa home. Joe. Besides sit in that bed until the day that that chocolate factory uh, ticket comes in, he's like, <laughs> you know what? Yeah, actually, I can walk. Go figure. I got it. I can dance. dance. I can dance. I can fly. Only when he's incentivized does he get out of bed. All right, in this essay, I will. <laughs> in this eight-page, three-hour YouTube video. Mike just walked away with the backdrop. Yeah, she's wearing the backdrop as a blanket. <laughs> I was like, Come on. that's the kind of power I want to have one day. <laughs> Maybe. Well, it, it, yeah, it's true. In the, in the modern in the version, one, Grandpa yeah, Joe got laid, laid off. off. The old one, mysterious Because of automation. Yeah. Robots take your dog. Which means that in the new one, they recognized that it was a plot hole. <laughs> I think in the novel they just were bedridden for the They're entire time. By Ronald Ball. Yeah, by Ronald Ball. Not Ronald. Not, not Ronald. Just Ronald. No, 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 it's Ronald. That's his cousin, Roll. Uh, uh, he made BFG. BFG. BFG stand for it. Big freaking giant dude. <laughs> We have $5 from Real Colors that says, hey everyone, sadly can't donate as much this marathon, but I'm always so happy when you guys are around. Since there's so much chaos, there's a certain question that I'm dying to hear your opinion on. Is cheese a sauce? Thank you. Yeah. It can be. Can if be. it's melted if enough, If it's probably. melted, it's a sauce. Okay, but what if you take nachos? Yeah. Like, you know, just whatever. Do you have nachos? Chips, tortilla chips. And okay. you put shredded cheese on top. Yeah. Is and it then, lasagna? And then... <laughs> <laughs> is it then a soup? It is neither a soup nor lasagna. Nor a sauce. It has layers. Yeah. Yeah, nachos could be kind of lasagna-y, right? You, like, you could absolutely make a lasagna out of nachos, and now I want to do it. <laughs> I really want to lasagnas. I would. Yeah. I, I I would accept that more than I would accept lasagna as a soup. I 100% want to make nacho nacho lasagna. I think you could do it. <laughs> oh, it's this puzzle. This sounds like the ideal like Midwestern menu. Absolutely. Mm. <laughs> nacho lasagna. <laughs> this is gonna be my new specialty. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. What a good game. <laughs> Poop! <laughs> I can't like how it just turned into saying the word and then blowing. I gotta make that $25 matter. $5 yeah. from soup. When does melted cheese stop being a sauce and start being a soup? <laughs> oh, that's an excellent question. You gotta measure the viscosity, man. <laughs> I would say, but even then, though, right? Like, I've had some pretty thick 
cheese sauces, but also some pretty thick cheese soups. I've also had some very thin cheese sauces. It's true. Yeah. There's a place, yeah, that I, I, I love going to, but their beer cheese, like, sauce, you can tell they just took nacho cheese and poured beer into it. <laughs> and it doesn't uh, work. Oh yeah, wasn't there a place good. we went where I got beer cheese soup, uh, yeah. but it like retained its shape when yeah. you turn the bowl? That was at, at the at the, the yeah, Milwaukee yeah. airport. And I'm gonna, gonna gonna throw you in down Whoa. under the bus apparently. Um, they Dude. definitely used the cheese sauce from another meal and turned it into a soup. They just put it in a bowl and served it. And you know what? I ate the whole bowl. Yeah, I also ate it. <laughs> As a proud Wisconsinite. <laughs> not gonna leave my. I'm not, I'm not gonna leave a single trace of that cheese. <laughs> <laughs> I slurped that up with my special cheese spoon, which all Wisconsinites carry. Yes. Mm -hmm. Driving through Wisconsin was a trip because, like, every gas station had the classic fridge right at the front. Yeah. It had Wisconsin cheese and meat stick. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> it was always, it was oh, always I, dear. Yeah, I, I have <laughs> I wonder what Gannon's up Same to. thing with the airport. It, like you can go, like as you're t taking off, there are three things you can purchase at every st every like gift store, in, 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 like from a Wisconsin airport, which is cheese, meat, and then beer. They'll, <laughs> like they'll have like 12 packs of, of local craft beers that you can just load up in your, I guess in your backpack and try to hide it through, uh, <laughs> like as you put it on a carry-on. Classic. As long as you are already through security. Doesn't matter. Cause, no, the, the trick is you're not supposed to bring that sort of stuff on the plane. So you have to hide it. What? And then part of the instructions is that you cannot you cannot let the, the flight attendant see you have this. So yeah, I was gonna oh say, so gosh. you're like encouraging you to sneak this onto the plane. Yes, okay. absolutely. <laughs> Wisconsin wouldn't have it any other way. No. <laughs> Five dollars from AV Regarianus that says, is lasagna a sandwich? Alright, so if you, put two, a if you put a lasagna on top of a lasagna, is it just yeah, a is it, lasagna? <laughs> if you put a sandwich on a sandwich, is it one or two? I'm gonna argue that it's not a sandwich. Okay, depends how many Hold pieces seat. of bread you have. Bread. And like, I was gonna say, the pot, like the I've, pasta itself, right? I've Where, seen sandwiches yeah, the pasta with like is the bread, bread on the it? inside. Where does the yeah. layer, like, yeah, if, if the layer of, layers of pasta have to be on the top and the bottom of the sandwich, or of the, this like lasagna sandwich, okay, then I think yes. this boss has like, is horny, and we have to count the number of hornies. I can't remember. I oh, the, the number of it, what? Uh, could you say that again? Hornies. Much louder though? It's hornies. The hornies. Things hornies. Like yeah. the devil's head, they're hornies. Hornies. We have to count those. Dude, this is this is an awful game. <laughs> <laughs> Real, realistic, realistic carrying key physics. That, this game's awful. That, that, key, that key weighs as much as a megaton hammer. I know in this game, the you, you go way faster if you keep throwing the key in front yeah. of you. So in Spirit Tracks, they made it so that the key doesn't you can't throw it. It just like drops, drops. to the ground. Uh, wow. Because that was the, that, that was the problem with this yeah. game. Yeah. <laughs> That's oh, when you did the too fast. <laughs> They're beating this game too quickly. <laughs> oh, picnic basket. Oh, here we go. Are we? Oh, is the stream dead? down? Stream Are we dead? Uh -oh. dead. Uh oh. Okay, good. That wasn't just me. Did we break the mark? We broke uh, Kinsu. <clears throat> okay, I'm going. We will. We will. All right, I gotta look at this little map because it's the the way to beat this boss is you gotta look at their horns. Blaze. Blaze the cat. Frames down. We are down in some frames. Reset the world. Oh, see it. Uh, it wasn't me. No one wanted to see this boss anyway. No one wants to see this game anyway, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone wanted to see Broken Play it. No. I can't believe they had just this exact boss fight spirit track. <laughs> Unbelievable. Are you that surprised though? <laughs> Hold, we are dropping frames. Oh, okay. no kidding. Pause. Pause, yeah. But up, up. We're back. Are we still? 
All right. Okay. Yay. Yay. I'm trying. Yeah. Return. The horny fight. Let's go, baby. If you can hey. hear us, type avocado in chat. Do it again. I didn't see it. We did it. Oh, I'd much rather talk about avocados than like <laughs> chugging cheese. For <laughs> All right, let's talk about avocados. By the way. Avocados lasagna. <laughs> oh, stop. <laughs> Onyx and Roman donates $20. It says, okay, but if onions have layers too, does that make it a soup sandwich or sauce? I mean, it's a soup already, French onion. Or a lasagna. Yeah. It's a, it can be a it sauce. Can be a it can be a sauce. It can be a sandwich. You, you can have two aioli. ends. I mean, literally. You, what, yeah, you can make an onion sandwich. Uh, very easy. Yeah. And then it already does that. Put a whole freaking slice of onion in right in there. So then all you need to go, do is get aioli and put it in French onion soup. Aioli. And is, aioli you have everything. Then you have everything. You've you completed you, the ultimate food. There you go. You're welcome. <laughs> you, you have won. Sure Urgent Lamb donates $9.99. That says, seriously, though. Apparently, in those first 40 minutes, there is a straight-up police procedural that we only see for, like, three minutes. I want to see the movie about the guys who kidnapped a dude to try to ransom him for a box of Wonka bars. I think, yeah, that was in the old one, right? Yeah, yeah and the, the old one, there are a lot of little vignettes of, little, of yeah. like, very strange jokes that they want to pull off, <laughs> but don't feel like elaborating on. Classic. Like Five dollars. Oh, go ahead. There's a I was say, like, building an entire oh. artificial oh, intelligence to try to figure out where the, the uh, golden ticket's going to be. That. That's too fair. And the AI responds with, why would I need it? I can't eat chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> and that, that's it. The, no, the, the, the AI machine that is smart enough to make a joke does not, does not come up with the rest of the, the entire tale. Yeah. That's all you need. The volcano has stopped. Five dollars for my late corn dogs. That says, on the topic of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, did you know there's a sequel book featuring a yes. space hotel, shape-shifting aliens, the President of the United States, and youth candy? Sick. It's called Charlie and the Great Glass Elevator. And oh, wow. it was yeah. very bizarre. Of the plot is a trip. I, I read the entire huh. Roll Doll anthology when I was in school. A lot of weird ones. Yeah. Same. And last but not least, five dollars from Soup that says, "Who um, spilt soup on the UPS?" <laughs> it was me. <laughs> it was me. <laughs> I spilled my lasagna. I admit it. I got a little too curious. So since we're caught up on donations, reminder: every twenty-five dollar donation forces me to save, which is so important. So please keep donating. Yeah, you guys. Um, yeah. You want to see also, this game eventually beat, right? What's up? You want to get that? Oh yeah, we'll get that in a second. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Um, also, you get put into a bunch of amazing oh, prize packs. So, who wants to talk about our prizes that we have? What? The amounts and all that stuff you have to donate. Who, who, who on couches? Who's got a good uh, grasp? Mercy, you actually, you, you've got the buttons there, right? Uh, there yeah, I got the, I got, I got the buttons. Should we look at prize block one? Let's look at block oh, one first. Really, that's what this one is. Welcome to prize block, block, block one. one. I should read what goes with <laughs> this. Oh my gosh. So it doesn't talk about prize block one. Uh, Twenty dollars or more between now and three fifty nine p.m. U.S. Eastern time tomorrow. Uh, you got just got to donate twenty dollars or more throughout that time, uh, and it could be cumulative, 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 cumulative. cumulative clouds. Uh, you can as long as you get twenty dollars in there at some point, uh, you get entered to win all these fabulous prizes that you see on the screen there. Yes, everything on that screen. And fifty dollars or more throughout the entire marathon gets you a chance to win everything on the screen here, including a Nintendo Switch OLED, Skyward Sword HD, a Megaton Hammer by Heroic Replicas, LED neon sign, and more. Look at all those things yeah. on your screen right now. There's so many things. Fifty dollars or more gets you a chance to win all that. That's it. Woohoo! Woo! Woo! That Megaton hammer? Heavy. Megaton <laughs> hammer. Yeah, like. That switch? Not that I heavy. I so desperately want to use that hammer to smash something. Yeah. <laughs> Me too, it's so. Like, <laughs> it's heavy. But the trouble is, that's the, that's the one. That's the grand prize. It's not just a replica of the grand prize, it is the grand prize. And so if I take it and I smash a bunch of fruit with it and I chip it a little bit, it's not a good grand prize anymore. And also Monica will be mad at me, so I can't. Monica will be mad at you. Let's just get a, a real hammer and let you smash him with that. 
This is what it would be almost like. You could probably <laughs> smash well, a normal hammer with the Megaton hammer, <laughs> honestly. Could. True. <laughs> Again, for realsies, weighs 36 pounds. And most of it is in, like, the base. Yeah, and it's just in this, it's on the front of that hammer, like, I guess what the Megaton hammer would actually be. It is dangerous to wield. The, uh, the center of gravity is definitely... Interesting. On anyway, that. regardless, fifty dollars, and you, the owner can be you. Yeah. You will have to sign a release. You, you can figure out how to use this thing correctly. You also no. get the neon sign, and we are not going to ship them in the same box. Mm -hmm. Or else yeah. you'd get a lovely no, collection of neon glass. We got no money to sign Everything's in the same box. <laughs> we're, 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 we're <laughs> Yeah, no money here. <laughs> you, you are going to get a, uh, a potato sack with all of the prizes in it. Good luck. No, we're shooting out of a cannon. Oh. Right at your house. All of it together. Put it in the stratosphere. <laughs> that Megaton hammer would go straight through the roof. I, I want to yeah. see a drone try to carry that thing to a house. No, that's like nine drones at minimum. <laughs> that's a helicopter has to pick that up, not a drone. <laughs> oh, yeah, the Nintendo Switch OLED would be in there, too. That's not... Uh... Oh, no, it's good, the OLED. Like, oh no. Oh no, OLED. Oh, what, is that what OLED stands for? Oh no, LED. Oh, 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 no. LED. <laughs> oh no. That's what that's what everyone's saying now with their pipes. Like, oh no, LED. Oh no, LED. <laughs> that's, that's... We get a one million dollar single donation, I'll smash the OLED with the pink <laughs> You know what? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I will back that up. A single million dollar donation we'll abs you know what? If we hit a million dollars during this marathon. No, if we got a half a million dollar donor, I'll smash the OLED. <laughs> cool beans. MC? Just devalue the entire prize pack for the cheap price of a million I mean, I'll dollars. go to Best Buy and get what a new deal? OLED. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. For, for a million dollars? Heck yeah. If, if, you, if your uncle's name is Jeff Bezos, uh, and you have a favor to call. Uncle Jeff, come on. <laughs> come on, Uncle <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> Let's go, Uncle Jeff. <laughs> it's time for some fun. Uh-oh. Fun? Uh, oh, I hate fun. fun. I hate though, because fun. I'm with my friends. That's Aww. cool. All right. Oh. <laughs> um, so, everyone home, we have a little bit of an incentive for you. <laughs> if you make a donation of $10, $10, oh, wait, no, that's so dumb. $8, $8. That makes a lot more sense. sense. Sure. Um, we will. Uh, when you make your donation of eight dollars, ask us in the comment some, some something that you need some guidance on, and we will give you the wisdom of the almighty magic eight ball, live on stream. Is that an analog eight ball or a digital eight it ball? It is an analog one. Oh, wow. that cannot predict now. That's how you. <laughs> that know was it's a real. freebie, by the yeah. way. That was your one freebie. MC, can I get a freebie? Okay, yes, one, one freebie, okay. and then, then everything else is $8 for everybody home and y'all. Will my wedding in October go well? Oh, God. Oh. 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 Will the wedding in October Why did you go make well? Free... Concentrate and ask again. <laughs> oh. Oh. Even the eight right, wants you to donate. Again. Yeah, well, you know, you gotta donate. You gotta focus on what you gotta do. Oh, no. Do you have another ring ready? Uh. Do, you have, do you have another $8 to ask again? Oh, no. Can't be, I'd like to... But pull your attention to this wonderful chat message that says, crack it open and drink the prediction juice. <laughs> <laughs> For a single $150,000 donation, I will drink the prediction juice. I will drink juice. the eight ball. <laughs> you know, it's probably not toxic because it's meant for children. <laughs> I don't know about that one. The box? It's over in, in, in that box. Okay. Oh, really? That's what I said. It's not toxic. Is Hold a on. child capable of actually breaking that? No, no, I need to know this when I ask <laughs> well, Google out loud. We have Hold an on. easy way of breaking it. We got the hammer. Well, we, we have an easy oh way of breaking it. Oh my god, can you like, drink an eight ball? A kid I'm that also like, throwing around around a magic eight ball. You didn't this have is, a megaton this hammer? This is how you become a cycle. If you drink the blue liquid from a magic eight ball, uh, let's see here. The liquid contains isopropyl alcohol <laughs> and alkaline oh, 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 oh. colorant oh, dye. Yeah, that's that's probably not the best. At idea. least like the old one. You need to do. share it. Hundred and fifty right. million dollars. Yeah, I was gonna say. What, what and they gave this money, thing to please. kids. <laughs> This could have dire consequences as vomiting blue vomit or worse. Why are you blue? Why are you blue? Why are you blue? Uh, I think we have some, some things in Marissa. Yeah, we do well, have some donations. That's it. We have $20 from Seanzilla that says, rat on a boat, smiley face. Is that the question? Wait, wait, how, wait how much was that? $20. Rat on a stick. 
Okay, that's not a prediction. That's, that's not a that's not a question for the eight ball. Just oh. add a question mark onto it. Also, eight dollars or more. So so you can you can you, you can you can you can spend some money if you want. <laughs> Fifty dollars from Kinru. That uh, no comment. Save the game. Thank you. Oh Ooh. heck yeah. Let's go. Baby. Eight dollars from Casey Happy. That's that so says, funny. should Jiggy shave his mustache? Ooh. Should Ooh. Jiggy shave my mustache? Oh, that's a great ball. As I see it, yes. Eight dollars from Video James. This says, "Oh, Magic Eight Ball, I'm having some trouble with a cross, a close friend." Thank you. Okay. Can you please tell me if lasagna is a soup? Is lasagna a soup? Help me. Is, is lasagna, lasagna a soup? Soup. That look good. In your oh. face. Oh. Oh. All right. Yeah. We'll, 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 we'll be your your hype ballers here. Okay. We have we have one more. From soup, eight dollars. That oh. says, should we drink the eight ball? Should, should we drink, drink the eight ball? ball? Oh, please don't say that. Ask yes. again later. <laughs> <laughs> so maybe is what I'm hearing. See, the eight ball wants to get used a couple more times. Yeah, before yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we can't. You gotta use up the magic first. <laughs> yeah. Hold on to your butts. Please. Oh, Ooh, that's butts. a save. That is a save. Yeah, that is a save. Oh. Eight dollars. Oh, well, just save. <laughs> yeah, we're at eight in the train. Woohoo! Eight dollars from Nemenya that says, "Dear oh. Magic Eight Ball, will I ever be promoted from moderator to cast member of Zeldathon? Will, will you ever be promoted, promoted from moderator, moderator to cast, cast member of Zeldathon? Come on, cannot predict now. So true. So true. So true. So many. Thank you for your service. Eight Ball has not been wrong yet. Yeah. Magic. Salute the mods, friends. Salute the mods. Twenty-five ninety-three from Umrag T. Burn. <laughs> that says, "Hey, Magic Eight Ball. I'm now a little scared to ask this, but will my wedding in the next couple years go well? Will, will your wedding in the next, next couple, couple years, years go well? well? Cannot predict now. <laughs> wow. What are in Why this size of eight ball? I the money eight bag. Balls. This is so eight ball doesn't, doesn't want to. It doesn't want to. Doesn't want to get involved, want to get involved with other this, people's yeah. relationships. This eight ball knows it's being recorded. Yeah. <laughs> this eight ball's like, uh, show, throw me a softball. <laughs> Just throw me a soft eight ball. Good luck figuring how to condense this one. It's a little long. All right, we won't. Eight dollars from Av or Garanus that says. Oh, Magic 8-Ball, thanks to your wisdom last marathon, I won the legendary Waffle Crisp. Should I open the box and eat the delicious cereal, or should I preserve this signed piece of history in its original state for as long as entropy should will allow? Okay, so the question is, should I eat the cereal first? Yeah. Let's go with that. Should, should I eat, eat the cereal? The point is he tried <laughs> Reply Hazy. Do you know how to use that? Oh my god. Try, try again. Try it. Like, oh, let's, let's, let's see. Another, I think we, I think we need to go another round. Another round. Another round. Another round. Another round. Another round. Okay, okay. We are going to try again. Yeah. Should we eat the cereal? <laughs> my sources say no. Okay. Oh. You got to maintain Entropy. it. So, Entropy. Entropy. It is preserved as history forever. What are your sources? Why are you blue? Why are you blue? Why are you blue? <laughs> why are you blue? <laughs> <laughs> this is like this. This was this me, me and Campy saw his magic eight ball on Target. And we were like, yes, charity. Some, some of the best. <laughs> yeah, some of the best. Nine dollars and fifty cents from washable markers that just says, please don't drink the eight ball. Please, please don't, don't drink, drink the eight ball. <laughs> Dog. How did he do yes, that? definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is, is that an agreement? <laughs> 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 is he don't drink me. Please don't. What's up, Phantom? <laughs> Doesn't he have the key? Yeah, you gotta dunk him, right? No, I just have to hit him. Send with him the yeah, yeah, I, I just heard it, I heard it fall. Like yeah, that. I hit him like four times before I fell. Take that. <laughs> Eight dollars from Burn, presumably the character from uh, Spirit Tracks. Mm -hmm. That says, "Oh, Magic Eight Ball, will I ever oh, appear in another game?" Who said that? 
Burn. Oh, bro. 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 I can just answer. No. <laughs> That's definitely wild. Oh, oh, Breath of the Wild, baby. too. Come on. All right, burn for Smash. Burn, burn for Smash. Eight dollars from Abra that says, "Will I regret eating at Fridays?" Will I regret eating, eating, eating at Fridays? It is decidedly so. <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, I mean, my dish was thirty bucks. Well, yeah. an appetizer, Fridays? appetizer, and Fridays? a pasta. Oh, okay. So you got the app, yeah. the app, oh, yeah. and the pasta. The, okay. okay. the appetizer as much as the the entrees. Yeah. Well, then they probably got a drink. Yeah. Which is like a hundred billion dollars. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, the questions are pouring in. Oh, let's, let's, let's keep it going. Let's keep yeah, it going. We're about to five thousand dollars for, do it. for Yo, the, the, direct relief. Direct. Woo, Eight dollars from Sophia that says, "I want to ask the stereotypical question of, will I be unsinglefied at the end of 2022? Will you be unsinglefied at the end of 2022?" <laughs> Cannot predict now. Oh. Oh. You know what this means? Once again, it doesn't want to get in the way of love. It just means you need to ask at the next Zelda-thon. Which is at the end of 20. That's what I'm saying. Oh, but they have, to do it, they have to do it day one. Just another $8 can get you another prediction on it. I mean, no one's stopping yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can ask question. again later. You can just keep Ball asking. Ball knows. 6191 from Riot Tarablo. Woo. This wow. is not a question. It's just a statement. That says from makeshift artisan and myself. Love to see Campy MC and the rest. From oh, makeshift artisan and the rest. Love to see you guys and the rest. rest. Without yes. a doubt. Oh. 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 I miss you guys as well. I haven't streamed. I'm Thank sorry. You so much. Campy stream. I miss your streams. I when we having that taco party? Are you one of the taco 23 parties. offline subs? Someone. Yes. <laughs> Okay, we have, we have a donation that's $16 with two questions. Ooh, that, okay, let's do one at a time. That's good, okay. First yeah, question, save, save the should I eat the entire tub of poutine? Should I eat the entire tub of poutine? <laughs> <laughs> Cannot predict now. Oh. If not, how about just the cheese? Should you eat just, just the cheese? <laughs> Ask again later. What? Man, it's this is all crazy. crazy. We're, we're going to leave that person hovering over a, a, like a tub of poutine, and they're not going to know what to do with it. I mean, has the ape all ever had poutine before? <laughs> has it ever had just the cheese? Have you ever had poutine? <laughs> <laughs> Cannot predict that. Okay, so at the end of the night, we have to have that ape ball submerged in a can of poutine. Let's see how it does. A can of poutine. No, a tub. Ah! A, can. a bathtub. A ladle. Whoever has a spare bathtub, a lot of stuff's going in tonight. <laughs> Guys, we just hit 5K! Let's go! Thank you, Matthew Apple. How much does the Apple cost? All around the world. Oh my goodness. Uh, I, I do not remember how much this 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 Apple <laughs> cost. Gaming. How much did you cost? How much did you cost? Okay, that's all yes, no boys. <laughs> As if, I see it, yes. What if, what if it said like $7.99 yes, USD? <laughs> $5. It's like, what? Hold on. $8 from Nemenya that says, Will Zeldathon Daybreak be amazing? Will, Will Zeldathon Daybreak, Daybreak be amazing? Be amazing? Please, please, please. Oh, look, not so good. Oh, no! <laughs> well, it's time to spike the well. beer. You know? oh, oh, no. Time to just shut it down. Let's get out MC, of here. MC, you better re roll a no here. <laughs> Can we get someone in chat to re roll that no, one? Just re roll it, please. I'm going to spike the screen. Oh. Setup. $8 from soup that says, Oh, Magic Eight Ball, is cereal a soup? Is cereal a soup? It is certain. Whoa! Oh. That's the most sure. The Magic you know, the Eight Ball's question wow. seems to be actually getting answers out it's of it. Except if it is, if, if, if the ball is in poutine. <laughs> so this thing really likes to have opinions on what types of foods are soups, sandwiches, stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess this is where just, we get our answers. Just like, well, no chance. Just no like problem. all of us. Just like all of us. <laughs> It just wants to deal in technicalities. <laughs> not not matters of the heart. Marissa. Yeah. What we got? $8 from Sonic and Ribbon that says, Oh, Magic 8-Ball, will I ever find my special someone in my life? 
Ask me my best buddy. Will we ever find a special someone in your life? Please don't be a bummer, dude. Bummer. <laughs> Cannot predict now. The A cop is not participating in love questions, apparently. Do they have like a love edition in the store or something? Like, can we can we get a new one for those questions? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, uh, it'll, it'll be here tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Are we just paint? We're gonna paint that one pink. Please don't reveal my production secrets. <laughs> <laughs> well, also cost three more dollars. It's this Five dollars. One. Eight dollars from Foxborn that says, "Ask, can you predict now?" Can, can you predict, predict now? now? We don't know what it's asking. Yes, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> it's ready right. now. Ask right. your question now. now. That's, that's it's ready, okay. Okay, we have $8 line. from Legos Jedi that says, Oh, Grand Magic 8-Ball, predictor of the predictions, foreseer of things to be foreseen. Lend us your powers and satiate our desire for knowledge once and for all. Is a Boom. hot dog a sandwich? Is a hot dog a sandwich? Yes, most definitely. It is certain. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Yes. Yes. It just loves vanity. food questions. That was like the food yeah. question. That was, that was no love. It was ready for that one. Yes. Yeah. Oh no, I don't have enough for the bomb. Oh, I kill some homies. oh. oh no, not the homies. Not the homies. Lay we have on. another double up question, a sixteen right. dollarino. That says, Mr. Eight Ball, will Zelda Van Daybreak be incredible? Will, will Zelda Van Daybreak be incredible? Be incredible? It is stuck between two right now, and yeah, it, it's cocked. Throw it, give it another spin. It's cocked. Reply, Hazy, try again. No, oh. that's better than no. Yeah, yeah that, that, that is a new thing. You know, as you guys keep donating, the it does seem part... to be slowly getting better in the response. Yeah, the second part is: Are you particularly lazy today and cannot determine answers and must come back another day for better answers? Are you particularly lazy today? Hey, you're not supposed to do that, Lane. Ask time. again later. <laughs> 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 this is the most fun I've ever had with a magic. $40 from Spirit of Water oh, Montaru. That says, Oh, Magic 8 Ball, right, will I be hydrated? Oh. Will you be hydrated? Bro, please let Reply, me. Hazy, try it again. It's hazy because of all the water and water and water water. Just, water just get some water. Hazy because of all the isopropyl just do it alcohol yourself. I just drank. <laughs> <laughs> Take this, the I'll be back in a moment. Hazy. All right, keep it going. All right, $8 from Nightmare117 that says, Magic 8 Ball, will I, a, will I be able to acquire a massive dice bag to support my crippling dice addiction before the year is over? <laughs> will you be able to acquire Pretty good. My reply is no. Oh, oh no dice oh. for you. It's, no yeah, dice. It is no right. dice. Wow. Well, no dice or no addiction? Both. Both. <laughs> no dice, that's a thing. Anyway, 1988. This is not a question, it is just a statement from Abyssal Hawk that says. Let the tradition continue. I've played this sound in every Zoldathon since I started. Won't stop now. Kill you, yeah. Chad! Thank you, Abyssal. I'm not a No, I'm too much of a gamer. Hitting the Coco Pebbles. Hit Burke. Okay, this is the most important part of the run for me because I always, for some reason, forget the most important item I need is the shovel. So once we do this, I have to go get the shovel. If I don't get the shovel, we're wasting time. Mm -hmm. Should we ask some Magic 8-Ball if he'll forget it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, okay. Ask so, those Magic 8-Ball. Just ask her. I, a freebie from me. All right, all right. Freebie. No, freebie. Will no, Campy remember, remember the shovel? shovel? Yeah. Very doubtful. Oh, Ooh, you're going to get it. it. Bro, we haven't so even much. gotten that answer yet on any of these. Yeah. 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 Hello, 8-Ball song. So, 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 hey. Now you got some motivation. Eight dollars. Eight ball wrong. From Soup. That says, oh, Magic 8-Ball, are you yourself Soup? Are you so? Cannot predict now. Well, it's pretty good. It really does not like answering questions about itself. Because it doesn't know whether we're going to drink it or not. Yeah. It's concerned. It's looking out for number one. In case it is an obvious by the way. Number eight. Number eight. Number eight. 
Uh, just be in case it isn't clear, friends. Uh, every or if you donate eight dollars, we'll consult the arcane mystic art of a magic eight ball here to find out the answers to your most pressing questions. Like this one from Ellipses. Or eight dollars says... or more. Sorry. Continue. Or more. No, eight dollars or more. Get out of here. Eighty dollars oh, would make it work it extra good. <laughs> <laughs> Please, Mr. Magic, Magic Mr. 8-Ball, this poutine looks so good. There's like bacon and stuff in it. I'm sweating so much just looking at it. Can I please just have a taste? Can, Can I please, please just have a taste? Please, bro. Very doubtful. 8-Ball oh. <laughs> does not want you to eat it. Nope. I think the 8-Ball eight eight is not a fan of poutine. It, it's already like midnight or something, like close, right? So P it's probably just looking out for him. Yeah. Mm. Please tweet us a photo of you with your poutine that you cannot eat. <laughs> you're, you're a sad photo of poutine. <laughs> so sad. And we're gonna retweet it. Don't put any text with it. We'll retweet it without without any additional context. <laughs> just poutine. $8 from Princess Neko Cakes that says, Oh, magnificent oh, magic sure. eight ball. Does pineapple belong on pizza? Does pineapple belong on pizza? Yes. Signs point to yes. Okay. So true. true. Oh, true. Right. All right, all right, okay. I had pineapple on An pizza eight, tonight. An eight ball of hey. fine taste. Mm. $8 from Six Alona. I had to approve this one. That says, oh great eight ball, here's a spicy question. Ooh. Will Leafy Cat Sprigatito evolve and be bipedal? The world must know. Oh. <laughs> Will, Will Leafy Cat Sprigatito evolve and be bipedal? bipedal. The world must know. Bipedal. Let me know. Ask again later. It doesn't Ooh, maybe, matter. Maybe, maybe, maybe after nine o'clock. Pokemon this Company won't no tell it. But Magic Eight Ball does not work at Pokemon Company. <laughs> Ew. No, Magic yeah, Pokemon Company knows their cool. lawyers. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> ch ch check the who made this. The Magic Eight Ball was given a cease and desist. No. We've never done this before. This is this is original. Why haven't we done Not this? An original eight ball. They only no, made it's both MC and I were smart or smart. Just take, just take I don't want to take credit. I'm playing Phantom Hourglass. <laughs> You're right. We we take away your credit. You take it away. <laughs> But now you're having yeah. fun playing Phantom Hourglass. Yeah, and, and you remembered the shovel. I did not remember. I have to go and get the shovel stuff. Dang it! Dayball is right again! I still have to go get the shovel. We need more donations, friends. The 8-Ball is waiting, and man, it works by the hour, and it is costly. Hey, I get lost. Hurry, Rat! Could you imagine Do we have any questions right now? Not right it? now, nope. I do wow. have some foil spins, though. Ask again later. And then <laughs> you just keep putting it in like it's a slot machine. <laughs> I didn't realize we were doing gold wheel spins this marathon. I didn't either, so I was like, I, I piled up a couple of them, like, Ooh, I'm not that's sure. That's a save. I don't think we actually added any new ones. Yeah, you know what? You're, you got a bank. I got a it's bank. It's been revamped a lot. It's also been years since we've had, like, a big couch it's like been this. Years. So. Okay. Let's do one. We have sure. three. A couple years. All right. You convinced me. Oh, one of them's really good. people. People want that classical Zeldathon experience right now. So you gotta give it to them. Like, I want say, the classical. Hello! Experience. Hello! Oh! What happened? Why did Hello! they all run to the same corner of the room? I can't run. I got not attached to a gamepad. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> See, they're enjoying that it. That was hilarious. All right, we got some questions for the Zeldathon. ball. All right, MC. Time to go back to the original this place. Is where you want to go. All right, there we go. Got Alrighty. the full experience now. Ready, MC? I didn't seem like you're Forty-two dollars from Abyssal Hawk that says "Dear," or no, it doesn't say "Dear." It just says "Magic Eight Ball." Is forty-two truly the answer? It is is forty-two truly the answer? You may rely on it. Okay. All right. All right. All right. There you go. That's a new one. That's not one, explicitly so. a yes. Yeah, it's not a no. Yeah. But it, 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 you, you can, gives it gives it if it makes your heart sing. It, 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 it felt it. like there's some conviction behind it. Though, yeah. You know? Yeah. Is, is my friend soaring here? Well, I guess I am, MC. Hello. Um, I would like to entrust with you this magic eight ball, if you would be so kind as to. Take my seat and consult it. Take good care of it. Thank you. Thank you. 
Don't, don't drink it. Though. High Priest MC had yet. to give it up, but high don't priest. worry, his, his highest acolyte is ready for us. We, we, we know a few facts about the 8-Ball. It really likes food questions, unless it involves poutine. It and does not like uh, question, no personal questions about it doesn't, doesn't it, give it, pen, it cannot give you answers romance. about love. It might at some point, but today is not, not that today. Special. And it, it does not associate with Pokemon Company International. Yeah, that's <laughs> we what have, we know uh, so far. 1010 from Roxy Gen 1990 that has two questions in it, but Magic 8 Ball works by uh, the hour, so we're gonna do the first one. Dear Magic 8 Ball, will I win the lottery? Will, will we win the lottery? This probably includes scratchers. Yeah. Oh, give oh, it a little shaky. It's, a, it's on the border. Oh, give it a little give nudge. It a, it's hazy. Uh, uh, give it, give, give it the touch. Most likely. Oh, yeah, which means you need to go spend your fortune oh, on the yeah. scratchers and then give us the money for it. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Let's go, big. Oh wait. Win that Powerball and put it right in the Zelda ton, so we have to use the Megaton hammer on the OLED. Please. If you do the long play and you buy the scratchers, you can like ask it again later. Will I win like the Mega Lotto? Or you, you, gotta, or, you gotta wait. Just, until, ask, yeah. just ask a bunch of questions. Like, is oh. the first digit one? <laughs> <laughs> until you get God, it. God, you're taking just all my. Uh, but that'd be a lot of eight dollars. It's true. Uh, Marissa, do we have a second question on that one? Or was it just the one? He only gave eight dollars. Oh, yeah, oh that's insufficient. Right. No, it's it's eight dollars per question. Eight dollars from. Uh. Sorry, I'm trying to use my brain for the, your name. You see, your name. That says, "Oh, magic eight ball." I am also curious. Will the leaf cat stand up? Will, Will the leaf, leaf cat stand, stand up? up? We didn't get a good answer last time. On the border again? On the tip, on the tip? Don't count on it. Oh. Ooh. All right. Sure? That's, that's, good. that's what the internet that's wants. Fine. Pokemon Company learning its lesson? <laughs> Sonata <laughs> Sonora 2.0? We'll the the A-Ball was whispering to me. Pokemon Company's lawyers are on the line. Uh oh. <laughs> Don't worry, I've dealt with them before. I'm <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it was in a positive sense. What? Before we did anything, as Pokemon got bigger, I emailed them and like, I was like, just stand on the stairs, but no, that loading zone is that first step. Yeah, just don't make money. Sure. Did you remember the shovel? Yeah. Wow, the magic eight ball was right! so I tried to not forget, oh, I got it, wait. We're here, save. One. Wait, was that what the Magic 8 Ball said? I thought it said that you won't remember the shovel. No, they said most definitely. Oh, nice. Th that's just living proof. The 8 Ball never lies. All right, all of our saves are saved. Friends, by the way, there was a tweet that just showed up on the screen there. Did you know that if you use the hashtag Zeldathon uh, throughout the marathon, you can get that tweet and more featured right on the stream? Yeah, especially and if it's mean, fire. Not just by and more, <laughs> like, you'll get more tweets on stream. Like, if you had images attached to them, we can share them. So if you guys do some awesome fan art or make some memes, share them with us at Twitter. Make some cosplay. If you have a fire tweet, not, I will show it. I'm not it. talking about Zelda people, by the way, but I'm talking about Zelda fun people. Zelda you do cosplayers, people. cosplay, of, cosplay us. of Zelda fathers. <laughs> if, if you Photoshop <laughs> Jiggy's mustache out, please send us the picture. I mean, you know. I'm, I'm just gonna say, guys. Can someone cosplay as Jiggy's original, mustache? Original old lady right here. Yeah. <laughs> cosplay of Shadow would just be a button down. Uh, from Untuck It, thank you very much. Not, <laughs> not sponsored, sponsor me. <laughs> Untuck It from Nantucket, oh my god. Hey. $10 from Connor that says, so happy to see the Zeldon team together in person again. Who's Connor? Hi, book heart. <laughs> oh, that Connor. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hi, Connor. What's the question? Does Connor have a question? No, no. question. He said hi, book. Oh, no. It's just hi. Hi. Just do hi, yeah. bro. Hi, bro. <laughs> hi, bro. <laughs> oh, password? Where, where is it? Oh, it's in the the showroom. Showroom? Yeah. Uh, can you bring it to you Sure. Okay. It would have been way funnier if you just said a password on the stream. So true. Hunter 2. 
I pray this is the right know. one. Let's go. It's like, We're gonna guess. Uh, huh. Look, there's a reason that the magic eight ball is this powered right now. This is the biggest right guess of my life. Like a Pokemon. It hasn't been right. wrong yet. Yeah. Especially about Maybe that food team. It has been like, really mean about that food team. <laughs> Yes, eight the Magic 8 dollars. Ball is still going. Yeah. Donate $8 or more to ask your question to it. Yeah, and it will give it sage yeah, advice. Yeah. Like this question from Avier Garanus. $8. It says, all right, Magic 8 Ball. Did the lottery company pay you to tell that other person they most likely win the lottery? Did, Did the lottery company pay you to tell that other person they most likely win the lottery? <laughs> The other person. Don't lie to me, or else. Eight, eight ball is gonna be like speak English, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Ask again later. Maybe. That's yeah, I'm very why it's concerned all about that answer. What is the answer? Most likely. Oh. oh. No. Ooh, what, I'm asking, what I'm wondering, eight balls, why we ain't seen some of that? Gotta huh? trust the Cry government. Here today. <laughs> Where's our commission? Where's our commission? Where's our donation? <laughs> like no wonder all the questions are hazy. The eight ball doesn't understand a thing you're saying. <laughs> Just be like, do I? Uh, do you like peas? Like something like that. Like. <laughs> Like, Please what? stop writing us books for questions. <laughs> they both can be bought. <laughs> I mean, I, I mean, like, you got to find them. Okay. Yeah, Let's get a train of eight dollar, yeah. like eight dollar questions of just asking why. That's it. Why? why. You know, why? you know what I want to do actually. Yeah, I realize that, of course, that this eight ball is pretty dubious at best in some questions. What we need to do is we need to buy like ten eight balls and ask them a series of factual or questions that can be backed up with facts. Okay, science nerd. And see which down. one is the <laughs> Let's find out which is the most accurate which in the bunch. Which one is the most right? The eight ball. Using science. Yes. Yeah. I actually like that. And then and then you can put the test sample and a control sample and yeah. see how they compare. Exactly. Find the best eight ball. We just talked about how we're putting all the prizes in one sack and throwing it on someone. You think we can going? get like an eight ball laboratory going? Yeah, I want yes. to see an eight ball lab. <laughs> Mattel, call us. We have eleven dollars from Roxy Jen, nineteen ninety. That says, "Dear Magic Eight Ball, will I become a t successful Twitch streamer?" No. Will, will they become <laughs> a successful <laughs> Twitch streamer? Give me a heart, thank you. Have a heart. You may rely on it! Hey! Don't! Don't worry! It's really bad yeah. as I Not said. A hard yes. <laughs> <laughs> also, Zeldathon, I love all your energy. Share the love. Heart. Love oh, the love. It, like it. it depends It depends on what you define as success. Uh, I mean, well, it, they, you may rely on it, which yeah, means that that's their job it. now. Congratulations. <laughs> rely on it that much. We've already called but where you, you work right now and told them that you've been quitting. Yeah. <laughs> we, we, you know, sometimes we you need a gentle pass. nudge into the deep end, so we're just going to throw you in. Uh, and, you know, when you're on top of everything, just remember, this is where it all started. Yeah. yeah. Don't even know And then, you know, share your exactly sub revenue with direct relief. Thanks. 23, 23 from Sonic and Ribbon that says, Oh, Magic 8 Ball. Will I be invited to attend a Zeldathon marathon in the future? Will you be invited to attend a Zelda Pond in the future? Hey, Bob, Tornado. Most likely, wow. Oh, oh, wow. Oh. Look at that. Most know. likely. Not 100% though. Just don't ask me in a bathroom and say, hey, I like Zelda Pond. <laughs> <laughs> Just, all you gotta do is yeah, DM one of us and tell us the eight ball sent you. <laughs> <laughs> it said Shut so. Shut up, my Discord. <laughs> They bring a permission slip. Yeah, your slip. Discord is a wild Abra number, uh, I don't know. <laughs> it's probably a Pokemon number, isn't it? Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> well, dang. Just call it. You're the calling me, yeah. 1979 from Soup, which with two questions, but that is enough for two. One, is this the best secret sound? Is, is this, this the, the best, best secret sound? sound? That was the Hartford Way I was wondering. Yeah, it was. Yeah, so, uh, I just got a Discord message. Better not tell you now. Oh, I, I bet 8-Ball oh, knows, you know. Eight Eight Ball knows what some secret yeah. sounds are. Yeah. 8-Ball doesn't want yeah. yeah. There's one yet to be found. Number two, will the file name Soup win for Spirit Tracks? Will, will the file name Soup, soup win for, for Spirit Tracks? tracks? My reply is AIO? What? That says AIO. My what? reply is I no. I think it's no. 
There's just a line across that, that, that. Yes, end. it's a misprint. <laughs> oh no! Oh, oh, no. It's worth so much money. <laughs> <laughs> you can sell it on the second day. Are, are you sure it's not AO? Like AO. I'm a AO. Fire, 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 fire. AO. Part-time rare magic eight ball salesman. <laughs> Thank you much. Turntables RPG for the raid, by the way. Whoa, hey, yeah. Thank you so Make much. Make sure you take the, the time. Are host the channel hey. uh, on your Twitch channel. Please. With slash host Zeldathon. We went uh, even day, if right. you never streamed, it does actually help. Metrics are crazy. Something, something algorithm. Yep. Yeah, for those of you who are just joining, welcome to Zeldathon Daybreak. This is a six-day yeah, yeah. charity marathon. We're going to be playing through the Legend of Zelda series while trying to raise money for direct relief. Be sure to go to donate.zeldathon.com to uh, donate. Uh, right now, we are asking a magic eight ball all of your hardest questions. But you have to donate at least eight dollars, or else you'll never know the answer. And if you've never, never heard of direct relief, never. they do wonderful humanitarian assistance in over 100 countries in all 50 United States, including its territories. They're doing wonderful projects like providing power to hospitals and medical centers in Puerto Rico, as well as helping out in Ukraine, so providing support and aid to those who need it. So true. I have a question for the 8-Ball. Oh. $8 from Commander Shepard that says, Magic 8-Ball, this guy named Garrus wants to tag along on my mission. Should I take him along? Should, Should you, you take Garrus along on your mission? We're about to find out if the eight ball is based. Oh, please. Mm. Ask, Ask also again later. Uh, Ask again later. No, oh, the eight bucks. But they're gonna leave him on the citadel, and that's no good. <laughs> oh. oh my god. Do you think the eight ball is just greedy and just wants to be asked over and over again? That might be a thing. <laughs> Ask the magic oh, eight ball. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, ready for this. <laughs> Dude, have lottery winnings that uh -oh. were paid off. Eight dollars from Riot Toroblo that says, "Dear Magic Eight Ball, are the emissions of electrons by electromagnetic radiation oh, striking on a metal what? surface hype?" <laughs> are the emissions of electromagnetic surface hype? You may rely on it. Yeah! Hey! That's pretty hype. <laughs> hey, hype! Oh, hype yeah. Can I get a hoi? Hoi? Oh, I like how you may rely it on is like however we choose to interpret it. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe not the right answer, but you may rely on it, sure. <laughs> what you can rely on? And all of your money being donated here is going uh, to a great cause. Yep. Oh, dude, get caught again. That was a funny face. Um, what? Okay. Don't touch your Whoosh. Get me out of here. Bugs, Tremors, Kevin Bacon saved me. Favorite movie star. Where am I going? Oh, how, how much would it cost me for you to do Lightning McQueen's signature kachow into the microphone every time <laughs> you need to do this? Kachuga. I'll do uh, $25. Done. That's a good $25 sound. That's a good $25 sound. You know, you could ask a question with that $25 sound. Oh, you could ask. And what can we save? You're right. I gotta think this through now. Kachuga! Now, if somebody had a lot Kachow. of money and wanted a lot of answers, they could donate a lot and be like, I have 17 questions. We might, want to put a, we might want to put an upper limit to how many questions you can fit in a donation message. I don't know, if somebody donates $80, I'm willing to, but we have to do rapid go, fire go for all 10? Yeah. Sure. You know what, even better? If you, ha if you ask more than three or three more questions, you have to accept the answer for the, s or the same answer for all of the questions. Ooh. <laughs> So if you have a if you have a eight, ten questions like eighty dollars, they all will be yes, no, or ask me later. <laughs> so then you can hedge your best, and you can ask some questions for which you want the answer to be yes, and some which you want the answer to be yeah. no. So that way, whatever way it goes, you have a consolation prize. Mm -hmm. Sounds like a lot of strategy there. Eight dollars. Strategy game player. Riot Tarablo. That says, dear Let's Magic try. Eight Ball. Should I donate another fifty dollars? Yes. <laughs> Should I donate another fifty dollars? Without a doubt. Yes. Yeah. 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 Yeah
Okay. If able, please donate responsibly. <laughs> donate responsibly within your limits. Oh yeah, you know, no, the the triangle has actually grown bigger, and it does say uh, within your limits. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. It's like it, it added that. Thanks. Thanks so <laughs> within your limits. <laughs> Thanks Eight dollars so from Kenla great. that says, "Will my family be able to get our first house this year?" Will yeah. my family be able to get our first house, house this year? House. 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 Apply hazy. Try again. Ooh. Uh, it's got, it's got to wait for the interest rate. Yeah, the market sucks. Yeah. Yeah. So you you got to put the down, the, the down payment down. I mean, not only that, but you have to wait for houses to become available and not get eaten up. It's a magic guy. It's a magic eight ball, not a realtor. Yeah. This one's this one's kind of scary. Uh oh. We're getting back into like middle school trauma dump. Oh no. Eight dollars from Dolphin that just asks, "Magic eight ball, am I good enough?" Are you good enough? Please say yes. Well, outlook not so good. Well, I'm sorry. Donate it again. <laughs> no, no, no. Maybe. You're better. Donate, be donate again. We'll get you a reroll. <laughs> yeah, maybe the eight ball is just saying, no, I'm you're even yourself. better double than that. Double or nothing, double or nothing. <laughs> double or nothing. <laughs> Money. There's a rope. Get out of here, rope. Yeah. What a cruel joke to name snakes oh ropes. Oh my god, $50 from Riot Trouble that says the magic eight ball has spoken. Huzzah! Huzzah! Thank you! Huzzah! $50, I gotta say. Thanks. Yeah. Boom! Boom! Well, let's go. Let's and they go. didn't tell you their ears, Pierce. Wait, do I have to? <laughs> no, they did not. <laughs> oh, I gotta do one more. Yo, I'm going to go do some t-shirts if you don't mind. I love t-shirts. T-shirts. So uh, you guys, we have Fair merch children. available <laughs> right now at zeldacon.com slash store. And there are a bunch of different cool designs where every purchase benefits direct relief. Whoa. We have this one, Cursed Kid by Artsy Rosie. We have this one, Moon Phases by Marza K. We have Kingdom Souvenir by Rain T. Wakefield. We have The Wolf by Raposa 2T. We have Pling by Hold Rain T. Effects. Wakefield. I'm holding. Hold Four Goddesses oh, yeah. by Evelyn Jade. And that's it. $5 from every single shirt goes every to Direct Relief. One. Every single one. Wild! So that means you should buy yeah, you get a shirt. all of the shirts. Every single one. Yes. Mm -hmm. I mean, l last time we were doing a double thon, I was wearing a lot of those shirts. <laughs> and now so you can wear true. even more of them. You know, someone who's very generous is for my girlfriend because they live in the Netherlands and shipping's weird. But pretty much every shirt for the last three years for them, and I had to take all of those shirts with me in my carry-on luggage <laughs> through customs to give them to my girlfriend. That is a pile of shirts. That's all, it was a third of my bag was just shirts that, like, at least I knew that when I went back home, I would have a lot of room for souvenirs. Did your did, did did customs give you a weird time about it? Like, why are you are you trying to smuggle shirts across the country? No, no, <laughs> they were border? they were they were more concerned that like I wasn't on vacation and I was doing something illegal. Oh, oh. oh. yeah, yeah, actually, yeah, I would imagine so. I'm like. You guys follow, like, I worked for the government for a period. How do you not know everything about my life? Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll take my heroin elsewhere. <laughs> <laughs> We've got questions for the eight ball. 2593 from Shadow Temple. Oh, what's this actually you? I don't like it. The question is, Magic 8 Ball. Should I donate my life savings? Should I donate, donate my, my life savings? <laughs> That's a trick question. You already yeah, just did. Uh, oh. The eight dollars? Come on, give us an answer. It's not giving me an answer. It's oh no! Time to move on. Oops! Time to move on. Don't count on it. Don't count on it. All right, all right. All right. So you. don't count my life savings. Just donate. Thank it. you, Got Magic it. Eight Ball. Uh, son. Eight dollars from Soup that says, "Oh, Magic Eight Ball." Yes. 
You can't ice it. Yes! yes. <laughs> As I see it, yes. Okay. Yes! Yes! yes. <laughs> As I saw it and heard it, yes. <laughs> Not wrong. <laughs> $20.02 from O Pink Penguin O that says, first donation of the marathon. I just noticed my tiny carved tingle in the grand prize giveaway. Yeah. Hey. Can confirm that is uh, the person who made that. Mm -hmm. He looks so awesome. small and cute on top of the switch. Now my question for the magic one. Dear magic eight ball, should I stop goofing off and start getting to work so on my super. sewing? Should, should you stop goofing off and, and start getting to work on your sewing? Sewing. Outlook, not good. You should you just keep watching yeah, yeah, yeah. the Twitch.tv slash Zelda phone. Here's that grand prize, by the way. It's pretty crazy. Look at all wow. $50 over the course of the entire marathon gets you a chance to win everything you see on the screen. Wow. Everything. You could win us? Oh, yeah. We're on the screen right now. I'm, no, I'm, up for I'm sorry. I'm no sorry. longer. <laughs> 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 $12.24 from Abyssal Hawk that says, Objection! Ignore that eight ball. Yiggy yaddy. Everyone's incredible. Oh, you're incredible. Aww. Thank you. Aww. Hold on. You're incredible. Is everyone incredible? <laughs> <laughs> uh, that'll be $8? Without a doubt. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. $8? I mean, that's a crisp five, but it's not $8. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, the Fair. Magic Eight Ball said fun. not to donate his life chase, savings. Though. Yeah. Oh, Michael. Oh, you only have $5. Right oh, that's a. That's yeah. A <laughs> that, that, that was the crispiest the clap you'll hear. <laughs> that's the chip. Bum, 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 Friends, we I ran out of questions. So we did run out of questions. <laughs> and you have to understand, like, if if we if we don't have anything further for the Magic Eight Ball, it has to go back to its day, its day show in Vegas. Like, you can't be hanging around here for that long. It's a celebrity. Uh huh. Also, fun fact: the total number of donations in the last hour is fifty three. Woo! Woo! And I woo, I wonder woo. if we could get it to sixty nine, and if so, how long could we keep it there? Of six, but we, <laughs> the have average so number, the number of donations over the last hour. Uh, so we, we oh. need a big influx of donations now, and then we'd have to trickle one yeah. every like minute, what, every minute or so. Yeah, <laughs> yep. minute, roughly a little less. Yeah, yeah, about fifty seconds. Oh my! You oh, heard, but, but at least sixteen donations right now. You heard the donation reader. Get it going. <laughs> For fifty-three. <laughs> uh, we, I suppose we have not done a roll call since this game has indeed begun. Yes. What? Have uh, we done call? a roll call? We did roll at the very beginning. Oh, oh, yeah. We haven't done one. Yeah. Sure. Wait, wave. hold on. Secrets Moblin. I have a question for the magical one, but all I have is secrets. Do you have a secret question? Secret Um, Secrets Moblin. Secret, yeah, that'll be an $8 donation, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you can't get the... You, uh -huh. think, you think you just wander on in here and just get yourself a question? It's not how it works, son. <laughs> uh, the 8-ball has been whispering to me recently, and it's telling me that it's established a deeper connection with the actual plane. Oh yeah? It is now more sure than ever that its predictions are 98% no. accurate. 98? Wow. Wow. That's pretty good. Wow. Yeah, it's pretty good, but you know, it feels real because it's less than 100. You know, that's that's more that's more accurate than my dentist. It's like when you say oh, 9 oh. out of 10 dentists oh. recommend. Oh. Yeah, it's like, yeah, of course some dentists would be like, oh, I don't like this. All right, before we continue on questions, who's playing the game? I'm campy. I'm playing this fun game. You're playing this fun game. Who's I'm a the director here. I helped make this thing happen. Oh, yeah. That's me. Cool beans. Who are you? I'm ROM Scout. I uh, just sit here and vibe mostly, but hey, occasionally I play fun games too. Hi, I'm Danny Music. I'm chilling and enjoying a game now, and I'll play music later. Hi, I'm Shadow Temple, and you cannot avoid my voice this marathon. Like it's in it's in the goal achieves, it's the milestones, it's, it's so in everything. You are trapped. What number? Uh, not a not a horrible fate. Hi, I'm Abra. I six nine. Uh, nice. I I nice. I Pokemon sometimes. It's pretty neat. I'm Thorin Chris, your friendly neighborhood eight ball acolyte. <laughs> Hello. It's required at all marathons. Uh, acolyte? Wait, are are you worshipping it? Like what's going on here? Yes. 
I'm the floating voice in the background. My name's Marissa. Hello. I floating I'm reading your donations. I floating void Marissa. Like this one. $8 from Nightmare117 that says, Magic 8-Ball, are you drunk? Are, are you drunk? drunk? Definitely. Yes, definitely. <laughs> I knew it! Well, that was quick. Uh, I mean, uh, it's it, most of the liquid in there is isopropyl alcohol. Oh, no wonder. Oh, yeah, no, it's, it's been right. drinking it's itself. So it's so the AC is like 100%, right? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Eight dollars from washable markers that says, Magic 8-Ball, are you haunted? Are you haunted? It's, it doesn't want to answer. No, the ghost no, is fighting. It doesn't. It My just... sources say no. Okay. Uh, right. So far as I know, <laughs> the alcohol. No. Uh, the the, the voice in my head has told me to say no. Definitely all, no. All of the spirits are saying no. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Sorry, tell me not all. The strange man in the window who tells me things says no. <laughs> Abyssal Hawk donates sixty-nine dollars. It just says nice. 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 And Dolphin nice. donates eight dollars and says, "Magic eight ball, will I ever be good enough?" Tosh. Will, will you ever be good, good enough? enough? Please be honest. It is certain. Oh, yeah. Okay. Better so than, not good enough not now. Not good enough now, but eventually you'll improve. You'll, improve. you'll, improve. Yeah. you'll get there. You got this. Right. Just keep at it. Keep on keeping on. Keep on trucking. I'm gonna spin the wheel because we have five cued. Oh, oh. Let's go, baby. Invent a new Zelda, Zelda game. game. Alright, so I've got an idea. Okay. 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 What we're gonna do is so you know how much of a shake up to the system that uh, Zelda Breath of the Wild was because we kind of shifted our genres a little bit? Of course. Bit? Yep. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make a Zelda game, yeah. and and uh, instead of uh, instead of going with like that open world, we're we're gonna go to the next level. We're gonna do a turn-based RPG. Yes. We're gonna All go right. back to back to the roots. Okay. Um, it's gonna be set in the style of a uh, Miyazaki film. Yeah. Uh, but oh. the problem is the budget that they're going to give the third-party company that's gonna be doing it is they never nothing. Do it. Um, oh. So. Ooh. So, uh, at the end of the day, you kind of just get a CDI game. Okay. Man, but, we're, but we do get another CDI game. Like, yep. They, they're cult wow. classics. Oh. Cult classics are still classics. Uh, you, know, you know cult classics need a cult. That might be a... We, we need to... Ooh, Man, actually, that a, a Zelda frame. game where you get a cult. Uh, yeah, cult you start the Ego Clan. Yeah. Fifty dollars from Starry Fox seventy one that says, "Oh mighty eight ball, ye who holds future knowledge, will things go well if I submit this application?" Will, will things, things go well if you submit, submit this, this application? application? Outlook, not so good. Yeah. Uh, that maybe, just means you need to revise. Yeah, it. yeah, yeah, just, yeah. Maybe that will change your thoughts. Yeah. Go Great. Not Move to well, a new state. Add 10 minutes amazing. to your time. Yeah, make sure your cover letter is nice and buttoned up. Yeah. Buttoned up. Brush <laughs> up that resume. Post your resume on Twitter. I'm sure people will help. Don't do that. Uh, yeah, especially don't forget to uh, omit your address and everything like that. Uh, <laughs> And we'll put it on stream. <laughs> and we'll put it on Use stream. hashtag ZeldaBot. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I haven't done this fight in like six years, so let's try to remember what's going on. Good luck. Um, this you better be careful, beast. he can summon cyclones. <laughs> Marissa, how many donations do we have in the past hour? 52. Oh no, went oh, down! No. It went down! Come on, please! But the max is $69 now, so. They don't even have to be $8 well, or 8 ball ones. They could be they, they could be less, so you could get that number oh, up so we get to 69. I mean, you can just donate four dollars and I'll consult the ball, but I won't tell you the result. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll know. Four dollars is the something. ask; the other four is the answer. Basically, your fate will be set in stone, but you won't know it. I like that. I like that idea a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I hate it. Please calm down, my friend. Just. Get down here for me to hit you in the face. Come on. Oh, how's that? Listen to these guys. He's got a big old bad pack of veins. He's so true. Okay. You 
Should I? Oh, oh, did oh, I really oh God. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Got the Matrix hey, box. boxes going. Get me out of here. All right, be right here. Uh, right. Y'all mind if I do another wheel spin? Do it. Yeah, go for uh, it. There's nothing wrong that could go with a wheel spin. Surely. Bob, you're hurting me. Strong oh, and sell the character. Right, who's feeling that? Oh, here. yeah, hand it my way. Okay, we go. I've been learning how to do an art. Next donation, give me a Zelda character. Do the art. Ooh, do an art. Alright, nice. I'll look over here. Th thanks for the comment, I appreciate it. <laughs> Alright, right there. Sick. You did it. Actually, Again, I, got I have ideas. not practiced at all. But if a donation. I think you can kill him. On the second cycle yeah, with all of your seconds. bombs, but I think I wasted an additional bomb. I think you need nine bombs to kill him. Reminder, for a $8 donation or more, we are consulting the almighty wisdom of the Magic 8 Ball. Get out of here. Look at the next file name choice for The Legend of Zelda. Oh, no, it's a It's fight. so close. Yeah, rat, rat and not and rat, rat are rat. fighting at each other. 193 for rat, 189 rat for not rat. Anything else. <laughs> I'm very curious if Rat is going to win that final oh, anymore, really but that's an $8 donation in order to consult the 8-ball. Yeah, the person who was actually going to play this game, you know, they're experts. I'm, uh, <laughs> you know, not. <laughs> right, give me, uh, hey, you're expert enough. I'm getting there. Good enough. Yeah, for, for, me. for what it's worth, you guys can donate to other file names as well. It yeah. doesn't it just have to be rat. I think you got a little bit of we spit can in your microphone. The rat mafia just yeah. a tad. I realize that like, the two categories that have been given do complete the entirety of the world <laughs> between rat and not rat, but we can make it. You can make it not not rat and not and not rat. You even put not, not rat. <laughs> We're gonna need to do some boolean logic charts here. Boolean. Boolean. So what's that donation? Because that might be a character I need to draw, or not. It is eight dollars from I Like Corn Dogs. Oh, wonder and all powerful eight ball should Abra so draw burn appearing in his next game. <laughs> wow, what a cool! Well, yeah, we didn't get burn into the new game either. Burn's yeah. got to be the main character. He'll be the leader of the cult. <laughs> all right, ready? Should, should I draw burn appearing in his next burn, game? Burn, burn, burn. How did it, should it, you draw burn me. become that one of a question? I don't know. <laughs> it still doesn't answer me. It doesn't know my artistic it's skill. It's still not answering me. I don't even know what it is. Like. It just told Get me to ask again later. Ask yeah. again later. Ask again later. Ask again later. Oh. Eight ball, come on. All right, so I think. I, I guess we just gotta keep rolling yeah. characters until it says yes to one of them. Oh, I don't have Control Z on this whiteboard. Excuse me. Just undo. <laughs> Control Z. Yeah, we're pondering on the orb up in here. Come join us as we ponder the orbs. I don't want to ponder any orbs. Eight dollar don donation, we'll ponder this orb. Uh, and answer whatever question you are pondering. You still have a save uh, stacked up? I'm about to, yeah. Yeah, we had a couple of uh, fifty dollar donations, so you could definitely save. I saved like five times in a row, so we'll do we'll do some where the. Uh... So I'm having too much fun with Danny DePillo. Danny. <laughs> Two-faced. That, that's a lot of that's a lot of pixels that came in. Mm-hmm. Hey. Remember when Orb was a meme? Yes. <laughs> Remember when it was a GDQ meme? Yes. I was. We went from Orb a to child. Mod. I was Are we morbing out? It was a meme before GDQ, right wasn't it? Hmm? It was a meme before GDQ, I believe. Uh, not that I remember. This was like over a decade ago. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, that's been a hot, hot one. Hey, folks. Folks. It's Orban time. It's Orban time. Orban time. It's Orban time. It's my okay, favorite part of that tail, movie. Which I think is the last one um, all the way over here. Is this the tail? It is, okay. Tail, and then you gotta go up north. I think. Hey, this tree? Good job. Okay. Go up here. Because this whole island is a whale. 
So we gotta go up. Dodging. There we go. Okay, there's two more. Let's try to draw a D on this one, but it doesn't work. Hey, Sammy, you have a car. Alright, that's the last one. Dan, the Dan normal did me, that was the last airbender. <laughs> boing. It's the time stones. No, I, I meant the weird things poking the little tridents at you. Uh, moblins. Oh. Really? Probably. Oh, okay. I mean, this is a Ganon timeline game. There. Ganon was, Ganon was here. What's this thing I'm getting? Oh, the chart. That's it. Okay. Like, why am I here? <laughs> is this just a, muscle memory is this lead so you to the Temple of the Ocean King again? I have to go there, but I, th I need this. Because okay. that's like fast warping. But I don't need it because I'm stupid, but I want to get it for Dan. Wait, that timing was perfect. <laughs> <laughs> he came out right as the Careless Whisper started playing. <laughs> yep. Oh All right. No, they time. knew. They knew. <laughs> <laughs> How am I doing on time? Alright, so I'm looking good. I'm gonna head on over to Cam so I can show off your new temple. No, I just yeah, finished yeah. the second temple. I don't, I mean, it's 11.20, I don't know what time oh. you're shooting for. Well, I don't know where, where, when I started was the you thing. You started at 9.20. Did I? It's going no, for no, like... It's, it's, like so it's going to like 5 a.m., right? Yeah. yeah. I think you're doing alright. I think you're doing fine. Five. We've got our magic eight ball. Oh! Ooh! Um, the Hero of Fortune. Hero of Fortune. Ah. I mean, I only have two more. I have an Ocean King and then the Temple and the, the Trial of the, the, the Strongman. The Strong Childman? I'm going to rapid fire some uh, eight ball questions here. Go Do for it. it. Uh, first, not an eight ball question, but really quick. 6969 from CWA Grant that says, Hello, Zolathon. Here's the first okay. of many donations. For the marathon, looking forward to a fun week. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. A50 from Roxy Gen 1990 that says, How about a Zelda game where instead you play as the good guys, you play as the evil guys and see their side of the story? Also, Zeldathon, you guys are the best. Keep it up. Also, Magic 8 Ball, will Zeldathon Daybreak make a record amount of donations? Will Zeldathon Daybreak make a record amount of donations? Guys, it's a powerful one. <laughs> Play hazy. Try again. No, well, <laughs> you can only find that. That, that it's in your hands. Continuing to donate. <laughs> uh, Bob Mungus, to answer your question, uh, generally it is always better, in its own way, to make one large donation as opposed to several small ones, if only because PayPal does take their cut, uh, and there's a flat fee on each donation. Uh, that being said. Uh, if you want to make a couple of donations throughout the marathon and, and stretch it out so you can play around in different fun little things, we will certainly enjoy that as well. So it is up to you. But yeah, we'd, we'd prefer a hundred dollar donate, a single hundred dollar donation than a hundred one dollar donations. In a big way. Yeah. So with the charity. Yeah. Twelve dollars and twenty four cents from Joey that says, "Yo, should I go to sleep at a reasonable time or reasonable hour tonight, Eight Ball?" Should, Should you go to sleep at a reasonable time? Cannot predict now. Huh? Well, the phone's going well, back. Well, we gotta stay up. Wait, 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 everyone, wait, wait, please, wait, everyone, please right. be quiet. Oh. Was it speaking to you? The high priest. <laughs> yes. No. I'm everyone, terrified. the magic eight ball wishes to rest for the evening. What? I'm going to take it to take it to its. Destined spot to slumber. But well, we, we cannot question the, prince. the words of the high priest. So. Um, perhaps we shall ask it. Uh, one last question? Yes. Pra perhaps a. Perhaps a. Shall April have a good night's sleep? My ship is exploding. Shall oh, April, April have, have a good, good night's, night's sleep? Night's sleep. <laughs> My ship exploded. You may rely on it. Yeah. Oh. Good night, Magic April. Good night, I will take April. it to a slumber spot. Good night. Thank you for your service. Thank you. Uh, and also thank you for the raid, uh, Techno. It's yeah. a Jiggy 11. You mean Jiggy 11? <laughs> with an, with an yeah. 11 person raid. <laughs> okay, so back to the Temple of the Ocean. With feeling this time. Good thing we haven't been there before. Trudge. So Chad, how are you doing? You doing good. I need money. You having a good time? 
a good, this is a good marathon so far. I don't know, but why, why don't we all like share something in chat that something good happened today, you know? L leave us yeah. a Yelp review. Five stars. <laughs> Only five so, stars. Someone was told they're gonna win the lottery. So yeah, that's true. That seems like that a good, good day. It's <laughs> true. I wish I was told I was gonna win the lottery today. So pretty good, it's pretty good, it's pretty good. I'm gonna put all of that telephone total right there. You're in bed, so you just, am I. You just had Food butter chicken? I got, I got some chicken tikka masala. I thought I read my Bowser crashed, and I was like, dang, dude. <laughs> 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 the Mario Kart 8 is crazy. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, what it did is, Joey, what it said it was, I uh, ask again later. It did say ask again later. It, it said, no, it said reply hazy. A reply hazy, right. yeah. yeah. Something, something vague, something, hazy, something, again, continue yes. to watch Zelda. But then the eight ball itself went to bed, so it's a little and, bit and suspect right there. Browser, so that sounds like some deep cosmic energy right there. It's true, it, the, the eight ball told Zelda that, it, that he, they could be doing better. <laughs> <laughs> you discovered Twitch today, well welcome to the internet. We'll be your guide. The the internet. 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 It's a pretty wild place the longer you spend here. You, you've never had the Leave. internet before finding <laughs> Twitch. <laughs> Leave now. Dead men tell no tales. Yo ho, yo ho, pirate life for me. Yeah, that's crazy. Five dollars right, from KGO minutes. Kev, thank you for your donation. Just like in this Ooh. game, pirate's life for me. What happens when the timer runs out? Good job. First out? route, first route, one second. Wait, what is... okay. Alright, Seriously though, guys, it is so nice to be able to finally kind of have this space again and be in a ballroom for six days straight without looking at the sun. <laughs> It's, it, we missed it. We missed it a lot. We hope you guys are enjoying yourselves so far. We're certainly trying to take our precautions to keep ourselves safe throughout this entire marathon. Uh, but we are happy to be back! And hey, uh, folks, if you got friends who are Zelda-thon fans who may not necessarily know that we're live and existing, uh, maybe let them know. Maybe, maybe you know, help spread the word and all that. True. Make sure that, uh, and uh, you know, especially if you can't donate, uh, make, make sure you keep spreading the word on social media. Tell people that, uh, might be able to donate and then we can get, keep that total going up and up and up and up. Social media? Social media, You mean Tell all me the social media that we're a part of, including Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube? I was just even looking at the Zeldathon TikTok right now and it is a bumpin'. It is it's a bumpin'. lit, <laughs> as the children say. <laughs> we're uh, we're How do you with find it. the Zelda-thon social media? I I mean I just put it on the screen. Is Read it? you're with your eyeballs. <laughs> Is it <laughs> Zelda-thon? It's Zelda-thon on wow. everything. Zelda -thon. Like, Zelda -thon. It's not everywhere. It's not Zelda-thons. Don't it? don't listen to those jerks. It's Zelda-thon. <laughs> don't listen to past clips from <laughs> ten years ago. They're no, wrong. <laughs> absolutely not. And just just so clear. Uh, you know, it's not a zero or something like something funny like that, right? No, 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 no. It's just good old fashioned Zelda. Zelda. It's Zelda Thon, not Zelda Zero. -n. <laughs> Took the wrong turn. Now we're going back here. Boom. And as mentioned before, too, make sure you're hosting. Uh, I think the stream went down for a brief minute. I don't know if that was enough to kick those hosts off, but I'm gonna double check myself and re-host if I need to. That was really good. That was really good. I love it. So Shadow, hmm. would you like to play a game with me? Uh, it depends. Uh-oh. <laughs> well. Abra was here a little while ago, and they uh, invented a new Zelda game for us. Huh? Yeah, that's true. What other things could we find in this crazy, low-budget Zelda game? In this crazy, low-budget Zelda game that has a Miyazaki uh, visual style, turn-based combat, and a budget of zero dollars. <laughs> and, you know, I, I don't think any one person is creative enough to design stuff for this game. So okay. I think we're going to have to go in blind. So here we have... Yeah. The whiteboard is divided into thirds. Into thirds, okay. okay. So we're all going to draw a third of an image. 
we're, we're gonna see what we design. Oh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh my. Oh me, oh my. Okay, right. you're you gonna start off? Sure, I'll start. So All right. you have the most drawing practice here, right? Should now. we do the, the yeah. main character first? Um, sure. I think it would make the most sense. I also right. want to see donations with what feature that you want to see in the, in our zero feet. no feet. budget feet. All feet. Miyazaki JRPG the feet Legend of Zelda. Feet. Please tell us mm -hmm. what sort of what sort of features will be in here. Yeah. Anoma's listening right now, <laughs> taking notes. I can't, I can't stop just playing with this Danny DeVito <laughs> though. I must give it away. <laughs> it's a it's a you texture gave, thing. I just I keep, it's Danny definitely DeVito in like the top eye. five Zelda on props. And a yeah. black oh, it's got to be yeah, it's got to be my you, favorite. You ate Danny DeVito's entire face. Actually. <laughs> All right. The Legend of Feet. Here you go, Shadow. All right. So uh, it is the main character, and I, I'm not. I cannot but, see. But the you top. can't see. You can't see with yeah. Um. Two dollars. All right. Anonymous. Let's get Jiggy's mustache in the drawing. <laughs> Jiggy's mustache will be <laughs> in the drawing. drawing. Well, that's good because it's not going to be on his face. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Where else would it go? About belly button stash? Right. I got the lowest third and I have no idea what to draw, so give me ideas, <laughs> chat. Also a mustache. <laughs> I have mustache for feet. I'm tiptoeing behind him so he cannot see me. Oh, this other one's gonna see me. Now. All right, let's abandon that one. Over here. Oh, the real colors is having a good station there. Next, we've got to draw the box art. <laughs> oh, the box art! <laughs> okay, I've completed my portion of, of our character. Okay, okay. So I'm here. Marissa. No, you're I just no, received you're a here. PayPal oh, okay. notification receiving the, a certain amount of money, okay? Yeah. Okay. Alright. And I, I, I was very confused at first because I was like, I didn't donate a cut this much money. And I, was, I realized it received. It says, buy a house now or else. <laughs> That's someone oh. donating to our house fund? Yes. <laughs> okay. Is it, is it enough for a house? No. Oh. <laughs> but it's a help. <laughs> That's kind. Uh, buy a house now. Love, Jeff and Shannon. Oh, okay. that's nice. Thanks, Jenna. Oof. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> but I just saw it, I was like, buy a house now, what? <laughs> oh, you're just death warping. Okay. Yes, we gotta go. We're back by your house. Just kidding. Magic Ape this said no on right? his economy. Yeah, this is definitely battle mode. We're <laughs> battling the mechanics. <laughs> Ouch. But this is the best temple. Oh, God. It very much is. This is where all my memory of this place goes. All right, it's I did something. Fun. All right. All right. Why don't right. you cover that up? Um, I'm trying not to look. Okay. All right. So this, friends, is the uh, the final concept art <laughs> for the <laughs> new <laughs> hero yeah, sure. in right. Legend of Zelda. Do we even name this one? Uh, oh. We'll find out soon enough. <laughs> Ta-da! Ta-da! Ta -da! Oh, let me. Let me... <laughs> Yeah, bring that up good, to the camera actually. there so we can see it real nice and good. All right. I, expected I expected much worse. <laughs> <laughs> so we have a, a dead person <laughs> with s stick arms that either feature muscles or tacos on each arm. They, they've got <laughs> anchor arms. They've got a, a flaming sword, a piece of pizza on a, on a string as a necklace, a dog on the center, a belt that says belt, and then uh, at the below the tunic has what I believe are two roller skates and an alligator tail. Yeah, that's right. Wait, wait, is are the arms Jiggy's mustache? <laughs> I think that's Jiggy's mustache uh, uh, on the arms. Metaphorical Jiggy's mustache. 
Yeah, yeah, you see how skinny that is? That's gotta be Jenny's mustache. <laughs> <laughs> The title shall be The Legend of Zelda and the Mystic Skates. <laughs> she just mad libs a plot together. Hey, look, it's a new one. I see, I told you. All right, so I think that was pretty fun. But I, I want to know what you know ideas out there for what we should think of next. Yeah, I, we, we need to hear some from the from the chat. Yeah. And by chat, I mean donations. Donations. Because I don't... I don't reach. I don't take suggestions from chat with no with no donations attached. How much are we thinking, guys? Five dollars. <laughs> yeah, right. Any amount, really. They just want to include. Is that the shirt so, design for next marathon? Can we please have that? <laughs> just a, a white tee with that. <laughs> It'll just say Zeldy on top of it. <laughs> Zeldy. Zeldy. <laughs> You kid, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna, like, now make it happen. It has to. Hi, Yeti Glenn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can, you, you just saw that on the stream, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Yeti Glenn, you got this. <laughs> let's get, let's get you in on this. Put on Zelda on merch, <laughs> merch Thank store. you. We'll sell lithographs of it. Lithographs. <laughs> <laughs> the Zelda <laughs> Zoldi. <laughs> oh, it could be irreproducible with TKO. Like, under 100% you could do it. Yeah. Or you could just like send it out to the internet and and say, would this look good on a hey, shirt? You see what happened? This. Not Rat took Not the lead. Not took over. Oh, wow. Not Rat took the lead. Legend of Zelda. Yeah. So friends, when you donate, of course you can. Hey, Hi. how's it going? Uh, when you donate, you in addition to doing many other things, there are a lot of different options you could throw in on that on a donation, like who carries it out onto the screen, uh, what sort of sound it is based on how much you donate, but it also can do things like pick a file name for the next video game. Uh, you do not have to pick rat or not rat, but it seems like everybody has, so <laughs> you can if you want. You also can pick other names, like Such as Zelda. maybe rat. <laughs> maybe <laughs> rat. <laughs> Perhaps rat. <laughs> How's it going? Good. I'm gonna work in like a half hour, but I thought I'd come hang out for a little bit. You're very fine, good. Very good. Do you want? Do you want to join our drawing game? Oh yeah. What are you drawing? Well, we're waiting for donations to come in and tell us what to draw. I oh, would love five dollars. Yeah. So what we're, what we're doing is. Uh, we've got this whiteboard divided yeah. into three folding sections. Ah. And so, we're fun. trying to design the right. Legend of Zelda game. It's very addictive. Oh, okay, great. Yeah. You're having Well, as a game designer. It's funny, <laughs> <laughs> but feel it. Just, it just feels so it good. It feels so I nice know. to change the, the face. I remember these as a kid. <laughs> right. It's, it, it, before the, like, the fidget poppers, we had sequined pillows of Danny DeVito. <laughs> <Is> that, <laughs> do you think it would be, you know? think it would be One in every household. <laughs> like, could you actually go to bed on Danny DeVito's face? I don't think you could. I think you'd be pretty scratchy. I don't, yeah, I don't uh, think it would. I mean, you might I did go to bed on those cuts. pills as a kid. <laughs> only, oh, when wow. like, only when I was like visiting <laughs> grandparents or something, but yeah. I, I can't think of a circumstance where that would be comfortable. Uh, Any form of Danny DeVito. As a kid. What? That's when I was comfortable. How dare you? Danny DeVito, I'm sure, is an excellent cuddler. Alright. <laughs> a little short a for me, personally, but... <laughs> Any bombs? Any How tall is Danny DeVito? He's like... 4'10 or something like that, right? Like, he's... <laughs> he's around my range somewhere, yeah. You're 4'10? Are, you, are you a good cuddler? <laughs> I, I, I would say so. Yeah. Alright, so Danny DeVito could be a good cuddler. For a single hundred dollar donation. <laughs> Find out how good cuddlers <laughs> <laughs> Danny DeVito. Okay. Cuddle. Oh my gosh, I don't like where this is going. <laughs> this would be a command in the new Zelda game. <laughs> Since it's turn based, right? Just See, the, magi cuddle. the Magic yeah. Eight Ball went to bed, probably because it's cuddling with Danny DeVito. So we can't uh, even ask it if Danny DeVito's a good cuddler. That's between the Eight Ball and Danny. Danny DeVito. All right, Google. <laughs> the Eight Ball could feel us going off the deep end. With, without, without a doubt. <laughs> cool. There is a an entire uh, Reddit thread about which celebrity would be the best to cuddle with. Wow. <laughs> Wow. 
See, What's I want to make consensus? it. <laughs> Dang it! That's what I want. That's what I want to get. That's it's my labeled problem. not safe for work. Oh. We need, we need a... <laughs> oh, I was about to say I want to make that list, but actually, no, I'm not so sure. If I do. <laughs> nope, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm in. Right. I'm in. It was deleted. Uh, <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll sort by the top uh, top answers. I want you guys to guess. Um, Ooh. Nah, you know what? That actually gets a little weird. <laughs> well, the first one's like, ha, ah, this will be cute. And the first one's like, Scarlett Johansson. And I was like, uh, all right. It is okay. getting late. Okay. All right. We have $5 from Perry that says, Design this game's master sword. Right, Here's Danny sword. DeVito with the cane said Jason Derulo. Danny, Danny DeVito. All right, designing a new master sword. Jack Black's up there. Ah, oh, it feels... Oh. I mean, does he slow down enough, though? Just seems oh, like... the, the panda would be very cuddly. That's true, that's true. Kung Fu Panda. Mm -hmm. Ultra Raid. Welcome Raiders. Ultra Raid. I'm Raiding. Raid. Here. This time of year? Hi, Raiders. <laughs> Welcome to Zelathon. Entirely compressed inside this marathon. <laughs> uh, so yes. Sorry, what are you drawing exactly? I'm drawing our new uh, Master Sword. A third, new you're drawing a third, a third of the Master Sword, right? Yes. A third of the Master Sword, correct. The Master Third. <laughs> the Master Third. <laughs> I don't want Danny DeVito's height. I don't know. I don't want to know. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Danny Deck Chair? <laughs> Was a movie in 2003 about oh. a man who flew on a chair in balloons. Oh, yeah. But he ends, uh, actually ends up getting untethered and ends up floating high across Australia. Like, no. for real? I don't know. Based on a true story. I, it does not say. But I keep getting. Distracted from my true goal of who picked <laughs> Danny to be the hype. <laughs> right. Okay, turn, four foot ten. I was right. All right. Oh, you're right. Okay. I got to continue the master sword. Okay. Teeny boy. An IRL guy flew with balloons and caused major issues by an airport. That is true. That that did indeed occur. Uh, oh, at least according to MythBusters. <laughs> I don't I don't remember the original thing. Oh yeah, he was uh, flying with balloons caused by a major issue by an airport. I remember there was like this whole thing where this kid said his his dad said his kid was in like a hot air or like a weather balloon. Balloon balloon them. kid. Yeah, and then they're like, <laughs> wait, he was just in the attic. <laughs> Well, yeah, Balloon Boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a whole thing. We have a $5 donation from OMG It's Monica that says, Best celebrity to cuddle with would obviously be Grimace. Look at that shape of him. Dude's literally a living body pillow. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and, and, and if you use four-armed Grimace from McDonald's checkered past, oh, no. like oh. that's extra arms to cuddle with. My fear is that we don't know the texture of Grimace. <laughs> well, Zan. that's my fear. In Canada, there, there's a ad that makes me very uncomfortable for some reason, and it's just a uh, Grimace playing basketball with the Toronto Raptors mascot. Oh, I, I've seen that. Yeah, it's <laughs> something about I, it just feels wrong. I haven't seen it. Because, but like in the existence of Grimace as like a mascot character, obviously it's like a plush sort of surface, right? And it's like, oh, that seems nice. But what about like in canon McDonald's land? Like grimace. What what is the texture of grimace? If you push on grimace, what do you feel? Mm. I always considered it to be a ghost, oh, like really? an apparition. A really? Yeah. Huh. Cause like the shape is kind of similar to your. So are you, are you saying you just don't ghost? feel anything? You just stick your hand in like nothing? Um. A cold chill. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't guess sound would, very cuddly. I guess it wouldn't be very cuddly then. No. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! What's the most? What is like one of the most important things when cuddling? Air, <laughs> air circulation. Uh, okay. <laughs> I was like, I'm not answering that. 
No, air circulation. You want to eat, 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 as you're cuddling. I'll gay next time I talk. It gets too hot. The most important thing. <laughs> but if you include a ghost in the picture as a, maybe a third party, <laughs> everybody's well air circulated. Oh, so you have two people and then a ghost. And a ghost, yeah, the ghost helps out. Yeah, leave, uh, leave huh. room for ghosts. <laughs> I mean, is Grimace fuzzy? Is he what is me? Grimace? Is he I don't know. Like, is he like, I don't know, is he wearing like a, feel like a wetsuit? What's going on with Grimace? Yeah, Let's see what's going on with this master sword. I, I always imagined like slightly rubbery, but maybe a little fuzzy. All right, folks. Let's see. Here's, here's the master, master sword. sword. <laughs> Dang, that seems like a tough, <laughs> a tough thing to hold. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> All right, the Master Sword. They're going for a new look. <laughs> so it's like a radical banana cactus keyblade. <laughs> but again, like what I'm trying to figure out is where do you hold it? Oh, you don't. Don't, don't worry. <laughs> oh, I was going for like gyroid. Thank you. I was going for gyroid. Thank you. I see gyroid. I see you. Right right there. Thank you. There. <laughs> Amazing. So glad. It just floats on its own. It's like a spiritual weapon. It just like <laughs> it just spins. <laughs> Spectral Spin. sword. Spectral sword. You only use it to short shoot sword beams. <laughs> and even then, carefully. <laughs> you will cut yourself on that sword. <laughs> he is a taste bud. In which case, oh, too yeah. much moisture. <clears throat> no, I'm good. No grimace, thank you. I don't want... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> it's too late well, for this. Grimace. Grimace. I don't want Grimace. But then to, like, why would he be designed taste. with four arms? I, whose idea was it to anthropomorphize a taste bud? It's like he's your bud. He's your he's your taste. He's bud. your best bud. All right, your best taste bud. Best taste buddies. <laughs> really, probably not the worst thing that people anthropomorphized. That's true. <laughs> uh, uh. Anthropomorphization. <laughs> Sweating audibly. <laughs> <laughs> we had a lot of questions about Pokemon evolutions earlier. So. Oh no. <laughs> you <laughs> you no, 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 no. <laughs> I mean, I just want to know, like, what were Grimace's parents thinking, naming him after an awkward smile, mm. <laughs> or, or, uh, or, uh, you know. The village of discomfort. <laughs> Wait, in, in McDonald's lore, is Grimace like a bad guy? No, he's the homie. He's a good guy? He's your taste bud. Okay, the the, the Hamburglar is evil. Right? He is evil, yeah. He's a villain. Is he evil or is he just misunderstood? He's I thought all these I didn't even know there's villains in McDonald's. <laughs> maybe, maybe, you know, like... He's a trickster. The Hamburglar, maybe he's like a, a disenfranchised youth and he's always wanted to have one great McDonald's hamburger. Also, who voted for Mayor McCheese? <laughs> I just have a vivid I memory voted for Kodos. <laughs> of playing the McDonald's game on Sega Genesis and getting to a point where Grimace wanted all of my money and you could say yes or no, but if you said no, he'd just ask you again. And you had to give him you had to give him all your money. Street punk. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we're getting some. Uh, we're getting, getting some, some signals for a future, a future problem for future shadow. <laughs> a future problem. Something <laughs> like maybe a not very flashbacks. distant future. Problem. Yeah, same. same. <laughs> the sort of stuff that will get one kicked out of Zelda Thon if, if mistakes are repeated. These are way too fun. <laughs> right? This is so satisfying. Oh boy. We're getting some. We're getting some McDonald's lore. I'm starting to understand a little better what's going on. Uh, Dark Dark's got the the milkshake lore here. Mm -hmm. Who's the evil Grimace? If there's no conflict in McDonald Land, do they have like a, a a base of reference to understand their own happiness? Like, what are all the other like McDonald Land characters? Like fries and like. <laughs> Balls of fluff. <laughs> are you are you saying that happiness can't exist without some kind of evil sorrow. or sadness yes. or sorrow to counteract it? Yeah, exactly. Mm. Uh, they can't be truly happy. Well, truly, the true villain of McDonald's Land is obesity. Yeah, I was gonna say the true villain of McDonald's <laughs> Land is like <laughs> ten minutes after you finish your meal. 
<laughs> but no one in McDonald's land ever fights obesity. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that's why they stopped existing yeah, after the uh, Super Saiyan came out. Nobody knew it was coming <laughs> until it's too late. Oh no! <laughs> the menu. I'm just, I'm just playing too much Final Fantasy these days. That's all. <laughs> Does anybody have a, 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 like a birthday party at McDonald's? I think the, the McDonald's birthday party has got to be like one of the best outcomes as a parent, because like. Yeah. You you're you're getting uh, you're, you're getting off easy, right? Like super cheap. Yeah, you, you oh easy. don't worry, I'll buy food for everybody. I and got it's like you. it's like you know it's like five happy meals and you're done. <laughs> and then you go play in the play place all for like all for free. Beyond yeah, just that. go just go take a nap while they're all throwing balls at each other. Yeah, I remember a McDonald's birthday party I was at once and. Uh, we're up in the pay place, and for whatever reason, this like McDonald's had like punching bags in the play place. <laughs> <laughs> wow! And, and so another kid punched the punching bag, which then smacked me right in the face, and I got Aww. a bloody nose up in the play place. I, I wonder why they don't have those anymore. <laughs> so strange. <laughs> Dude, I was the worst. I kept on trying to go up the slides the wrong way. <laughs> oh, uh, there's no wrong way on a slide. Every kid can go there, both ways. There's the <laughs> oh, there's the um, going down, and it's and a speed run way. slide, and then there's the challenge slide. The true way. I definitely had birthday parties in those. I think those they're, they're those like massive, like they're, they're like McDonald's play places, but the whole thing is just the play place. You know? Sure, sure. Mm -hmm. Like, like, like a whole separate tubes. room. Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's not McDonald's. Like it's just like an institution devoted oh, to sure. being the a play place. Tubes. Yeah. Those are great. Oh, I miss those. I wish they made those for adults. I, remember, I think there was one in my town called like Totally Tubular or something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's Jungle Gems where I was from. Like, oh, like Jungle, no. Jungle, 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 Jungle Gems is a very like terrible restaurant where I'm from. <laughs> uh -huh. you know, I thought as as a kid, and I, I was so disappointed every time it happened. Uh, you know, you know, like the kids' clothing store Jimbery. Mm -hmm. I thought for the longest time that there was a jungle gym in that store, <laughs> and every time yeah. I saw it from the outside, I was like, "Mom, I want to go to Jim Marine. She's like, "I guess." And we go, and I'm like, "What's this?" And she's like, "It's closed." No. <laughs> it's closed. That's so sad. Like, I don't know why I had it so stuck in my head that Jim Marine is going to be this fun place. But no, it's a clothing it, store. It does suck. It, that's how they get you. Yeah. Like, <laughs> well, I mean, Jamboree, Jamboree, it's like a party. Yeah, well, and also like oh, gyms, so you do running things and stuff like that. No, it's oh, the size. We need Dan's notes. <laughs> no, I have. We need to find the secret. It's gym. the size of a large bathroom, and it's just, there's not a lot going on in there. <laughs> All right, back about hooking me up with the adult. Did you say it's the size of a large Great. bathroom? Thank you. Yeah. Like a really large bathroom. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, it's, it's like one of those small slice uh, like stores at the at, at the at my local mall, and it was like, all right, there's there's the cashier, and then there's like seven racks of clothes, and then <laughs> like, all right, nothing happened for the rest of the marathon. <laughs> oh, yeah. See you guys. It's been fun. And guys. nothing happened, but nobody came. <laughs> and so time passed. Can't be looked up what to do next. I just don't remember this part. I was right. Monica, will like people like kick us out if we just go to like I was doing the, the kids' yeah. place. So like, here's the game. You, you know what's the best part about being an adult? You can, not always will, but can <laughs> have money. And you know what money can do? Rent out a place that allows you to just fly around <laughs> in the, not, gym, in the not jungle not gym. <laughs> and the I laser tag. Maybe, maybe you drew it the other way. Maybe. You made a slightly <laughs> worse hour. <laughs> and you know what they're going to do? It, no. so, okay, to be fair, I thought you were drawing the number eight Let the last like time. Well, no, sometimes yeah. in this fight you have Great to drugs. make an eight because they won't count the corners. It's really oh. freaking yeah. stupid. Yeah, no, that's all. I was losing my mind. I'm like, I swear. Yeah, like I, I think you made the hourglass, but I think you drew it a different way this time compared to the previous time. Oh, okay. I looked, I just looked down, I was like, dude, I made an hourglass. <laughs> first one, uh, first one's well, last time you drew the right-handed hourglass, now it looks left-handed. So they accepted it. I'm having way too much fun with this. <laughs> right, though, right? It's so good. It's dangerous. <laughs> there you go. I get it. I cheated. <clears throat> All right, y'all. 
It's time for me to go to bed. Oh, oh that does sound like a good plan. I think. Rippity Ruda, or whatever. <laughs> All right. Well, whatever. <laughs> Rippity Ruda. <laughs> <laughs> Rippity this is why I know it's time for me to go to bed. Uh, yeah, but it was so much fun. The missing reindeer. Rippity Ruda. Thank you, <laughs> everyone. Hopefully, Thank someone you. will come and read donations. I'm sure that they will. <laughs> You got this, Good Dino. What? Let's go. go. Let's go. Let's go. Drink some water. Just did a radio. Hi, I'm here to read donations, but I'm also working on stuff for later. Pause. I'm also gonna see secrets. Well, I'm just gonna hold that. Alright, bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs> bye like, what is she gonna do? She's going to bed. Yeah. Right. You have a foot pedal over here. Yeah. What is this? No, that foot pedal is there. You have like ten foot pedals lying around. Why is none plugged in right here? <laughs> Because she'd be nasty. Get me out of here, get me out of here, get me out of here. Alright, chat. I woke up from a nap like 20 minutes ago. What's going on? Uh, well, an eight ball has decided the world's fate, including yours. Uh, but the outlook's a bit hazy. And. Mm. We've been designing a new Zelda game. Yeah, we, we have a new Zelda game coming. Ah, mm. uh, sick. Burns in it. It's a Miyazaki film. It's low budget. And it, we have. Tingle a, in it? We have a Cactuar Master Sword. I love Cactuar. We don't, we don't know stuff. if Tingle is in it, and we can never know because the Magic 8 Ball went to bed. You know, yeah. we, we might be able to uh, if somebody donates that as a suggestion for us to, true. to design. Design the new Tingle for uh, this game. True. And speaking of donations, the Magic 8 Ball said a lot of rude things about Zeldathon, that it wouldn't be incredible, and that it wouldn't be a success. And we need to prove it wrong by creating a lot of awesome donations. <laughs> So Jenny, have you raised at least four dollars? Um, Outlook Hazy, <laughs> ask again later. <laughs> yes. <laughs> then I'd call it a success. I don't understand this comment in chat about a fake tree. Where is there a fake tree? A fake tree? The fake tree that is not part of the backdrop. Like, it's What's a real tree. tree. I can walk all the way around it. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's, that's a real tree? tree? That's a real Are you tree? kidding me? That's real. Yeah. This is a real tree. I just 200? banged my head on the branch. It is definitely real. We're in a yeah. forest. Yeah. Look. 200 for the arm? I think put so. a couch Someone in the chat knows, right? 200 <laughs> rupees. Legendary Moon! I oh, love you! Oh. Never met you, but love your name. I think it's 200. Because I need the arm. Yeah. Well, you're not 200 covered, right? 200 I think, I'm pretty sure. It's either 200 or 300. Hmm. I don't remember. <sighs> Yeah, what does really the Magic cool. 8 Ball know? I'm not even sure the Magic 8 Ball knows what it knows yet. I think 200 is the max, I think. Oh. The Magic 8 Ball had a lot of very correct opinions about whether things are pasta and soup and lasagna. Yeah. And then, uh... And a lot of very, uh, non-answers about different people's romance and love life. And whether they're gonna buy a house or not. Yep. The Magic 8 Ball is not into real estate. The Magic 8 Ball is not into predicting whether or not certain Pokemon will have four legs or two. But it does oh. love the lottery. <laughs> <clears throat> it really likes getting more money out of you. <laughs> that seemed to be a theme with it. <laughs> yeah. But to be fair, we like that too. All 100% yeah. oh. of your donations are going to Direct Relief, who very much likes our, your money. <laughs> <laughs> Someone else say what direct relief is done. <laughs> what a Freudian slip. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, so direct relief uh, gives humanitarian aid and uh, sends medical relief uh, to over 100 different countries in all 50 US states. Does really cool stuff with uh, really hard to send medicines like cold storage for insulin. Um, it, They've been doing work in Ukraine a lot lately, um, dedicating over $10 million in aid to help people who are displaced there and uh, going to Poland to get free medicine, which is amazing because, like, yeah, when, when you just lose your home and everything, like, yeah, free medicine is extremely important. And, ah! and uh, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> so. Yeah. Among what? Them. It's in Hear Me? You didn't say chow. This one will be monster! Woo! Ha 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 ha
No. Now those are some pipes. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I was saying. We were talking earlier, we were just having a casual conversation. This is what yells yeah. into my ears as far as I can tell. <laughs> it, it was a bee, by the way. Get me out of here. Okay, I have to go to work. Have fun, everybody. Bye. 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 So yeah, pretty cool stuff. God, get me out of this loop of heck. Man, look at how much the postman involved in the Legend of Zelda lore. That was Cupid. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Hey, is, he's is, not the postman? No, is that Cupid. what Medley's race turns into? Yeah, Cupid. Oh Diaper my god. Like, oh, upgrade gosh. of the century. <laughs> Okay, where do I go next? Delivering mail gives you wings. I have to use Norby. the arm to get the piece, right? I hope that was rhetorical. What, me? Yeah. Where do I go next? <laughs> Dude, we're free balling right now. I think I have to use the arm to get the case for the chart. Boom. We're good. Let's go. All right. So, I mean, MC's here. He could say, "Yep, you're right." What? I have to. Yeah, get, you you've hundoed this game I have recently. To, right where this says, I have to use the arm, right? I don't know. Cool beans. <laughs> <laughs> how do you get to something under the sea? How? You want Wait, how do you use the arm? I have good news for you, though, Campy. What? Your shift is almost over. Which one? The midnight shift is here. Yo, it's the midnight, midnight. shift! Welcome, welcome everyone to the midnight shift. Congratulations, it is now late night Zelda fun. Wait, how do I dig? Oh. As, as, as uh, the game player during the midnight train segment, I'd like to first W Gamer. <laughs> Thank you. Very prestigious, very prestigious. Salvage. Yo, there we've we go. got the gamer hat. Wow. That's certified game right there. <clears throat> yeah. Now, everyone. That's a nice hat that Campy has. Would you all agree? Yeah, pretty good. I covet yeah. it. I'd good. buy that True for five dollars. Five dollars? <laughs> That's cheap. I'd buy that for a dollar. Everyone, for your five dollar donation, you will have your name or whatever you want written on it, as long as it is stream appropriate, written on a hat, and you can tell us where to put the hat. Preferably on a person, but we're also not Stream appropriate. Stream oh. appropriate. You no, can, no, no. I, well, you can tell us where to put that hat. So you can, you can put it on the pillow. I'm, or the cam. I'm really, really okay. uh, But so yeah, oh. submit your five oh, donations and we'll uh, put I the hat just on went back up. Also, the hats can stack. They, <gasps> they, they, hats can stack. They, they can go very well. I want to see a hat stack. Wow. It's hat time. I want to see a hat stack go so high that it goes off the screen of the camera and then we have to readjust in order to get them all the hats visible. <laughs> it's going to be like the dogs from Undertale. Oh. Oh, yeah, that game job. from seven years ago. Don't make you feel old. Seven years. <laughs> What'd you get? How old was this I game? Think this is what I got. Yo, is that your Taco Bell delivery? No wonder it took so long. <laughs> it's a little moist. <laughs> it's a Taco Bell delivery. That's relatively dry. Sunky! Sunky! Why are we so happy? <laughs> it's a game! It's my favorite key in the game. Sun doors and Madala, right? What? The sun door is back where the shovel island is, I think. You keep asking me these questions as if this was gonna be my game for this marathon. Did you didn't you play this like three months ago? No. Well damn. <laughs> Every Remember, Zelda MC, game, MC prefaced it with, I'm playing <laughs> the good Zeldas, mostly. The Secret <laughs> Moblin was a paper hat. Yeah, I right. wanted to have a paper hat. Secret Moblin, I can try to give you a hat, but it'll probably have to be put on the TV, but you need to donate five bucks. I mean, I technically, bucks. I'm on my last dungeon before I pass off. And before you pass out, too. Well, enjoy so the hats, true. folks. I think I'm going to sign Dude, off for the night. I got, I got cool. All right, thank you, Soaring. Have a good night. Get to eat them yet? Bye, Soaring. Bye. Oh, this is where I have to find the boss fight. That's right. Let me hit it again. So... Five dollars. Get yourself a hat. And put it on something. Put it on anything. 
within reason. Put, put it on Danny DeVito. I want to see Danny DeVito. Yo, Danny DeVito looks kind of cold. We should get him some this hats. Is the fight. Okay. And, you can, and again, you can write whatever you want on the mask or on the hat as long as it's uh, stream appropriate. See, see, uh, see all this hair that's exposed. You heard it here first. Don't need to put a hat on the tree. Oh, I think we have one coming in. I, I see one. That's a dollar. That's eight. That's a dollar. Right? Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for the dollar. Thanks. Happy birthday, MC, says Donkey the Dingo. It is my birthday! Yay! 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 Yo, can we get a birthday train? I can't believe... Di what was it? Donkey the Dingo. I can't believe Donkey the Dingo was the first person to wish me happy birthday. <laughs> happy birthday to you. Oh. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, and also metal and I like corn dogs. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. Cheese. <laughs> and many more. Thanks. I've I've never had Zolathon on my birthday before. <laughs> Aww. Well yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, we usually don't do it now. We're gonna have Zolathon on everyone's birthday. Where's my birthday hat? Yeah, Yo, so, oh, so, yeah, it's, it's officially my birthday, birthday so I, I, I can now uh, bring the stack of birthday hats over. <laughs> Let's just rotate it every year. So I, 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 I was, I was <laughs> just gonna have Dino do them since Dino can also see the donations oh, coming. Okay, that works too. Well, I have to do work. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> while, while you're doing on work, while you're reading donations. Work. Well, if I have to do stuff, you do too. So I'm going to spin this wheel, and I'm going to make you guys do things. Okay. I'm ready. Hey, Ooh, hey, 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 Oh my gosh. All right, where's the sh- Hi, Hydrate. Right. Uh, we, I don't- we, we, Yeah, we don't uh, bring water. It, mm. <laughs> Dino, uh, cover us, please. <laughs> hey, Jamie, you want to be the coolest guy on Earth? You want to get me some water in a small cup so I can chug it in my throat hole? <laughs> <laughs> that was such a Oh wait, are we are we doing a funny man fi fine donation as well? I know, I just funny man the donation. donation. Cool beans. There's multiple things happening. I think funny man wants us to donate $5. <laughs> Wants us to donate five dollars? Right, wants, wants chat to donate five dollars. Oh, we got lots of donors coming <laughs> in now. Get, to get past. Stop to what get I was doing otherwise. No, five dollars is higher. Mm. Okay, well, let, 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 let's let's focus on hats and then I'll, I'll cover that in a second. We have 1990 from TK Sony saying, Hi friends and happy birthday MC Yay. level up. Thank you. 2096 from MJ Evans saying, Try Fox on a hat please. Both Try Fox Fox's eye and nose and some sort of ears in the Try Fox word. But please get four hats for that 20. You want to do four for twenty, or one doing per? You may have it, but in the future, let's not try to let's let's keep it a little bit easy on our on our donation. Because five hundred dollars would make me be writing hats for the next twenty minutes. Yes, <laughs> and I'm I'm way too lazy. And, for that. and also use half of our hats <laughs> that, that we have bought. Anyone that wants, come everyone. If they don't, I get to pick. Cool. Anyone want? I want. There it is. Oh my gosh. Cool. Yes, yeah, throw me one. Me brain. K goes Kev with five uh, you, bag well, why five say Sure. And, and 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 maybe someone can help bring them in like that. No, no, no. Right, Zach, here is MC's first hat. Wait. <laughs> this is a hat that says old on it. <laughs> All right, Grandpa. You, you can thank Bagbot for that. Why did the lights turn off over there? <laughs> Everything's gone wrong. I'm old. <laughs> oh, wait, this is that puzzle. Happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday. Uh, I think the filter got this one weird. I don't see where it's, what was filtered in the text. But $5 from, oh, in the name, Speepo. Did you get the Trifox hat? Done, or? I, I, I'm, I'm doing the individual ones first, then I'll do all the Trifox hats. Okay. Do you have the systems? This is The ancient memes. Uh-oh. Yeah, yeah. Uh-oh. Wait. Steve! I, 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 Steve! Uh -oh. Steve! Steve! Wait! 
This is a hat that says number one Tom Waits super fan. <laughs> yeah! Thank you. Thank you. Who gave me this? That, that was Speepo. Oh, Thank my you, shovel! No, get me out of here, bro. I don't want the shovel. <laughs> I, I need to go give a hug to someone real quick, if you don't mind. I'll be right back. Five dollars from ONG. It's Monica saying this is for MC. At, it says birthday boy. Uh, thank you. Oh. Give some hats to other people. Yes, please. My head is barren, and I wish to not have that happen. I have been given a directive from your boss. Oh shoot. Uh oh. No, you're fired. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, but come on. Join right. us. Oh, let me, let me Join us. Is that a gamer I see? Few gamers. Just, just one. Oh, oh there you are. You can only one way. You have the entire crew right here, right? Hello. Bob, get me out of this. Hello. So, so, MC, your boss gave me a task. Yes. She wanted me to bring what we call the triumph task. Oh. Which is something that we do that the, the partnerships and philanthropy team at Director Leap does to, to recognize momentous occasions. Wow. And wow. I said, look, I've just got this one bag. I'm doing all carry on. I can't bring the Triumph hat. I will, bad things will happen to the Triumph hat. She's like, okay, let's make a deal. You must sing Super MC Gamer Happy Birthday. You have no other option. And so now I'm here, and I would like to ask everyone on the couch, including oh, Mr. Ooh, gamer over there, there, to join me in singing happy birthday so I can fulfill my contractual obligation to your boss. We already okay, had one, so but you know what? Let's, that doesn't let's, count. Let's, let's yeah, do this, it one, again. this one's not, con that wasn't contractual, so let's do it with more gusto. Okay, <laughs> more gusto? All right. So does that mean higher pitch and falsetto? Uh, gusto, Might as well, go for I, it. I feel Add like a little gusto, vibrato if you can. I feel like gusto is really something that is a feel-like thing for each individual. Yeah. And I think you have to do what just comes naturally to you. And if that's falsetto and libretto, then I think okay. that's where we're at. <laughs> okay. I got All right. this. So on the count of three. <laughs> You're the one, falsetto. <laughs> two, three. Uh, happy birthday! Whoever's on audio, sorry. Um, <laughs> th thank you, and, and thank and thank you, HB. Hey, that was not any worse than asking the eight ball questions. True. <laughs> Wait, yes, it was. <laughs> oh, might as well. Thank you. Ooh. All right. What a, Try what Fox hats. Try Fox hats for all. Try Fox hats. Oh crap. Thank you. Would you like a Try Fox Please. hat? Thank you. Also, welcome, Steve. Uh, you yes. haven't been here since 2016. That's correct. Wow. Well, welcome. That is a factual statement. I've been in chat almost every time, but this is the first time I've been back since um, 2016. Amazing. Yeah. So I'm Steve from Direct Relief. Hello. Hello. Hi, Hi, Steve. <laughs> Hi, Steve. I'm angry. <laughs> Hi, angry. But you're playing a fantastic oh, video. Oh, you're so yes. right, friend. <laughs> All right, that's it. Monster Hunter time. Let's go, baby. Get me out of here. <laughs> um, one thing I'd like to so so a couple things, everybody. Uh, uh, Funny man, I'm pretty sure this is the same uh, incentive that's going on. So there's a, a special second incentive on top of the five dollar hats going on, where I believe what Funny man is doing in the chat is, um, Funny man has the idea for a specific donation amount that we don't know, and it's currently doing higher lower. So when you donate, like for example. The ten dollars was just donated. Funny man said in the chat, lower. But we know it's higher than five dollars. And so if someone donates the exact right amount using this information, that amount will be multiplied. <laughs> and multiplied by five? Multiplied by five. And wait, then matched by Google. Wait, is this another hat? It's so another hat. Really for you? Multiplied by Does ten. it say Mick Gamer Day on it? <laughs> yeah. Thanks. My hat stack is being I, so I, powerful. I'm bad at stacking hats, apparently. Um, you you have to put it inside, not yeah, outside. Yeah, you should take it. Okay. Steve's been here before he knows this going on. Okay. Steve's a pro. Do you know what that hat says? Questionable? <laughs> Questionable? <laughs> All right. Abby was from Orem Morgan. 
Uh, MC Gamer Day was from Palm. Um, Spirit Zelda has questionable and tank 10. Thank you. Keep and then a $5 donation from Unnamed that says, for Abra, cutest psychic type. But Aww. does it say what they want on the hat? I, I guess cutest psychic type? I don't know. <laughs> so far, well, I can't that was in parentheses head. to describe Abra. Oh. Uh, oh. I, I will. I will draw Maybe. an Abra has that. <laughs> Hang ten. Oh, that works. <laughs> Congratulations. Surprisingly appropriate. Yeah. <laughs> Get out of here. Where are we? Brooke, you seem to be having. Oh, a, maybe it is supposed to be two to strike type. Because I have not. They just sent another one saying for Rom Scout, Frank's hot red hot sauce is too spicy. What? what? <laughs> Frank's red hot is too spicy. Yeah, this is a, this a joke? Hat. Is this a meme? Am right, I everyone's making fun are of these, uh, now. Are these provocative questions? Questionable. <laughs> Provocatable. Questionable? Although, okay, you know, I, I've I'm never heard of this hat, by the way. The, this direct relief hat. The Triumph hat? I've never heard of this before. Well, MC, as it turns out, there's an inner circle that yeah. someday you'll become a part there's of. There's like an Illuminati. I've been working at this <laughs> for five years! <laughs> 35 years! He's worked for like eight times longer than me. It's true. Do you know about the Triumph hat? No! See? Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, I think it's one of those things that happens. I think it's actually been packed for a while because of COVID. All right. So that makes sense. Drinks red yeah. hot, too spicy. But no, with, now we have some deep lore, MC. The next time you visit the office in person, we need to request a, a viewing. A viewing of the Triumph hat. In fact, I think there would be probably good cause for the Triumph hat. Dawn? Yeah, what is it? When you, uh... Dawn? Yeah. Did it have a dawn upon you? It's starting to look like a chef. <laughs> oh no. Sorry, mm -hmm. I... Wait, what? It has to be perfect. Oh, thank you. And by perfect, I mean truly perfect. <laughs> but there. Oh, oh, okay. So Thank you. you there is my two second four. drawing. Yeah. Cutest psychic type. What a good abra. There is an incredibly low, low bar for me yeah, to compliment yeah. something as oh, a good yeah, abra. Yeah. <laughs> so, every abra is a good abra. Okay. Pull the one okay. top, top of bottom. Hey everyone, we have a goal. Yo, oh, hey. what's the goal? Yeah. It's just been snuck into my ear. Um, at $6,250, we will call in a lumberjack. Are they okay? Oh. We will call in a lumberjack. We we hear there are some trees that need some uh, some some attacking here in, in the in the Zolophon world. Uh, huh. So we will call in the finest lumberjack we've ever heard. So if we could get the goal added to the system for six thousand two hundred fifty, the lumberjack. Oh God, please! This, <laughs> that'd be great. Has my head gotten bigger? I can't fit all these hats. I swear these hats have gone smaller since Inflation 2019. has destroyed the hats. <laughs> so then, in order to get closer to the lumberjack goal, we can start guessing numbers between 5 and 10 with your donation, with in your donation amount, and see if we can get closer to a funny man's secret number. You know, donating $7.50 would, you know, kind of help figure out, because that's where the middle lives. Yeah. Y y y all are the difference? I see a bunch of people who are mad that the thing that, that, that this tree is about to be chopped down. I didn't say that tree. I said there's a lot of trees, so we're gonna lumberjacks gonna do some work. I mean, lumberjacks aren't just cutting down trees. They are arborists. They are preserving the good and ensuring that the trees grow healthy and strong and do not yeah. fall on. Well, but but when you cut the tree down, it's no longer growing. No, but they they. I mean, if they see a tree that's looking sickly and like, it looks true. like it's gonna fall on other good trees. You gotta sweep up the forest sometimes. I, I mean, we'll plan a new one there. Don't Brooke, worry. you can verify. We're in an entire forest here right now. This so entire marathon is being conducted from a forest. Yeah, the the dense forest of Jupiter. Yeah. Square crystal. Where the heck? I was, was, getting, I was getting where the wild <laughs> thing are. By. Didn't you just look this up? I got to this part, and then everyone kept asking me questions. <laughs> It's only four hats in C. What's the problem? Oh, we're here. Okay. <laughs> the, the, the problem is the base does not conform. 
I'm not dying to this guy. Welcome to Good Burger. Home of the Good Burger. Can I like corn dogs donated twenty dollars for a birthday oh. hat for oh, MC on. Metal Corn Dogs and their friend Altiami. I did die to him. Oh, Probably Tiami. Danny DeVito. He was the closest. Wow. Big birthday day. <laughs> it's okay, we're not done. And that's it for my queue, but you know what, what? I still do have a queue of? Wheel spins. Wheel spins. Wheel spins. Oh boy. Watch that circle evolve. Whoa! Are you getting hypnotized? I already am. Oh, thank God. All right, couch, yeah, this is mine. Couch nap time spin. Good night, everyone. I'm up. I'm waking up right now. I'm trying to get done with my part so I can pass it up the thing. Who's this for? There you go. It fell off. I have a large head. On God, we'll need the map. <laughs> All right. Good morning, everyone. Good nap. Uh, is the Pokemon Direct uh, are, are, you, are you gonna go get an actual nap soon? Uh, it's still only 9 p.m. He's pretty time, sure they've so. shrunk. Okay. I was hoping to get an actual meal sometime soon. Did they buy the oh. child size? Uh, across the street. Uh, the, the, across the street, there's, a, I'm sure, a lot of food. Yep, in many different places. Yes. Jupiter has there's lots many of foods and many places. <laughs> Ju Jupiter somehow is more populated than Mars. Can you believe it? <laughs> I can't believe it. It is a bigger place. There's, bigger there's a really good ice cream place across the street. Just saying. Is that on there's ice Europa? cream in many places. We're further from the sun, so there's a lot of cold. Very true. Plot on the course. There's so many YouTube poops that I did not reference there, but saying flat of course. Thanks. <laughs> this hat's <laughs> down! <laughs> yeah, you kind of have to break the hats in. By the way, that was Darth Plagal saying nothing, but they split the 5 to 10 down the middle. We now know it's lower right. than 750. Wow. And Palm with 631. This is Team Math Hour. Last time it was Team Brute Force, where just you increment it by a penny and try again. I mean, yeah, you have to time. like. I mean, so this can, does slide out a bit. But, like, you can split it in the middle, or you can just guess That's a random like number. It's, it's between five dollars and two six three one. Problem? Well, you have to make more headroom. Headway. This looks disgusting. Everyone, campy. my hat stack is being is being uh, evolved and changed before your very eyes. <laughs> is this an arm stack? <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> Sleeves. Soon, soon it will be. Be an entire. Yo, we're arm making. Cannon. This is how we make the new Zeldathon hoodie. Dude, I pressed. Oh, oh my God. Speaking of new Zeldathon hoodie. Can we make Max Headroom right, Abra? I have a VTuber, yeah, no. There's that's going fine. to be a Zeldathon hoodie? Tell it's me more. It's right here, I'm wearing it. Oh. I'm, so, I'm so in the loop. Check me out. Check it out. Check it out. <laughs> oh, whoops. Oh, Check I've it out. This. I've actually seen it. It looks awesome. Yeah, and, and if, you, if you want to get one over on our merch store, uh, uh, proceeds benefit direct relief, so. Mm -hmm. And you get to pick the color. So I got like a navy blue, but it looks good in white also. Also looks True. good in the black color. True. I had too many black sweatshirts though. That yeah. was all my closet was, so I decided to go with navy blue, which <laughs> almost looks the same on camera. <laughs> I think navy blue, is, if you're a suit fan, navy blue is absolutely the safer choice. Mm -hmm. As much as I like a nice light, you know, like a white or light colored sweatshirt. Can't eat soup. I, yeah, I'm, you know, I like to cook so everything gets stained. <laughs> oh no, can see my hat. Uh, am I required to wear No, this? my hat! Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah the, you, you're required to keep it on your person at the very least. Okay. You, you, you can turn it into bracelets if you so choose. You know what trees are made from? I'm sorry, I'm about to do a Hats? exact segue. <laughs> okay. Uh, trees are made from paper. You know where paper comes from? Or, Money. Wait, I said hats are made of paper. Whoa, That's what I meant. Whoa, whoa. I just messed this up. It's even more Zach like. So, you just got here. I know, right? <laughs> so do you know what? Do you know what hats are made of? <laughs> They're made of paper. You know what? Where paper comes from, paper grows from trees. So if you want to see some paper made, maybe from a very talented lumberjack. You should donate so we can get to $6,250. You know, yeah. we, are, we are really much in sniping distance of that 6 k somebody wants to get us there, they very much can with a very generous donation. I saw a comment when the Lumberjack was brought up originally. I was like, is this going to be the great return of Cletus Cornstarch? Who's that? But, uh, <laughs> who, who's that? Cletus know. Cornstarch is one of the most legendary figures in Zelda history. Is it an Eric character? N no. Oh. <laughs> that was a good guess, though. Right. Yes. Okay. 
Maybe it will be. O only time will tell. Who is, okay, but who is Cletus Cornstarch? Man, you gotta <laughs> check the lore. It's so you had to be there. You thing. expect me to read the lore. <laughs> you expect the lore to be written down? There's, I'm sure there's <laughs> lore. Okay. I mean, if, if I mean. If you don't know who Cletus Cornstarch is, press one in chat. <laughs> wow, I can't believe the entire Twitch chat just pressed one. Cletus Cornstarch <laughs> is, is an infamous character played by Zach Teep, who, uh, <laughs> as per his name, you might realize he is a outdoorsman. That's all we I know mean, about him, really. <laughs> <laughs> like all Zach characters, they are a mystery wrapped within an enigma. No, oh, I missed it. I thought I was yeah. supposed to shoot. MC, right? I need to know. Yeah. On the goal wheel. Yeah. Has the cheese slap returned? No. Absolutely not. Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> but for the right amount of money, <laughs> anything can return. Can I, I don't even know what the cheese slap is. Can I, can I share my deep lore? Hat? You can share your deep lore, um, but, but I'm going to add an amendment, uh, uh, <laughs> amendment at the end. So, 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 so you share your, your, your deep Zeldathon lore. So at Zeldathon 2016, Summer Zeldathon 2016, I attended for my first Zeldathon ever in person. And much as I am right now, the representative well, director, I, I got super into the stream. It's a great opportunity to, to meet folks on couch and chat everywhere. And I got really caught oh, up. Push, My name got added into the goal wheel rotation. The, and it was spun and cheese slap came up. Now, I was familiar with cheese slaps from videos of, I'd seen of older Zeldathons where yeah, a piece of like Velveeta was put in someone's hand and then they were slapped. More of a caress across the cheek. <laughs> that was sort of what I expected was going to happen. Little did I know that that was not going to be what was happening. And I knew that this was actually the case when they brought out the black plastic bags <laughs> that they had turned into uh, basically Dude, ponchos I that I was going to wear. Yep. And then they put plastic down on the floor and on my legs. And I'm like, what's going on here? And they're like, well, Steve, you thought that this cheese slap was going to involve a slice of Velveeta, but we've kicked it up a notch. This time, it's going to be bacon cheddar cheese whiz. <laughs> huh. And Lizardu, bless her heart, filled her hand with an enormous pile of bacon cheddar cheese whiz right in front of my face. And, and she was into this assignment, which was slap the guy from Direct Relief. And so, <laughs> as she whacked me, and that, that unmistakable pastiche, that aroma <laughs> of, of cheese whiz and bacon, cheddar, as, it, as it, it's the sting of that, I feel like I can still feel it somewhere deep in my pores, that there's that bacon cheddar cheese whiz. So, knowing that that is now sort of off the menu, I breathe a sigh of relief. Now, you see, it's really funny that you mentioned that because <laughs> Uh, I got your PTO notice. Oh, yeah. your, your your out of office notice, which which mentioned uh, saying you're going to Zeldathon. Yes. Tune in if if you want to see the possibility of me being slapped by, by cheese again. I'm pretty sure that wasn't in my PTO notice. Oh, I'm pretty sure it was. <laughs> something like that was. I swear. Something I something that I read into your message. Mm, I think you unconsciously wrote it. <laughs> I won't read it on air, but I am going to confirm that I'm not going crazy. It might have been a message that someone else on the team might have sent. Oh, was it? <laughs> that hit me for real. <laughs> Sleepy. He fell down like a sleep. He did. <laughs> Took a big nap. The biggest. Yeah. Anyway, so if it were to happen, I wouldn't complain. But if it's not going to happen, you know, that's a uh, that's a little less PTSD I'll have to live with. I mean, how far is Jupiter from Wisconsin? You can complain about cheese all you want. They're not going to get you in time. <laughs> Post traumatic cheese. Yes. Yeah, you know where cheese comes can from? I, can I read you your, your own words? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> not, not I am giving her it a says, death glare okay, she uh, started. <laughs> from, from, from one, Steve. This year's charity beneficiary is once again Direct Relief, and I'll be there as an entertainer. Their words, not mine. On behalf of our organization, I'll be speaking about the work, answering questions, and oh, possibly so getting slapped with bacon cheddar cheese whiz as part of a donation goal oh, again. I, it's all coming back to me. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is the depth of, 
of the experience for me. I've actually blanked it out. <laughs> so, so do you want some cheese whiz while you eat your words? Um, <laughs> um, maybe, maybe, perhaps later. <laughs> we have six days to cover. There's <laughs> plenty of time for even worse things than cheese was to happen. Oh. oh. Yeah. <laughs> Plus, we have just under four hundred, or just over four hundred dollars. To, to raise to, to call in the lumberjack who may or may not be Cletus Cornstarch. <laughs> I hope it is. I've never met him. <laughs> you want to meet Cletus? <laughs> I don't like that name. <laughs> <laughs> makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> I knew it was in that. I was, like, I was like, when you said no, it wasn't, I'm like, where did my brain no, summon when you, this? When you started reading, I was like, oh no, I did write those words. <laughs> yeah, you just got leaned into the bit. Yep, yep. Oh man. Yes, if it's my destiny, MC. I this is your it. destiny. Well, you said you got that from a wheel spin. I did. And you, you were would... just mentioning some wheel spins. We earlier. do. We do have two left. Oh no. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know, they left it in there. So, uh, Smoople says Cletus Cornstarch has been out in the woods for like Clean three years. Area. He doesn't know what's been going down. Clean it's up the area. Okay. Clean up the area. What am I supposed to do with this oh, here, wing nut? Not... <laughs> is this yours? That yeah, probably is. Oh, okay. Goodbye. Yeah, no problem. You're supposed to... Never mind, I'm not going to say that. I'll put it in my pocket. <laughs> what does this one say? Oh, I have a lot. Okay. Do we actually know what this wing nut is too? I'll uh, probably go back to Dan. Oh. Lowpoke is a gamer, donate six dollars, saying you're never far enough from Wisconsin to give cheese takes safely. <laughs> Wisconsin will find you. You know, my family's all from Wisconsin. Oh, I, they will find you. I, oh. I agree with that statement. Have they ever uh, had there's a cheese beer over... soup or whatever it was called? Apparently, uh... the special donation amount is between six dollars and six dollars and thirty-one cents for that. Uh, ten times match total. Getting closer. Brooke, are you having fun yet? I'm having war flashbacks. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen We have a lot of PTSD going around this this couch right now. <laughs> this touchpad is killing me. <laughs> Man, I can't even talk because I have not got my donation filter or my double phone filter in my brain yet. Yeah. Uh -oh. And so I'm like, oh, I should say this, and I'm gonna know. And then either Ron stares at me or I catch myself. And <laughs> um, <laughs> hey, I, just because I stare at you doesn't mean you have to stop. It was very disapproving. <laughs> um, I have a little bit of stuff to prepare, um, so I'm going to bequeath uh, old to you. What? Birthday boy to you. I am not a birthday boy. Gamer day to you. <laughs> and the most precious of all my hats, the number one Tom Waits super fan hat goes to you. <laughs> Enjoy being the number one Tom Waits super fan. Can I guilt chat you, into donating? How do you wear this six, many hats? I know, mm. right? Oh, remember that book from when you were a kid where it's like, like they're all guy falling off my head like, anyway. So the guy who wears like a hundred hats. Oh. All, this one will be a bracelet. <laughs> Um, but can I guilt chat into donating? I have worked so many hours on this lumberjack segment that you should really donate. <laughs> <laughs> but it's true. Like, we have been doing so much tree I... construction over the past couple days. No import... spoilers. They must I... donate. I will say, she was continuously I... growing trees from scratch, taking I care of them as so babies. Do you into know this giant tree? Do you know from how much like bone meal yesterday in the morning until now? <laughs> All I speak is tree now. The skeleton mob grinder has been completely cl uh, clip uh, clean of bone for the bone meal to make these wow. trees. You have the most epic hat. No, <laughs> you're all hat all the time. I hope I'm doing this I'm just right. feeling my inner tree. You have a lot of hat going on. <laughs> I'm just becoming a tree. If we keep adding hats, will it turn into a tree? Possibly. Because trees are made of paper, correct? Yes. We established that bit of deep lore earlier. Trees are made of paper. <laughs> yes. Not only that, but if you keep donating to put hats on me, 
you may donate enough money to call the lumberjacks. Yo, that means donate to Zeldathon? How can they do that? Go to donate.zeldathon.com. What? <laughs> I have to escape too, but I will be back. All right. Okay, well, can I tell the story about that picture? Literally, Jiggy was like, this was at like, I don't know, after midnight last night. I was really tired. And Jiggy was like, clink it. Can you, I was like, or I was like, Jiggy, I need to show you one thing before I go to bed. And we, he's like, okay, and he comes with me. And then he starts talking to Luke and Grant. And I'm like, Jiggy, I need to go to bed. And, so, and then he kept talking to them. And so I just went to sleep on the floor <laughs> until he was done talking to them. <laughs> yeah. All right. And that's the last time you slept. And that was the last time. <laughs> <laughs> I was kind of protesting. I was like, fine, Jiggy, if you won't talk to me right now, I'm just going to go to sleep <laughs> right here, right now. <laughs> head cannon confirmed. Is this a head cannon? Just a reminder, yeah. we have a 31 there. cent range for Funny Man's secret number. Yeah, oh. you can cut that down in half by donating $6.15. If I was a six, betting... 16, uh, or six dollars fifteen and a half cents. <laughs> oh, round up or round down, depending on what your currency conversion is. If I was a betting woman, oh. I would guess... Are there any funny numbers that start with six dollars? Yeah. With like a six? It's lower than like... I can't think of anything funny. Six, no, it can't be 69. Six dollars and nine it's cents. More than that. Oh, six zero nine? Okay. I mean, that's a little <laughs> abstract. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing wrong, because I thought I was this puzzle. <sighs> I have no idea what this lumberjack segment's gonna be, but yeah, I'm seeing I feel it. like I need to stay awake for it now. <laughs> well, that do I didn't think that had anything to do with it, but maybe it does. No, this has nothing to do with that. Oh. oh. But I thought you needed a door. There's, no, not for that There's multiple stuff coming up? Oh my gosh. Start I planned my shift! <laughs> I love my shift! <laughs> I would have planned more for my shift, but I had okay. a Delta episode. MC like literally planned a lot for his shift, which has how many hours left? The we hat, just hat stack was 12 to 1230, Three by the way. Hours. Three and a half hours for, and oh, are we on that, schedule for this stuff? Already? Or do we have to, are we on schedule? We, we, we got to get those donations oh, in to I've, see everything? I've been awake a while. <laughs> I, didn't I know mean, <laughs> that, your, your answer is supposed to be yes, MC, regardless. Yes. Yeah, MC has so much planned, guys, and we need to donate to I did not plan a Lumberjack segment. However, we should do that. You know what? I did plan a Lumberjack segment. Ah. I can't believe you. Lumberjacks are real. <laughs> so true. Lumberjacks are okay. Usually. Unless they're named Cletus, apparently. <laughs> they work so I just right. don't like that name. You know what else is okay? This donation from PTR Bob that says, Oh no, I, I left it. my Zelda on. Oh. Oof. Oh, my God. Uh, uh, uh. Ah, ah, ah. By the way, um, I think Stone Money updated all these computers uh, on setup no, day. No, that was they Skippy. Oh, was it Skippy? Give credit where credit is due. Skippy spent, or oh, Skippy updated all these computers uh, setup day. Up they took the all day to update. Guess what computer now has six updates ready to install? Mm. Oops. Uh, probably not social media or tech or any other computer you're not on right now. That's a good guess. <laughs> I'm gonna guess the donation station computer. <laughs> I'm gonna click remind later and hopefully it doesn't remind for the next six days. <laughs> That is a setting. True story. The day before, I think it was the day before setup day, we had a little like director powwow and we were like, oh, what should we plan for setup day? We're like, we need one person to update all the computers. We're like, Skippy. So true. <laughs> this really did happen. <laughs> true story. <Yeah>. Skippy. 
He was the old, well, besides me claiming Melvin Kurt and Duck, those three were like the only three that were like truly claimed for setup day. Right, left. get me out of this. And then MC almost got locked in the pod. And the what? The pod? Why? Yeah. He, please, he almost closed it on himself. Please do not contain your MC. They must be free range. Do you like your trees free range? I'd be so claustrophobic in a pod. <laughs> oh, so true. All right, my everything's like falling apart. I'm sorry, chat. This game Damn. sucks. <laughs> I, I was about to say, I'm starting to see why this is like the most beloved Zelda game. <laughs> oh yeah, the highlight of the franchise, Ocarina of what? <laughs> this is actually a Phantom Hourglass marathon. This is literally a game about collecting sand. That's gonna be you our next it to be good? I, I just really enjoy that you and MC had to get the two best Zelda games this marathon. <laughs> <laughs> we don't get to play our games. <laughs> okay, hey, but hey, Spirit Tracks is a quality experience. MC originally wanted to play this game. No, he did wanted to play this one. But instead, we gave him <laughs> But he got tracks. the other one. <laughs> In a way, they get what they want. Man, I can't tell my game because I don't have, I don't, even, I won't even care anymore. <laughs> So what are we playing? Power. When we do a Phantom Hourglass theme marathon, can we just call it Zeldathon Sand? Yeah. <laughs> of course. <laughs> We're gonna be playing your game, so when are we playing Resident Evil? Uh, right now. Okay, turn it off. Resurrections, Resistance, whatever the one's called. Alright, this is the boss. That's a crab. And I think I have to just shoot its pimples. As you do with all pimples. Ah, so this is how you cure dermatitis. I think that's it. And then I have to hit his booty hole. Uh-huh. I think so. Okay, chat, what if I told you that the Lumberjack segment will expand the couch setup right now? Oh, I, I thought you were going to say, like, expand your horizons or something. I mean, well, that, 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 that's true. Too. That's true. Does that make it more exciting that you want to see it before I go to sleep and I think I give up on this segment? <laughs> because guess what? This tree is only a piece of everything. Don't touch Wait, it! Wait, trees more. grow? Yes. It, I mean, I, I do have to admit, I have seen like a forest we, in this dude, the place. boss was so free. Holy cow. We did it. We're, uh, we're literally almost done with my segment. <laughs> Unless Dan wants me to do the... That was way smoother than the last Wait, you're, boss. You, you went ahead of schedule? Am I ahead of schedule? I don't know. Yeah, you've got another half hour. Let's go, Dan! <laughs> Whee! What? I'll chop this couch in Why half. was that boss 500 times faster than the one before it? Okay. Well, I think it's because I literally missed one bomb on the, oh. the second phase. Oh, okay. And then it goes into the third phase where it doesn't go over a tornado as often. Is that the equivalent of getting the Master Sword? This? Yeah. No. It, it, Usually we split games with the Master Sword. So no, it's this is... Um, it's, it's an hourglass. <laughs> no, it's not, not it, sure if you noticed. No, master sword. no this master is... Master glass? <laughs> no, you get, a, you get an hourglass sword uh, at a point. But no, this is where you get on to the whole point of the beginning of the game, where it's like, yo, we gotta find this ghost ship, and then it's like, yo, we did it. End of the game. <laughs> and then it's really nice. Yeah. Oh, so you're getting the fake ending. Yeah. Okay. There it goes. Wait, this isn't Spirit Tracks? Yeah, Wait. that's the preview of the Lumberjack segment. <laughs> yep, congratulations. Would you like your hat stack back? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, with extra disgust. <laughs> I mean, I'm being. So yeah, we are we are looking for not a secret sound, just an amount between six yeah. right. and six dollars thirty cents. Someone guessed six oh nine. Someone guessed six oh nine. You can find it in like four donations. Someone guessed six oh nine. Someone I'm, guessed six oh nine. I'm just gonna give you a tip, everyone. You, you can put this on me if it's wrong, but I've known Funny Man a long time. I know in my heart it's 617. Dang. Wait, is that what his number is? Just, just go for it. 
Wait, where am I going? I, I will match it if you get it wrong. Oh, Don't no, it's worry. Hermione that's six months old. Oh, well, That's right. Well, it's Funny so Man also. You're saying right now, if 617 isn't going to get matched by Funny Man, you will match it. Wow. Yeah, just because I I messed up. If you're going <laughs> to guess. <laughs> well, I'll match a donation. <laughs> yep. I will match 609. Oh, so we got a couple of mounts you can match. Abra, which one are you going to match? Oh. <laughs> What's your call? I'll do. I'll. I'll. I'll, I'll be risky. I'll do six point three, because sixty three is Abra's oh, dex number. Oh. I like one dog at six seventeen saying, "I'm trusting you, Ron Scout." Here. All right. What do we got? What's the verdict? Lower. Lower. So that, that, that counts me out too. All right. Well, well mine was going to be six twenty-eight, which is two pi. Yeah. Well, I, I just got counted out, so that means I got to donate. Yeah, I'm, I, I got donate it. too. And I donate even if I'm right. I am That's about sure. to be at Why ghost not? ship. Probably. Six MC. oh nine. MC, I'm about to be at ghost ship. I don't know. What does Dan? Hey, ghost ask Dan. That was the plan. Yes, goat ship. I can do. I can figure out either. Just let them know. Let let them know that I'm at goat ship. Okay. Does anybody know how to make these lights on for Yeah, you have to use the app. I don't. No, I don't think I will. <laughs> well, then they're not. No, going. they should be able to. Oh, okay. now they're No, on. they should. I, I was like, is my internet connection bad? No, my phone typing is just. Horrendous. Um, you might have to reset them, like press the, like Please do the don't reset, reset them. Please them, because yeah. then you have to reconnect them. Actually, I have the app on my phone, because these are my lights. One moment, please. What would you like? <laughs> are they I think you would the like them on. on. Are they connected to the same network as before? Because that, if not, you have to reset them anyway. Well, we, we reset them when we uh, Tech oh, Desk okay. has used the app. But I will put on, I need to get on the right network, though. That's true. Uh, Tech Desk, I think one of them is still off. Give me a moment. Oh, they got it. They're good. Oops, that's not the right password. 609! Well, that's my donation. I'm getting there. Is there something you would like on your hat? Do you want me to do ghost ship? Uh, um, yeah, just put the word Aber. If you want to. If you don't want to, I can. I'm about to literally be on. Um, I can. I'll pull up the guide and just okay. walk it through. It's. Uh, the fight is I have to follow the one that shoots the ball, right? Yes. And then the lasers, and then avoid yeah. that. Okay. And it's four, right? There's four of them? There's four of them, yeah. Okay. Here, I'll, I'll be chilling here, so if you need any help with anything, I can try to remember, I can help out. 6'10 yeah, from Gossip I'm Stone. remembering. Ever? Dang, bong bong, time is now 8.45. Thank you. Okay, let me... Okay. Just the word Abra. The Elgato. Oh, yeah. Would you like a hat stack? Sure. This was Clinkett's. Was. It fell yeah, off. it was 609. Oh, rats. Uh, did, it was not a 609. There was a 610 in there, too. Oh, there's a, no, we have a 610. Wait, uh, wait, is it lower than 610? We don't know 610. 609 and 610 was sent. 609 was sent? I don't remember a 609. 610 happened. Lower than 610. 610. We had oh. a 609? I missed it. We had a 630. We have not had a 609. Zolathon is the Zolathon channel is so, saying yeah, it's 609. Yeah, it is it, it it is within 10 amounts. It is clearly 609 at this point. <laughs> There's no other option. Wait, did someone guess 608? No. No. <laughs> Dang. I mean I like how our hats are slowly like tilting Whoa, forward. Oh no, I forgot that I have to <laughs> We're, we're really getting like, like, who will, who By me, by oh, me, yeah. no 609 yet. <laughs> Sorry, this is taking so long. I'm just very Sorry, bad I'm at saying. using phones, turns out. Yeah, out of here. Hey, 610 is the name of OC's cat, it's true. Wow. 610. Mm-hmm. Pinky. Get me out of here. Where's line back? First of two mandated Jolene fights. 
Jolene. Jolene. True. If someone don't. Oh, wait. I might not have to finish what I just said. If someone <laughs> don't. <laughs> Yay, Perry, thank you. We gotta get that lumberjack boat. Please write 609 on the hat. We got a 609. 609. Who wants the 609 hat? And a 608. And a 608. 609 lower, what? Wasn't 608. That means you gotta donate, that's 609. No, 609 was guest, it was, oh I do, you're right. Yeah? You meant me, not Who wants a 609 hat? I, I think have you have to put it up in the corner, it. right? Well, I just threw it as you said that. Oh, okay. Uh-oh, my battery's gonna die. Can I donate before <laughs> How much battery time? I have, I have 51 minutes based on my usage. Wow, these are small. I told you, they're for ants. <laughs> <laughs> That's the first thing everyone who puts on a new hat has said, like, why is it so small? You have to, you have to loosen the back and make it wider. I don't think any of that loose make will make that fit my This head. is as perfectly circular as it gets. All right, we also have a 608 for my like corn dogs. All right, if this isn't it, I think I know what it might just be. What is it, corn dogs? That wasn't it. I got your slate. Oh, thank you. Nice. <laughs> That's all that matters. <laughs> you're, you're a blessing. These hats absolutely do not fit on my head. 606? 606 from Ethan. 606. I should go into first person mode here shortly, right? We got it! Nice. Woo! Yeah, baby! 606. Kaboom. Answer was 606. And after an hour, I finally was able Isn't to top left recover the ability floor? to donate. Yeah, it's in like the top <laughs> left. And that was also 604 for another check with hashtag team math. And Rom Scouts 617. That, that took so long for me to donate again. I oh, forgot how to use a phone. <laughs> That's how tired I was. That was Rom Scout That's saying, sorry, I was wrong and don't know how to use a phone. <laughs> What's the thing? Is that one? I just put an N. Yeah, I go Nintendo, but backwards. Well, if I'm to go through this part again, I have to do the loop de loop and pull. Yeah, and then I think like whenever you enter the area, like you get the first person mode, and then you, you get the, the fairies. They yeah. they show up and you. And there's Plinkett's match. Indeed. We are now less than ninety dollars away from six thousand. Six K, and if you add that less than ninety dollars to two hundred fifty dollars, you get slightly <laughs> more than three hundred dollars, which is how much it costs to call in the lumberjack. Woo! I'm, not, I'm trying to get it. I really want to go to sleep. Can we please call in this <laughs> Oh, we did it. First person mode. Rat. How? Um, fairies. There they be. All the girlies. Squad. They say, I will whisper sweet nothings into your ear, and the sweet nothings are me telling you where the ghost ship is. <laughs> <laughs> I will blink vigorously. I just took damage in first person, mode. Get out of here. <laughs> hey, the, the, uh, the teleporting over to that island, I've never done that before for the ghost ship, and that's way faster. Yeah. I always just like... Oh, split. no, that's what I was like, I'm not doing the loop-de-loop. -loop. <laughs> I'm out of here. I always yeah. have... Well, whenever you go to the ghost ship, you don't have to do like the whole pathing, yeah. but it's, it is annoying like going through all the rocks and stuff. Spooky, scary skeletons, speak with such a screech. You'll shake and shudder in surprise when you hear these zombies shrieking. Uh. <laughs> 
31 dollars and 10 cents from funny man 3595 saying congratulations to ethan for finding the right amount here is my half of the match nice spooky scary skeleton and there's six thousand let's go Who else might make that sound? The lumberjack. Maybe. <laughs> Does, do lumberjacks make that noise? I can't confirm. The sound defense with $90 and one cent. Thank you so much. Saying, let's go beyond 6,000. We've done that. That was a great excuse to yawn. Have you met this lumberjack? No. Look at this lumberjack. <laughs> when I think about him, I feel whack. So true. He, that's why he has black. Thanks, Google. Boy, Thanks, I hope Google. they aren't gonna betray me. Wow. Do we have a secret sound that's not very high that like exudes the the spirit of a of a lumberjack? Of a lumberjack. Spooky, scary skeleton. <laughs> I, I, I thought you were gonna say exudes the spirit of sixty-two hundred dollars. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the vibe we're looking for. Yeah. One of my top Do five favorite exactly search now. engines, Zoop Google, donates thirty-one dollars and ten cents. Do we have a secret sound that costs approximately three hundred and ten dollars? <laughs> I need check. like a hundred ninety dollars. God, get me out of here. What's the secret sound that's closest to whatever the math is to get us to $6,250? Oh, let me out of here. The boomerang is the most rancid thing. This whole game is <laughs> ratchet. This is the most ratchet game. That last dungeon he did made me sick. Just mm. looking at it. Oh, the, the Temple of Courage? Yeah, like just the, yeah. Invisible, the invisible nonsense the whole time. Oh, yeah. The invisible bridge is rancid. Yeah, and then the touchpad's just like, hey, I'll go left. Yeah. Out of nowhere. Oh, yeah. There he is. Mr. Steal Your Woman. Here are some wonderful secret sounds that would get us there. Are they lumberjack? In, in the spirit of lumberjack? Don't, you're, uh, you're being way We got too country up. roads. <laughs> there that's, it is. No. No, no those are, that's, con that's like prairies. You want, like, forest. But what about country the THX roads. sound? Have you, you ever met a lumberjack? Western Anyone? Virginia. <laughs> I'm from Seattle. <laughs> the, there's How, a big wait. difference between <laughs> They have trees in Washington? We have a lot of trees in Washington. <laughs> I'm from the Pacific Northwest. I know a thing or two about trees and also ferns. Exactly. <laughs> hey, the double raid coming in. Now, how about these raiders? Do you know anything about lumberjacks? Welcome to Zola <laughs> Don't talk to me unless you've seen a man like rip a log in half with his bare hands. <laughs> Not on TikTok. <laughs> okay, what other sounds do we have? Uh, when I when I think lumberjack, I think tad tones. Tad tones? Like tad yes. tones. That's a little abstract. So, so Actually, hear me it's out. Very hear me abstract. Out. Very abstract. Trees. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, trees! Right, okay. Everyone give it up for trees! <laughs> it's not even one in the morning! <laughs> it Almost feels like morning. five in the morning right now. I love it until I went this game. Just kidding. But really. Yes. Uh, Alright, Klinka, it's your turn. Going back to Quantico. No! <laughs> not Quantico! <laughs> you know what? It's no, I threw it off the ledge! You know, but speaking of Quantico, you know what's in Quantico? A lot of trees. And a golf course. The Quantico's there too. Every Marine's paradise. No! <laughs> yeah, you know, they turned off the gas. They turned off the gas. All right, real quick for the for the raiders coming in. Want me to explain what we're doing, or does anyone on a couch want to talk? Because I, I apparently can't say more than trees. <laughs> okay. Hello, welcome to Zolthon. I'm playing Phantom Hourglass for the last like ten minutes. 
But we're here raising money for Direct Relief. Direct Relief is an awesome humanitarian organization that not only specializes in disaster relief, but also sends out medicines to all the healthcare clinics that are supported by in all 50 states and over 100 countries around the world. That's a lot of countries. That is so many. A lot of people still say 80, but I'm like, yo, dog, 100. <laughs> Count them. <laughs> we got a lot of flags. Oh, I jumped. Um, she's scared. Direct Relief's very own Drew. I hit, bro, get uh, out of Drew, here. Drew, Scout, whatever right you like calling me. me. Uh, he works at Direct Relief. You can talk a little bit more about Direct Relief. Well, um, as I was talking earlier about, uh, they have been helping in Ukraine with getting people uh, who have been displaced and having to move to Poland uh, free medicine. There's a 10 million dollar grant dedicated to that specific purpose and a lot of important medicines that are hard to ship like insulin which requires cold storage um, you know like EpiPens stuff like that like there's just all kinds of very specific medicines that people need and it's very hard to get them when uh, you don't have your normal health care uh, resources so yeah that uh, same kind of thing being done with uh, the Kentucky flooding um, Working with health clinics out there to help get all that same stuff uh, out. It, actually, while this marathon's going on right now, the, all that medicine is going to be shipped out there. So you you'll probably be hearing about that within the next couple of days here. So. Yeah, we, we we got the information that we're assisting, and right now the warehouse is packing up, making sure we get all the correct information, and that's important. Is the correct things. Uh, that these clinics need and the communities, um, they send requests. We don't send anything without them knowing uh, what they need and everything like that, that everything is important and gonna be used. So donate now. All right, and, and we're, we're doing a roll call at this point, so. Oh. Lumberjack lady. I'm not a lumberjack. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly not. <laughs> Sorry, right, lum like, lumberjack summoner. I do like <laughs> trees, and I do make trees. Like, literally. This, if you want to know how trees are made, well, they're made out of paper. <laughs> 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 but my no. name, hi, my name's Clinkett, and I make trees. And I, and I really want to call the lumberjack. <laughs> Please donate. <laughs> donate, Lumber. and we will call 1-800-LUMBERJ. <laughs> Hi, I'm Starmy. You can also call me Dan. Um, and I'm going to be running the second half of this game, and Campy is doing a wonderful job. Everyone, please clap. Thanks. I feel warm. Hey, your name is Starmy. Guess what? That's a Pokemon. Guess what? I'm a Pokemon. I'm Abra. I stink. <laughs> We've all been awake show. an extremely long time. <laughs> anyway, we are here raising money for charity, and I'm here to... It's fun! I sometimes stream... I don't know. Who's reading donations? Hi, I'm Dynamation, and I was just told that they're gonna do something on Challenge Cam. They didn't tell me what it is, but it's something. Woo! Something... Does that mean we're going to challenge cam? Let, let's go to we're challenge going to cam. Challenge cam. Oh, okay. I don't have that power. <laughs> um, that's probably because all the producers are yeah, either on the couch or challenge. We're, we're literally all right here. Yeah. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Yeah. Well, so you see, you see my, my, my high tech technique for for when there's an unexpected transition, and we don't know if the, the mic's on yet. Is to say hello four or five times, so that way one of them gets through. That's the key word, so they know. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, it can center a little bit. No, MC's the star, not, I'm not here. Oh. Hi everyone. Today we're gonna be uh, doing one of my favorite activities here on Challenge Cam as part of our midnight train. Uh, going nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> so true. Uh, it doesn't involve this shield. This shield is just a cover for Lego. That's right, it's time for Lego City. This is the uh, 60283 oh, Holiday sisters. Camper Van, uh, which is an excellent set that I've never done before. Um, I'm going to open it here. However, I'm going to explain a little gimmick. Uh, I'm going to put on a blindfold, <laughs> and uh, 
my friend Jackson here is going to help guide me through the process. Jackson will have the guidebook. Um, and Jackson, why don't you tell them how they can make it more interesting? Well, Lego is already interesting enough. You don't have you don't have to reinvent the wheel. Lego's already done that. However, if you feel the compulsion to add some excitement to this arrangement, a simple donation of thirty dollars, thirty U.S. dollars, Ooh. will will empower me to create some roadblocks for this city camper, to create some obstacles for our beloved leader here to uh, overcome. And I'll just uh, give MC Gamers some, you know, some challenges. Life is full of challenges, isn't it? Yeah, so $30 incentive is uh, challenge, yeah, <laughs> challenge MC in various ways. It is called Challenge Cam, isn't it? <laughs> so true. Let's, let's make it live up to its name with the City Camper Van. So, well, for now, I will I will assist MC Gamer as much as I can. I'm gonna open up bag one because that's, <laughs> that's what we do. Um, yes. And oh, the small bag part. This our small part. Per, 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 perhaps one of our friends could maybe uh, alert me or some way to if a thirty dollar comes in. So I. The Jackson, we have a donation. It's from OMG. It's Monica. Guess how much it is. Is it thirty dollars? It is not. It's nineteen eighty six. Come on, don't slow roll me like that. Okay. Jackson. Yes? What are we doing? Well, right now, okay, let's skip the part where we build the uh, build the minifigure. We can skip, we know, we, we know. Wait, we no, know. I want to try, oh, oh, oh. Okay. Is this, this, this is like a wheel part, is what this feels like to me. Well, do you want to start making the characters that will be in this camper van, the family? Oh, is there more than one? There, uh, there are three members of this family. Let's build one member of the family. That's a good start. So. Okay. Well, we, let's build our, our character, which will be a hair piece, a head piece, a body, and uh, and uh, allegedly some legs. And now there are a few options, but just pick. Is this a head? I feel like this is a head here. That is a head. Okay. This is not a hair piece. That that is a a two by one. Is, is this Lego speak? I don't know this stuff. Okay. What's, what's our what's our nomenclature here? Okay, wait, where did I, I've already lost the head. I'm gonna hold on to the head so I don't lose it. Oh gosh, this is actually really hard. I've never done this. I've seen it be done before. You can do this if you need my help. I, I'll, I'll I'll coax you if you if you need coaxing. It, do I have a general idea, a good idea of my my vicinity in terms of the radius? The pieces are in front of you. <laughs> hey, don't get hey. You gotta start somewhere. Help me find the body. <laughs> <laughs> like this is a stand by me? Yeah. Okay. Move to the right two inches. Move to the left one inch. A uh, little bit northward. Uh, ooh, what do you have there? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's put this head on. Call the police, we found the body. Uh, there we go, perfect. Grand. Uh, legs, let's see. Maybe the, the legs will be near the body. Probably not. Lieutenant Dan, you don't have no legs. <laughs> I actually watched that movie for the first time. Uh, just uh, not so long. Oh, legs. <laughs> it was it was uh, quite entertaining. They don't have to go on the perfect way. Just get, you know, just do a little good enough. So yes, thirty dollars will make this more interesting. And also, uh, Campy, let me know when you're done, done with your segment so we can give you a proper applause. Applesauce. Applesauce. All right. You said there was a hair piece involved? There is a hair piece, but you know what? Ever since Michael Jordan and Stone Cold Steve Austin, bald is just fine. Okay, how do they look? <laughs> Rough. But you know what? Life goes on. All right, let's put them... There. <laughs> All right. I'm just trying to find another heart. Let's go, where are we going? Hmm. All right, so the vehicle, oh wait, oh, there's, there's actually a sure meal. There's like, you make a little stove with eggs. You? Oh. Are you hungry? Sure, is that the first step? It's, it, it, yes, it's only, it's only three pieces. <laughs> so, um. Okay, describe it to me. Okay, one is a head-shaped piece, but it is red. However, uh, there will be other head-shaped things, so just find something head-shaped and either we'll be cooking on a stove or on a human skull. <laughs> okay. Oh, is this like supposed to be the gasolina tank or something? It's like, a, ga no, gasolina is a song by Daddy Yankee from 2005. Oh, okay, Pro propane? No, it'll be, it'll be a headpiece 
and then a circular with one uh, nubbin, should we call it. A stud? Is it a, a stud? A stud. See, look, talking the language. A stud. My boy. A stud piece. My boy. Wait, that's $30. <laughs> yeah, it is, isn't it? What's going on? What was that? No, it's not, it's not, it was Clinket. Clinket's just What? <laughs> wow, she's fast! Did you say something about a lumberjack? <laughs> I mean, you'd be, a, you'd be a lumber Jill, technically. I'm not a lumber Jill. Lumber Jane? Stickers. Not a lumber Jane, I don't know. Wait, ooh. I'm a lumber... Where is it? I don't know. Yeah, Gamer, <laughs> it, it's, it's near your Apple Watch. It's near your Apple Watch. Wait, what oh, wait, what is that? It's wet here! What did you do? <laughs> is it? Is this? Is this one of the pieces? Oh, it is. That's that's the base of the uh, of the stove. It's wet. <laughs> yeah, you only need like hundred. Why is it wet? It'll cut. It'll, it'll must come right off. Is is it good to like wipe on my shirt? Yes. Okay. There's nothing da nothing dangerous. I I don't know that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So thank you for the assistance. Yes. Okay. So put the head on the base piece if you if you don't mind. What head? I haven't found that. Oh. Okay. Well. <laughs> Well, uh, look, look leftward. Look leftward. There are actually two options. It's still wet here. <laughs> actually, that, that, that's a hair piece you just had, so... We... Wait, the hair piece? Oh, no, Is it... There are two hair pieces, actually, so we're going to have some fun. Hold well, on, I'm going to put this hair piece on this person. Yeah, you're close. You're close. There you go. Look at that. Do you need the puzzle numbers? Is it two, four, five? Beautiful! Two, four, five, one, three. Yeah. All right. Head. It's still wet. <laughs> Why is wet here too? How much wet did you put on? That's weird. Here, I'm taking. I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna help you out and get you your, your up your oven piece. Buy your Apple Watch. <laughs> Everything is by my Apple Watch. This is the game. Ah, this is not wet at all. <laughs> it's a little slimy. Why is it slimy? Wait! <laughs> MC Gamer, we have a whole set to build here. Could, do, would you what? mind? <laughs> okay. is, is this correct? It is so far. One more piece, uh, which actually a, which is, looks like a unique sized piece. It is a frying pan sized piece. It is a frying pan piece. Have you seen a frying pan? I assume it's over here in my small pieces section. You're close. Yes. Oh, you have a finger on it. Down. It is a circular what? with a with a Why with a small rod working? coming out of it. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. There you go. Oh, oh. Try it from the other direction. Oh, and the, there, is, there is in fact a, uh, there is in fact a... It's so slimy. Why is this... No! It's so... It's so slimy I can't hold on. No! Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll help you out. I'll help you out. It's, it's, right, in, it's right under your fingers. Close, Remember, closer, chat, don't make your you. Legos too slimy. Closer to you. It's by it's by your uh, your betrothal band. I, I tried to figure out what a betrothal band was. All right, we're back in business now. Where did that frying pan go? <laughs> it's still wet. <laughs> under under your right wrist. There you go. Our family is eating. Be All right. Behold the stove. The okay. Stove. Okay. Now let's go out to the vehicle, shall we? What do you say? Oh. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, twenty, fifty. There is a long sixteen by two piece. Okay. And they. <laughs> I was about to say what color, color is it, but then I realized. It's... That that is it. That that's our base. So to that. Oh boy. Okay. There's a four by four with a little wheel stud. Wheel stud. What do you mean? A, a little stud? a thing upon which you can you can oh. attach a wheel. You can shove a, a wheel. A four by four, though. It's it's a. It, oh, I'm sorry. It's a two by two. Excuse me. I don't know this Lego business. It's a two by two, a skinny two by two, or a narrow one. Flat. Flat. Yes. Thank you. Flat. Ah. Flat two by two. This is not. Wentz. Move 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 left toward toward the center of your of your pile. There you go. A little north. A little north. Oh, left. Whoa! What you got there? You feel, you feel that? Ah! Uh -huh. Isn't that nice? Nope. <laughs> you didn't tell me where to put it, actually. Well, uh, put, put it put it at, at the end of the long piece. Yes, just like that. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, reverse, reverse it. Reverse it. You mean like? Yeah, rotate it 180 degrees. Yes. No, 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 no. Uh, have it be flush. Oh, so you want it to be hanging off? Yes, the edge? exactly. Yes. 
And now the oh. other one, the other one mirror that. Exact, there's, the, there's another one? There is another that same exact piece, yes. Okay. Um, hey, hey, chat, thank you very much for being here. Remember, a donation of $30 to charity will make something happen that I do not know. I please, truly please do moisten know. our Legos. $30 and something very... Was, 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 was the stove the same thing as the w previous wet? Well, MC Life is full of mysteries. You yes, know. Uh, you're yeah. fair, fair point. Where is that two by two wheel piece? A little, little north, little northward. Yeah, yes, very, very close. Go to the left a little bit. Ooh, what have you there? <laughs> oh, look at that! You've, you've got, you've finished step two. All per right. Perfectly, I might, I might say. Okay. Okay. So now we need. Now we need a six by eight flat. Oh wow, you got right on it. There you go. Is that it? Six by eight flat, yes. And also a one by two one by four flats. Do, do I set this aside and then? Uh, yeah, set aside the long piece. Okay, two, two what? Two one by four flats. Two one by four flats. Two one by four, that's a Too little. Too long. That's a little long. Too long. Too long. Sorry, yeah. I'm gonna die. That's okay. Two. And you'll get there eventually. If you need two, there are two, exactly two of these. I keep finding these. These are like six, I think. Yes, slightly. I'm gonna put. I'm gonna put. Ooh. Slightly yeah. elongated. Ooh, flat and smooth. Okay, there's there's one. Wait, no, I didn't get it. There's one. Oh no, that's that's not sorry. That's a smooth. That's smooth. I'm wearing the nomen. What is this? This is an earplug! <laughs> Wait, did they mute donation sounds so I don't know when they come in? And, oh, and, no. And see, we, have, we have a vehicle to build. Okay. $30, everybody. $30 to direct relief. Relieve yourself directly. Okay, one by four. Okay, I, I hear. I, I'll, I'll, throw, I'll throw you a bone. I'll throw you a bone. Where are we walking? Oh, what's that you have? Oh, right, no, uh, there, ooh, how big One is that? One by four. One by four. Yes, don't worry about placing it now. Just just have it have it there. Now, another another one by four, for example. Yes, look at you, look at you. <laughs> okay, all right, now, if, if you could grip the long piece that we had before, if you can find it, it's under your Apple Watch as everything. All right, now put put a single one by four directly behind the two wheel spoke pieces. Yes, centered just like that. Now put the six by eight directly behind behind that, centered. Like this. Yes, perfect. Good. And then and now, the one by four after that. Look at you. Yeah. Oh, look at you. This is not a one by four, is it? it, it is that good? Yes, it is. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Now now, now now we'll put them all. Uh, uh, tighten them all, or, or secure them. They're good. They're happy. Okay. Now, if you now if you would, uh, we need two more of those spoke pieces. And spoke. So, oh, it's two more of the same spoke pieces. Of the, of, the, of the two by of the two by two pieces with the, with with the stud. So, if you would find a find a couple of the <laughs> find a couple of those. If you don't mind. Be gone. <laughs> Foul spirit. Be gone, earplug monster. Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh, I hate how sticky it is, Jackson. Why is it so sticky? <laughs> oh, no. It's all right, MC, it's all right. It's all right. Nothing, <laughs> nothing dangerous here. Nothing I know nothing dangerous. <laughs> Yes, you have one. You found it's one. It's sticky. You found one, didn't you? Oh. <laughs> correct. Uh, yes, exactly correct. Yes, I'll find one, just one more, and uh, do the do it likewise. Look, that's a. That, that. Why is everything so sticky here? Why indeed? Everything is so sticky. My fingers are sticky. <laughs> Look, this and it feels like. It feels like 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 like, like hand sanitizer, but that you left out in the sun too long. <laughs> <laughs> okay, look look more, look more centrally, directly in front of you. Yes. Oh, you're very close. You're... 
It's so sticky. I can't tell if it's the pieces or my fingers at this point. And I feel like I'm going to feel this all night. I'm going to go to bed. I'm going to wake up and I'm going to be like, I can get it. Sticky Legos. I'm sorry, Sticky Lego. <laughs> okay. So uh, you, made, you made it to step five. Can you believe it? Yeah. So this will only take about seven or eight hours. Okay, so you've got that. Now we need another one by four flat and a two by six flat. A one by four, uh, a little lengthy. A one by four, <laughs> if, you, if you don't mind. Working on it. Oh, wait. Two. One, by, one by four what? A one by four flat. And? A oh, two by oh, six oh, flat. Two by six. Two by six flat. <laughs> These earplugs are making me feel something. Cause like, they're like, cause like, at first it's like, ooh, this is a little bit squishy. And then I realized how round it is on the end. I hate it. <laughs> two by six, perhaps? Two by six indeed. $30. Like this? Uh, no, not exactly. Remove that two by six, if you would, and put put the one by four. Oh, what's one by? One by. <laughs> Here, I'll th I'll, th I'll throw you I'll throw you a bone. I'll throw you a bone. What's that under your ring finger? What's that? Uh, the other ring finger. This ring. This ring finger. Oh, ooh. index finger now. Yes. Now put that where you put the two by six. I hear the boss. Oh no 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 no! Closer to the yes. And now put the two by six on the on the end there. So it's like hanging out a little it bit. It sure is. And now there you go. That's a nice chassis. That's a chassis. If I <laughs> That's what my my RV sounds like. All right, MC Gamer. Now we must go a little bit smaller. This may be slightly. Why are you standing? This may be slightly. Sit down. <laughs> no. Okay, MC Gamer. Well, um, you're gonna need a one by two flat. But uh, actually, I'm gonna help you out with it. I'm gonna push it right here for you. Unfortunately, uh, due to shenanigans, they have been stuck together. Wait, the one by two flats are—they're not supposed to be stuck together. No. <laughs> I don't have a brick remover tool. Thirty dollars. $20. So, so the patient sounds have been muted then. Well, don't, don't worry about it. Everything's going to be okay. <laughs> no, they're not. <laughs> here, MC Gamer, here. I'll I, I help you. I'll help you. Will you? Yes. I'll help you. He's going to put another one on. Are you trying to get them apart and you're now realizing how difficult it is? Especially when the pieces are... Thanks. All right. Wait, they're still stuck together. <laughs> you just said, let me help. And then you, you did something and then nothing happened. You handed it back to me and nothing changed. What do you mean you helped? <laughs> See, well, I'm here for emotional support. Aren't, I, aren't you being helped emotionally? No. Oh, wait, the eggs are a sticker. The what? Okay, oh, what, I'm sorry, we'll deal with that. The eggs? We'll do that later. Okay. What do you mean eggs? We should, we should probably... You have eggs here? We can probably... Oh, no, 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 it's no. <laughs> okay, on the stove, the frying pan should be should have eggs, but it's a, it's a sticker. We can save it for the end, for the, for the flavor of it, you know? Okay, okay, well, I, I, I'll, I'll, I'll... I'll try. I'll try a little bit more gingerly. A little. Yeah, bit. You, 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 you may have made a grave mistake. We have no brick remover in the house. Well, well I, 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 I am the brick remover. <laughs> wow. How do you do? How do you play with these things? This is the nice. I use the brick remover. Well. And I don't cover it in lubricant. Well. <laughs> well, you play your way, and I'll play mine. Where are the stickers? Why are you blue? <laughs> okay, perhaps we can skip this step for, for right now. Perhaps we'll come back to this. <laughs> oh, hey, look at the gamer. I think I, I, I found another one by two that we can uh, use, use, in, use in its place. Uh, 
Here you go. Here you go. Okay. Okay. So now put that on the dangling dangler, on the bottom. No, on, on the on the bottom. On, uh, flip flip the hook. Oh, yes. underneath. Okay. Yes. There you go. Cool. Okay. We're we're get we're getting there, aren't we? We're getting there, ain't we? Okay. Now we're going to need MC Gamer. We're going to need a few pieces. We're going to need a pair of two by two flats. Two by two flats. Two by oh, I love those pieces. Two, They're like one of my favorite Lego pieces. Yes, two by two flats. It's it, it feels so sticky over here. The stickers. The stickers. Yes. The stickers. <laughs> I really want them. If you if you feel so inclined, wait. It, where are the eggs? There's another baggie here. Oh! Congratulations! Wait, that means Campy's done! Well done, Campy! Yay! You did it! You're my friend! Good work, Campy. Campy, where are the eggs? <laughs> and your mum. <laughs> I think you'll no. <laughs> That is That is true. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Late Night with Silverphone. <laughs> You have to go to the, you have to go to the scary door. I know oh, exactly okay. what this with is, because Zach yeah, yeah, was yeah, walking yeah, around yeah. like earlier going... <laughs> MC Gamer, we need a pair of 2x2 two two flats. Oh, you can jump across those as well, by the way. No, yeah, I'm Think not more middle, that. think more middle. <laughs> left of the stickers, yeah, a little... A sticker. Yeah. We have left of the stickers that I can't... Out of here. My pinky hurts so much right now from holding this. I bet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, out of here. Next. Woohoo! Woo! A pair of two buttons. Well done! Congratulations. Dan's got the hard part. What time is it? It is uh, 124. 124, yes. Oh, 24? Okay, so so this will be a good time to wrap yeah. it up here soon. $40. To Lego time. Being hey, for me, getting through this, $40. Someone right now, boom. Yes, yeah, so, so, someone, can someone give Campy some congratulations? 40 bucks. Congratulations, $40. Gamer, look left of your eventually. Apple Watch, if you don't mind. She's stoned, and we're skipping. <laughs> Story? Yes. Absolutely not. <laughs> no, no, keep Boom. looking left. I'm you, out of you, here. You have your hand on it. A little yeah. north. A right. little north. Thank you very oh, much, what's, everyone, what's for that? joining to Direct Relief Dan. Good luck. Have fun. Yeah. This game sucks. And, it, and it's just as much as you, you remember. Thank you so much, Campy! Woohoo! Hey, wow, we hit the amount! Wait, we hit the goal? About yeah. yeah. We're doing lumberjacking. What lumberjack? Water and 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 water well, here, let me let me finish the, the, this piece, and, yes. and then we will summon the lumberjack. How about that? Yes. Okay. Uh, so I hope the lumberjack is ready, because let me finish this. Where do we put this piece? Uh. We'll hold. We'll hold the weight. We'll. We'll. Uh, well, here, actually. I'm in. What are you doing? You, you need. To, you need to put it in the center of the table. Oh no, what? What is. Is this a sandwich? Wait, this is. This is a Taco Bell menu item! <laughs> Thank you, everybody! <laughs> what? It's a front trap? <laughs> well. Where's my vision? It's, it, it's, the, it's the end of our segment here, everybody. Uh, oh, now, now where's that dang lumberjack at? I need some tree felled. Why didn't you just shove that in your pocket? Don't talk to me. No, fine. Where did the lumberjack go? Oh, hey, person. Thank you, MC and Jackson, for that wonderful Lego segment. Wait, no, no, no. Keep the camera over here for a second. Oh. Bring it back. We're not back. Go back, Hunter. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. Thank you for your donations. Now, if only we could find that lumberjack. 
Hello, who are you? Hey, I'm Zach from the internet. It's been two and a half years since I've gotten the opportunity to appear on one of these programs raising money for charity. And throughout the last two and a half years, all of us have learned new things and discovered new hobbies, you know. Maybe you learned Spanish or Swahili or personal banking. Or maybe you, uh, maybe you learned how to draw or write or sing. I chose to engage in my hobbies, destruction. And when you work really hard in a certain line of work, and you get really good at it, you learn to play to your strengths. Lower, Zach. And you learn to get lower so you're in frame and play to your strengths. And that means that you have to know when you can and cannot do something. MC, you couldn't build whatever that is in the state you were in, right? Wait, or did you? Is that it? <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a chassis. Yeah. All right, well, hey, yeah, that's, that's what you need. We have a chassis over there of a tree, and it needs to be felled. And I know just the guy for that. <laughs> it wasn't you? It, was, it wasn't him. Uh, I gotta switch cameras? I'm in danger. <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> Guess we'll see who that is soon. Anyway, how you doing, Dan? I'm doing pretty good. I have to remember how to how to get around. Excuse me. Oh my goodness. I was touched. Welcome back to Outdoor Living. I'm Cletus Cornstarch. <laughs> now, my friend Zach, he let me know that we had we had a foreign object in our midst. And we have really, really strict measures we take here to prevent foreign objects from entering our sacred body. And that's why I'm here, to take care of this problem once and for all. Now, chopping down a tree doesn't have to be that hard, but it's also not always that easy because you need a lot of manual strength. You need a lot of automatic strength as generated by your object. And you need to combine those forces in such a manner that you successfully fell the tree. There are four seasons. You got spring, you got summer, August, or autumn, and winter. And it's gonna be a long, cold, hard winter for this tree when we take it down. Just like this. And this is what we call the kill shot. <laughs> you didn't even see that tree. That tree just happened to exist and then was killed. We'd like to welcome our newest member to Back Couch, Tree. <laughs> tree. Two. <laughs> so now that that chaos is slightly, slightly done, uh, I'll go through those donations that we got. Uh, I got thirty dollars from Dino says, "Huh?" Thirty from Nemenya. Thirty from Guy. Thirty from Abra. Uh, Nine twenty-two from John Wee saying, "Guess who still hasn't gone to bed at a reasonable hour?" Huh? <laughs> None yeah. of us. Uh, Forty dollars from Hades saying, gotta see that lumberjack, and 2291 from Hermione, saying, I haven't heard this sound, I don't think. Ayo, zelda on day one. Do Ayo. Ayo. And with that, they have all been read. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hi. What's up? Who are you? Hi, I'm Stormy. I'm doing the second half of this game. You can also call me Dan. Welcome in. Hi, hey, Stormy. Who Who's next you? to you? I'm Abra. You could also call me Abby. I'm sitting here, contemplating my existence. It's yeah. it's late night Zeldathon. And your disembodied voice for the night is Dynamation, who's... For the night? Does oh. that mean I have you to 8 a.m. shift? I am actually 4 to 8, so... Yo! I think I'm on tech, though. Kinda hype. Nice. Uh... 
but in the meantime, should we talk about what all those donations people donated could potentially get them? You mean prizes? Prizes. Whoa, I can't believe that you could win things so, at Zeldathon just for donating. For day one, we have something called Prize Block One. Ooh. Look at all that cool stuff. I don't know what's in it. I could look at the website, but that sounds really hard. Just look at it all. That's the stuff you win. I see I see a mask. I see a scarf. I see I can't see more Key than chains, that. Keychains, Zelda sticker, uh, a rupee, a moblin, or a mini bin? All, all, the, all the stuff's on the set. I've seen it all. It's all super cool. That mask you can actually attach to your face, and then you can see um, you, you can see people. Mask of Truth replica, root pour stationary pack, bow goblins and link. Amigiri dolls. Plus, Plus more. more. Thanks, Tech. T T tech is um, compensating for my laziness. Uh, so you donate $20 or wow. more during day one, cumulatively, and you enter to that. Donate $50 or more. You have a bigger list of stuff. Got a big old hammer. Got a big old Nintendo Switch. Got a big old neon LED uh, Majora's Mask light. Big old copy of Skyward Sword HD. Play on your big old Nintendo Switch while swinging your big old hammer at your big old neon light. We legally have to tell you, do not swing that hammer while playing Nintendo Switch. That thing's 36 pounds. It is very heavy. And $50 or more during the entire marathon. We'll get you in that. Neat. All right, I'm going to uncover you two, because this, this image is in front of you now. Oh, no, I'm uncovered. Woo! I'm back. They've been exposed. Man. <laughs> I've been exposed. Um, I honestly am astonishing myself, even already, you... with, like, how much I'm remembering with this game. I think mean, you are astonishing, so it's like, you know. <laughs> I'm like... It's been a hot, hot second, but honestly, God bless. Okay, wait. Oh wait, no, I need this. Yeah. Is this so, the Temple of the Ocean King, famous Zelda dungeon that you go through 20 times? LMAO, unfortunately, I'm crying and dying inside, but I'm also thrilled to be here, so. <laughs> nice. But now we have to get around this big scary man. Where is he? He's a fast boy, though, so we should probably be able to just kind of... No, he's literally right there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Absolutely stunning. Um, you got him. And then I need the... Oh, I need to get the key off of that man. I have to hit that man with the boomerang. Mm -hmm. Ooh! Yo! That was, a, that was a little noise. You know what else did not get hit noise. by a boomerang? Is this donation from Nightmare? Behold, tree two, electric boogaloo. $11.18. Oh, oh, wait, actually, oh, this is good. Oh my god, he's so fast. Oh my god, he's so fast. He's zooming. He's got the, so quick. I think I have to shoot him zoomies. with the... I have to shoot him with the bow. Right in the butt? Yeah. All right, we have a question with this $5 donation from Soup. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. What is your most controversial opinion about Soup? About Soup? Mm. About Soup. Um... Hmm. Panera Bread's a decent place to go to. Ooh. I know Is that a couple controversial? I know a couple people that are adamantly like, no, find a real sandwich shop. Ooh. I think, I mean, yeah, I could see that. There, there you go. Our controversial opinion about soup is about sandwiches. I think my controversial opinion about soup is that, um... I think not enough people appreciate cold soups. Like, there are soups that are meant to be eaten cold. And I feel like there should be more appreciation for those. I've never had a cold soup, but I'm interested to try one now. They're pretty good. Do you have any cold soup recommendations? Um, honestly, not off the top of my head, but I know that there is like, there is like some, it's, it's common in like, uh, Korean food. Hmm. To have like a cold soup. I think that happens sometimes. 
You could also just kind of let the ice cream sit out and it turns oh, into oh, a cold no, soup. No, no, no. Very true. Oh, did we not want a portal there? No, we really, really didn't. We oh, did we really, just leave? We really, really super didn't. We're back at the beginning. We have to do that over again. Is this the famous Temple of the Ocean King that you do 21 times? <sighs> okay, we'll right. talk more about soup. So. Well, maybe we can do it faster now. Because ice water. Soup or not? Mm. Ice water? Um. Uh, no, ice water is a beverage. Okay. Or a drink, sorry. A beverage is something you have to create. A drink is something that you can, is just like one ingredient. Mm -hmm. But there's two ingredients, ice and water. But the problem is- They're both they're, water they're, though. They're, yeah, they're both different states of water. So it's only one ingredient. What there's if I have a cup of milk of that I put ice in? What if you what? I think that's still considered a drink because it's just like, like the ice is like- All right, all right, that, like that's a, fair. You can drink soup, but that's not its intended way of consumption usually. Um, I <laughs> I read this post recently where um, people were talking about, um, somebody was like, I put, um, I carbonated my my milk. <laughs> oh, carbonated milk. Oh, and God, like, I heard about like, that tragedy. Congratulations, you simulated spoiled milk <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> by carbonating milk. Have you ever wanted to accelerate the aging process of milk? It's pretty simple. Yeah. Now you can do it at home. Try it. Try it with your family. <laughs> Put milk in the soda stream. Have some courage. Milk in the soda stream. I keel over and die instantly. <laughs> what, are, what else would be cursed to put in a soda stream? Most things. Yeah. Any pilkers? Ew, any pilkers? Yo. No. That sounds nasty. Tried oat milk in a soda stream? That sounds kind of bad too. Wait, yeah. which, which room is this? Oh, this is the force gem room, of course. Yeah, what if you put like tomato soup in the uh, soda stream? Carbonated your, soda. Well, yeah, what if you put a soup in a soda stream? Does your soup become a beverage? No, your your soda stream becomes a broken product. <laughs> and your cup is filled with regret. How much was that soda stream? How much did that soda stream cost and was it worth it? How much is that soda stream in the window? <laughs> the one that's filled up with pilk. <laughs> <laughs> I just hate the sound of the word pilk. It's very sonically rotten. Oh, <laughs> God, yeah. We're gonna run out of bombs, and I'm gonna be mad. We get someone whispering sweet pilks into the ASMR mics. Oh, my gosh. I... I if I wanted to get the ire of the audio engineers, I would touch those microphones, but I am not. Because they are good friends, and I don't want to anger them. All right, and another question from soup. Are, are you a soup if you have a bubble bath? It has multiple ingredients in it. Is a bubble bath intended for... Uh, bubble bath. Bubble bath intended for consumption? At which point I'm questioning what kind of person you are. All right. Who, who here has watched iCarly? Yeah. There was an episode where they showed a clip of some kid laying in a bath full of scrambled eggs. I don't Did like that, that kid just become a soup? I would say... The thing is, it's scrambled eggs. So, like, if you eat scrambled eggs, you're not eating a soup. It's solid matter. It's pretty fluidy, though. Whoa, we got a $70.13 donation from Igox. Yo, thank you. Thank you so much. That's huge. Thank you. That's very appreciated. And that get that adds to our wheel spin cube. Oh no. We have, we have a light Yo. couch, but we have three wheel spins. Wheel spin time. I love to spin the wheel. Spin it, baby. Spin it, baby. Oh crap! This man is gonna see me. Group evil. Group evil laugh. laugh. Three, two, two, 
one. <laughs> that was pretty good. Nice job, team. Teamwork makes the dream Everyone work. gets a thumbs up. Everyone gets a big, big old thumbs some up. some thumbs up in chat. And this time, I'm not going to be a stupid dumb idiot and go down the wrong way. Oh boy, level two. Oh, crap. Is the ocean a soup? Um, Are you trying to drink the entire no, ocean? No, please, please don't drink the ocean. The ocean is neither made for drinking or eating consumption. I mean, if you could survive drinking the entire ocean, good on you. But we have, we are done as a species at that point. Hello. Someone just tried oh, to sneak hey. on chat. Hey, is that OC? It's OC. It's a me. Oh, crap. C crap. OC, we need your controversial soup opinion. Soup is good. All right, there That's you go. That's very controversial. True. Hot takes. Soup is good. Hot soups. Do I have, do I have adequate bombage to get into that little that little beady boo <laughs> the answer may surprise you i hate these stupid little dumb dumb little eyeballs they're evil knock him out while he's down dang he wasn't filled with bombs well he was not filled with bombs Grave is like a thick soup. Are you supposed? But soup is supposed to be consumed solo. Are you just drinking gravy? Are you judging? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I am here to do two things: drink gravy and be rancid. Congratulations! They're intrinsically linked. <laughs> Congrats. You get the two for one package. I would say donation incentive, but then there's no food in it. Donation incentive? You just have yeah, to. Dan drinks gravy. I'm gonna make a Twitter space drinking gravy with friends. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> everybody, everybody that uh, that joins the drinking gravy with friends space is automatically kicked out of my Twitter circle. <laughs> You said gravy, why are you talking about me behind my back? <laughs> you know Jackson, you know I respond to the G word. Jackson Gravy Master. You know, I really hate whenever these these little these little phantom boys. I'm made with real chunks of sausage, Dan. Do you watch do you, you watch everyday sausage? Is that some kind of gimmick YouTube channel, Abro? Yes. We love oh, a gimmick boy. YouTube they channel. They just make sausage every day out of whatever people suggest them. Well, like wood, wood, uh, wood fiber sausage. Well, no, Sawdust. it's 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 things that are edible. Sawdust. <laughs> so dirt. I mean, I guess they could if if it's edible dirt, like. Oh I mean, crap! Technically. Listen, Abra, people have eat, eaten dirt for centuries. It's a cultural mainstay. Oh, believe me, my family line has been doing it for years. No, that, that sounds like there are all, all kinds of channels where it's just like, let's do this, let's do this thing in a different way. Uh, one is like the, uh, the, the, the Finnish, the hydraulic press channel. Mm -hmm. hey everybody, welcome to the hydraulic press, uh, hydraulic press channel. Uh, today we will <laughs> press... They did make channel. a dirt sausage. Today oh, we press good. a can of Coca-Cola. They've definitely done sawdust. Oh my god. Ordinary sausage. Yes, ordinary sausage. There you go. Here it's like, I'm, I'm, sure, I'm sure there's a channel just putting things in the microwave. Hey everybody, welcome to the microwave channel. Today we're going to put- That literally was one of the channels that started YouTube. Well, yeah. Oh, what was another one, Abbott? Will it blend? There's yep. A, that was a, <laughs> Will it blend? Yeah, that was a, that's a well, timeless that classic. Was, that was just an advertisement channel for Blendtec. Oh, well, there you go. Yeah. Good advertisement. Oh, I mean, yeah. We're still talking about it 80 years later. Uh. Everybody, welcome to the welcome to the air fryer channel. Today we're going to put an iPhone 13 into this air fryer and see what happens. Let's find out. Don't forget to hit the bell. I think we need to come up with our own, like, will it do something channel. Yeah, will it X? Will it hydraulic press? Will it sausage? Will, will it, it blend? Tree? Can you make a tree out of it? 
can, can, can we 3D print this Beanie Baby? Let's find out on the next 40 minute video with 27 ad breaks. What? Oh, okay, it accepted it. I was about to scream, First try. sorry. <laughs> Let's put, let's put Dan in an air fryer. Can try for us, I'll think what what happens next? Place me in an air fryer. Let's dehydrate Starmie. Okay, we made it. I I went through all of those levels in four in three and a half minutes. Let's go. I'm I'm okay with that. And now we get a, like a save state, so we can come back to this level without having to redo the whole thing. Yeah, you get a punch in the wall that lets you just get here. Yeah. Use the courage. Use the courage. A Abra, you're you're like a you're like a smart person. So like I'm sure there's like a computer programmer. Like, what creepy device can we pro you know program Doom on? I look. I, I wrote a tro I wrote a mal a ransomware on a TI-89 graphing calculator. Because I did Hello World on a pregnancy test. I would you know. say <laughs> on a clear blue. On a, Pro yes, on a probably on a life support machine, like, <laughs> like something that, like, like uh, what is the proper name of the machine that goes boop with your heart? Um, the e ECG, EKG? E yeah, the EKG. But instead of, like, showing heartbeats, it, it just draws the screen of doom as a single line. Oh, do we not have a, a shield? <gasps> <gasps> yeah, you don't have a shield. Oh my god. Well, you know what? 75 Where's lines per minute. Really fun time, then? You gotta have a. Well, I mean, you're playing Doom, so your heartbeat better be going pretty fast. You're right, aren't you? You're right. Yeah, you can play Doom on a birth control test, yeah. The thing is, you're just using it, it's not running it. Like, you're just using the screen on it. Oh, that's that's lame. Yeah, I know. I'm sure that pregnancy, pregnancy tests in the future, like, the cheapest chip that they have will be more than enough to run. Doom, just because like nobody makes a chip that's t dinkier. I have to step away real quick. No one donate while I'm gone. Do it. Do what you have to do. <laughs> Everyone immediately donates. I do see that that just showed up now. All right, we got one more soup question. Will it soup? Hey everybody, Abra here. Going to find out will it soup. Today we've got a grape. Can we make grape soup. Oh wait, that's called wine. Oh, well. Crap. Watch our next video next week. I'm gonna make shrimp soup. Shrimp soup. <laughs> they call that bisque, don't they? Yeah. yeah. It's a racket. Or chowda. No, chowda. go back Thank the other way. Our East Coast friends. No, go back the other way. Chowda. You smacked him right in the booty. I want this. Money? Time? Time. I mean, time is money. Give me all the time. Today we're gonna write a, a, key, a key gen on a Tamagotchi. I'm gonna write a key gen for Photoshop CS2. Oh, wait, this is where we oh. came down from. It'll be 16 kilobytes and have like an eight minute song playing on it. I sequenced it myself. Yeah. Is it right here? Crap! Goodbye, little man. I was a little bit too. There you go. So, so do you want concentration time, or do you want us to just dink around? You can do whatever you want. I'll. I'll you can try to right. concentrate, but we will not let you. All right. Well. As, a, as a matter of principle. If I can do anything, I will. Oh, hi, MC. I mean, the principle. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. I'm, I'm good. The e MC Gamer, we're, we're throwing around free ideas for YouTube channels of the, of the Will It X formula. Will it blend? Will it microwave? Will it sausage? Um. Will this random product do this will, thing? will it ice cream will probably work if Whoa. it's not already done. Will that just makes me think of like, uh... <laughs> Which is kind of like the hydraulic press done. channel. Yeah, it feels it, like will it ice cream should have been done by now. It makes me think of how to cook that, if you're aware of Yeah. that show. Welcome to Will It Ice Cream. Today we've got... Hot peppers. Will hot peppers ice cream? Somebody's already done that. I, I mean, I'm just putting different things in, in, in like the wrong appliances. Thank you, no one. Like, what, what if we just did a channel where, where we just put stuff in dishwashers or something? Where... Will it dishwash? <laughs> yeah. Mechanical keyboard, Dan. Dan's got Dan's gone into these mechs. Hey, on, on Mythbusters, they one time cooked lasagna in a dishwasher. Good. Was it good? I think it was good. Italian they had Alton Brown give him a lasagna recipe. Ah, does that help? <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> or was that just for the, the pr promotion? No, they actually did. He was like, well, you're gonna get about this temperature, so we wanna use these kind of ingredients. Look at you go, you don't need a shield. Pair it this way. Well, Adam, I think we need to put the temperature at about 700 degrees. <laughs> Same. I don't need a shield. I have heart palpitations. <laughs> those, those, those will shield me from the outside world. Yeah, my cat's got those. Well, not my cat. My parents' cat. My cat, sir. Well, Adam, I think if we, if we put dynamite in the dishwasher, oh, I think it might destroy yeah. the dishes oh, first. But there's only one way to find out, Jamie. Let's go to the... The explosion zone! Oh my god. <laughs> the Alameda I, I, County I, I, bomb range. Your Adam Savage is, is oh, fantastic. Oh, that's what it is. Okay, <laughs> Adam Savage. Thank you. We need to give you the hat, the, the white hat. I, I, I actually, um, so, so Adam Savage is, like has a channel like for like, a small production company called sure Tested. Does. Sure does. Uh, and on the channel he just like, my one of my so favorite weird. series, he, it's just called One Day Builds, where it's usually not actually one day, but he's, he's makes something. And in his workshop, and it's my favorite thing to watch. It's really nice. He got a fantastic workshop. Mm -hmm. You know, everybody, everybody could be jealous of that. Can you yeah. do the Jamie Heineman facial hair? <laughs> well, that's what matters here. Uh, with a couple months of growth, no. Actually, no, oh, no not either. Years? No, his is too good. It's too. Come back to mustaches. I don't have the. I don't have the genetics. What about you, UFC? Do, do you think you can become Jamie Heineman? Jamie who? From uh, Mythbusters, do you know him? Oh yeah, is that the, the Mythbusters? Yeah. The one of us. Is that is that the bearded guy? Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, the guy with the big mustache. I feel kind of sexy in this. <laughs> in, in the beret. <laughs> can't can't you sure forget do, the beret. Now, if we put dynamite in this water heater, it'll explode at seven thousand miles an hour. Which is just what we want. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think that's I think that's a bad idea, uh, Jane. Uh, uh, uh. Adam. Uh, All right, man. Adam. But it but if this goes wrong, we're trying my idea. <laughs> <laughs> they have the perfect like left brain, right brain. You know, yeah. it's perfectly aligned division. Yeah. They, they they they've talked at length in, in like 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 talking about how like. They they were not like friends, yeah. but they but they were like really good coworkers. Like 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 they, they came in, they did their work together. Like they didn't really argue too much. They did their job, and then at the end of the day, it wasn't like, all right, but we're best friends, so we have to go to dinner together. No, no they, they got they out of there. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Exactly. See, see, uh, uh, there's this thing, is, uh, apparently they hated each other. Not quite. Apparently they did not hate each other at all. They just they just weren't friends. They just weren't friends. Yeah. Yeah. When work was over, work was over. Yep. I think this, the triangle, old triangle gal. What? <laughs> triangle goes in the square hole. Triangle gal goes over on the Where does this shape go? Oh, That's you, right, the square hole. The That's square right. Hole. It goes. Oh. Right, it goes in the square hole. It goes up here, I think. We'll get it up there. The triangle's gonna go in damn square hole in about 30 seconds. I am gonna. <laughs> Scream so loud your eardrums explode. <laughs> On behalf of my good friend Drum Ultima and Atsuku Natsu, no. <laughs> no. 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 No, don't. Not on no, today. I don't want that. No, nice. That. No, oh, it's the fake one. Oh. <laughs> Give me the butter. <laughs> Give me the butter. Crap, 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 crap. I didn't know Paula Dean was here. <laughs> Okay. Right, imagine, no, imagine, imagine. It's, me, it's imagine. me, it's me, Paula Dean. I'm gonna cook myself for you today. It's gonna be wonderful. <laughs> cook myself. Step one, we're gonna get a lot of butter, and I'm gonna put myself on the frying pan. Listen to me sizzle. Lather me up, baby. <laughs> Lather me up in butter. Okay, listen, MC Gamer, okay, now we're, ha we're having fun here, but you know what, MC Gamer, I, I, for the past six years, I've been on a journey of teaching myself how to cook, and you know what the bad news is? The bad news is that butter makes Everything tastes oh, good. Oh, so yep. true, it's so true. It, it Paul, the, the bad news is that Paula Dean was right the whole time. Yep. Yes. Mm. It works. And you know who knows that? French cooks. Yep. All that hoity-toity French cuisine, you know why it tastes good? Because they put le beurre. They put <laughs> le bass and le beurre. They <laughs> bathe it in butter. That's why it tastes so good. Go There's it. no secret. Dude. If something tastes good, it'll taste better with more butter. Jacques Pepin says it. It's true. What, what? What? Okay. Okay. So this is gonna this is gonna almost invalidate my story. But what was the name of of, of the lady who did the French Chef? 
Julia Child. Yeah. Julia Child, thank you. So I, I watched an, a, a, a documentary on Julia Child on a plane once on, on a trip where I was going to see uh, extended family members because I was told that many of them are older ladies. Yeah. And I, I saw it when I was searching through all the documentaries on the on the plane and I saw Julia Child, I'm like, this is going to be great Which because is, relevant. I'm yeah, going to be topical. able to talk to all these older ladies about Julia Child and it sure worked, man. Wow. I mean, uh, that covered every one of my dinners with extended family. It was Jeez, amazing. That's great. You, you, knew this, you knew the strat, man. Yeah. What did you like learn that you can share with the people? Uh, she had a husband that she loved very much mm. and it, it was really interesting at the time because uh, she was definitely from the age where it was the man goes to work and, and the woman stays at home. And um, she did both. And, and she yeah. and she went out and worked and, and he stayed home. He was like the homebody and there was actually a lot of like 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 nasty rumors about her husband and stuff because of that. Judgments and such. Yeah. Right. And it, it was actually quite 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 interesting that, that she was like very outspoken about being like, Hey, how about y'all shut up and let me do my work and you know? Yeah. She did, she did she did some video some uh, TV stuff with, with Jacques Pepin. They did some French yeah. French stuff together. Ooh, French connection. Yeah, Julie yeah. Child, kind of based. I'm sorry to say that. I love that. Don't out of my be mouth. sorry. Based. It's, did you did you, did you based learn that Urban what? Dictionary? Based yeah. in butter. Yeah. Oh, nice. Nice. braised. Look at that. Ah, oh, 15 seconds. Stupid, stupid phantoms are dumb. <laughs> They're so mean. Would you right call there. it a phantom menace? Get it. Attack oh. it. No, I'm leaving. I'm getting out of here. Storm's coming, oh, Annie. Oh, crap. No, I have to bring all the crap the down here. The bones are aching, Annie. What is that? That's from Phantom Menace. That's is, the, it, is it really? That's the old lady. Oh, oh my god. You're right, yeah. Storm's coming, Annie. Hey, why don't you, uh... Show me your best part. Annie! 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 Annie. Annie. They need to say Annie. That's the... <laughs> I could say every other Watto line, it doesn't matter, because the best line is just Annie. Uh, what are you okay? You kind of sound like you got a problem. W uh, Watto. I don't need them ship parts. I don't want them. But I Somehow do fried this. butter is a thing. It's really good. Oh, yeah. I've never tried it. You had butter? Ooh, yeah. You ever had fried stuff? Yeah. Well, it's like that. No. Okay. Well, there is, there is a so-called brown butter, browned butter. Um, that stuff's great. Where you brown butter almond either. ice cream. You roasty toast the butter before you yeah. put your thing in it. Why did that happen? <laughs> Yo ho ho. Why did that happen? Gun. Oh crap! Stop right there, criminal scum. I dropped down and right in the friend. right in the back. He just activated his scoliosis after ten years. Oh. <laughs> You've activated my trap card. Put the, put the back brace on. my trap card is scoliosis. Thank you everybody, by the way, for coming and watching us tonight. I see a lot of people here in the chat. We just hit the, the 10 hour mark, so true. Yeah. 10 hours of nice. the marathon so far. Cool. 10 hours of Mark. No, I see the phantoms are chasing Oh, hi, Mark. Me. Oh, hi, Mark. Anyway, I love Lisa so much. Ooh, no, you're not busting that out yet. However, he did. Hi, doggy. <laughs> that's uh, my favorite. The, 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 the that's only my, that, video. I love that scene. The so only video much. that can make me laugh every single time I, I look at it, no it, matter it, what it, my it, mood it, is. Keep the chain every time. It, it's interesting because the room, like, yeah, it's it's a bad movie, whatever. It's a funny bad movie, whatever. But when you watch that scene, you have to wonder how that just all came together exactly in that way. It just, I don't know. I'll, no, I'll tell you. I'll tell you exactly. They they said Johnny. Pretend like you're actually at a florist shop just buying flowers. Behave exactly as you would. That's how many of us would behave. Walk in. I'd like these flowers, please. Keep the change. Hi, doggy. Bye. Ve ex too normal. It's too normal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For a movie, you don't want to see normal. We want better than normal. I think I heard once they actually, like, they voice acted it. Like, they, they recorded the audio ahead of time. Good. So it was, like, preset how that would go. And then when it didn't organically happen that way in the video. Oh, wait, so the opposite of, like, post-recording. Basically, yeah. They, they pre-recorded that content. And that's, that's why it's not a normal human conversation. Um, on this note, uh, we, we need... Actually, would you just like to trade spaces? 
I'm going to let Dino come on, because we have, we, we have a fun game to play, I believe. Oh, oh. oh. We have OC on the couch. Oh, sorry. I mean, oh, that's because that's, that's you're too smart. Uh, That's right. Uh, 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 OC, yeah. uh, you, you're going to be our answer key for this. So, okay. uh, yeah. Also, I didn't realize that the, the, the tech or, or donation station has uh, this wall erected because the whole point was Excuse I wanted me. to be able to see the couch. <laughs> Blame us unified. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. I need transparent audio panel. That's all right. Do you want to switch? Yeah, go for it. Pop it. Alright. I'm hopping. Right. I'm hopping. There you go. Wanna take back? Hey. 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 Thanks for sitting on cat with me. Do what you gotta yeah. do. Yeah. Yeah, this is your moment. It's warming up on time. My moment. My moment. Like the Rebecca Black song, yeah. my moment. Keeping your seat warm. See, I just know yeah. Friday. Yeah. <laughs> you don't know her other work. Well, there's an entire six other day. days full of moments, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> gotta learn. No, this is the Why do you have that? No. You can't plunge my leg. Will it plunge? Will it plunge? Hello everybody, uh, I'm from Finland and now today is a Willy Plunge. <laughs> uh, today <laughs> we'll try, try to plunge the Dutch oven. Is that a finished oh, show? the couch does plunge. Yeah. You get some suckage there. It's not gonna do I it. Beg your Why pardon? is the plunger back? It's not gonna do it. <laughs> it's not gonna stick, but it, it, does, it does get some suckage. Listen, there's only one good bit with the plunger and it's been done already. I, it sure has. I wonder who did it. Was was what was it you doing flying a Star Wars uh uh that, starship? That was good. You did that once. It sure was. That was pretty good. You were not entertained by it, Zach. You were like, what was that? Why did you do that? <laughs> it was actually uh, uh, that reaction made me laugh a lot though. Oh, there are doubters everywhere. You're a Rebecca Black fan. Yeah, that's the only other, only other Rebecca Black song I know. It's called My Moment. So you have two. There are two, yes. Right. There's Friday, My Moment, and Saturday. Wow. Oh, Saturday. Wow. Look, at, Let's go. look at Overachiever Damn. over here. Damn. And all of her new stuff. President her of, the, stuff of the fan fun. club. Um, hey, Dino, did, did, did we need to do a, 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 a slideshow of some sort? Yes. You can do that while I'm trying to figure out how my phone works. What, what type of slideshow? All of them. What do you mean, all of them? All right. It just, said main. Just run it. Oh, okay. Hey everybody, this is MC over on Donation Station. While Dan is, is heading out of the Temple of the Ocean King, uh, we're going to give you some quick info in case you didn't know that you're watching Zeldathon Daybreak. It's a six-day charity marathon where we will play your favorite games from the Legend of Zelda series. Uh, throughout the entire marathon, uh, we have a wonderful schedule, a variety of remote and in-person game runs. We're excited to be back together uh, something a little bit more closely resembling our usual events while still trying to take some measures to keep our team safe. It's going to be, it's, it's a wonderful six day event. I'm so glad that we're in a hotel having some fun together. Um, and we're raising money for direct relief as you see on screen. It's a wonderful organization uh, that ships medical supplies to over 100 countries, all U.S. states and territories. Uh, they're doing all sorts of amazing programs at all times, including responding to the flooding that just happened here in the United States. Uh, but also something very relevant to uh, recent times. They're working with the Ukraine Ministry of Health to uh, provide requested aid, including trauma kits, cancer drugs, insulin, antidotes used in those chemical attacks, and more. Uh, really, uh, you know, you know I, I, I know I'm biased because I work at Direct Relief, but even if I didn't, I would absolutely love donating and, and supporting Direct Relief. It's one of my absolute favorite charities out there, and I'm so happy to be here with you all raising money for it uh, once again. A quick reminder though, uh, e you know, even if you can't donate, or, or you already have, to be sure to go over to our different social media accounts. We're Zeldathon on everything, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, uh, over on YouTube as well where we put up highlight videos, the archive and all of that. Uh, it's a great way to make sure you're keeping up with what we do. Uh, also, uh, before we get back into the game, uh, I want to give you a huge reminder, everybody, that we have partnered with Heroic Replicas to do some amazing things this event. Heroic Replicas is a, is, a, is a company that I was, like, a fan of before we started working with them, and now that we're working with them, I'm, just, I'm, 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 I'm overjoyed. Uh, right now, over on, uh, if, you, if you go to zelothoncom slash store, you can see all of our different merch options, but you can see, for example, the Kinstone that's on your screen right now as well as the mini Megaton Hammers, called the Mini-Ton Hammers. Um, 
When you buy either one of these products from Heroic Replicas, half of uh, the proceeds go to Direct Relief, um, and it's absolutely a, a, a great thing to do. Um, and in addition, I'm going to just kind of cycle through them on screen right now. Uh, Heroic Replicas has donated some of their amazing work to be auctioned off throughout the event over on eBay. Uh, so if you go to zelathoncom slash store, you can see all of these items that you're seeing on screen. Uh, they're amazing replicas of some of your favorite uh, Zelda items. These are all being auctioned off presently over on eBay. And uh, proceeds from these are being split between both direct relief and also to fund future charity projects with heroic replicas so we can keep doing cool things like this because uh, these items cost a ton to make. So that's what we got going on right now. Just want to make sure you are all aware. They cost a megaton to make. They do cost a megaton to make. It's so true. Well done. What do you think the best day for Rebecca Black to do a song about would be? She didn't cover it. She's already done Friday and allegedly Saturday as well. Arbor Day. Found it. Arbor Day? Did you say Arbor Day or Labor Day? Arbor. Well, I, I, I thought the idea was day of the week. You mean a holiday? Well, I mean, uh, just it's an interesting introduction. It's a good idea. Well, no one thought about that before. Who the heck is Arbor that? Day. What do you? What is Arbor Day? What is Arbor? The day for cutting down trees. What is? What's the deal? We already did that. We already did that bit. Wow. <laughs> I think in Michigan there's a town called Ann Arbor. There is. That's true. Ann Arbor, or Arbor. Of Arbor. Nor Arbor. Well, I don't know. Well, she's already done Friday and Saturday. Xor. As far as good days, you know, good days go. Like, you've already kind of thin, thinned the. I, mean, I don't know. Wednesday is a great day of the week. Hump day. Hump day. It's good. I can afford one dollar. One dollar for the good looks. Do you like Wednesday? For a dollar. Isn't it Wednesday right now? Well, yes. no. Well, is well. It? Like Wednesday yeah, just means Wednesday. Wednesday means you have another half of the week to go. It's I don't Wednesday think it's that much to celebrate over. Well, we still have a fifth of the marathon to go, or like it's also MC's birthday. Hey. We're good. Yeah. Hey, We're hey, Leif. Leif Eriksson. Yeah. Hello? Can I say my name? I don't yeah. know. Did you so hear Leif Eriksson? You can now name? donate to send MC secret oh. birthday messages that he can choose to read or not. Ah. Uh, uh, Dino, do, do you have something to do, though? I do. So, we're going to do something. We're going to play a game called Real or Not. Real or Not! Yeah. Now, now, now I'm going to have whoever's editing this video make a really cool like intro, like real or not, and some fireworks. No, no, there's gonna be basic text. Just Times New Roman. Ooh. Real or not. Aerial. We'll, 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 see, we'll see if Flying's up for it. Thanks, Flying. No, no. Yeah. Anyway, the basic idea is I'm gonna say a, a fact about Tingle, and you decide if it's real or not. That's why OC isn't playing, because oh. he's too smart. <laughs> uh, so, let's start it off nice and great. Tingle murders an old lady. Real or not? Real. Oh, uh, well, that's from Majora's Mask, right? The old lady gets killed, but Tingle didn't do it. There's no way he does that, right? I, I'm, I have to go with not as well, but I, no, I feel like I'm no, about yeah. to be surprised. That's a no that's for real. Well, wait, 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 wait. Somebody, somebody, Link, in murder, game, Link murders the old in lady. In game, in game, or in like. Backstory, I wonder. I'd like to make yeah. sure that our, our friends are aware that we're well, also like, probably counting the life. Tingle, the Tingle exclusive games. Oh, okay, God. okay, well, definitely Tingle has killed. I know that for sure. I'm saying yes. But so, has, but, but has he killed an old woman? But has he killed I'm, an old woman. I'm going to assume. I mean, it, there. It, no, I'm, I'm saying no. Assume. There's no way. Tingle so, is a murderer. In Tingle's Rosie Rupee Land, there is an old lady called Map Lady, and by obtaining all the maps. Map lady dies. Hey, rest in peace. I'll take that. Point. Well, no, that, that, but he did, that doesn't mean he killed her. She yeah. Might have died of natural causes. Did, did he know beforehand that this would kill her? You can assume. No, you can't. <laughs> you you can made assume. this game. You, what, who was assuming? Did he? Did he or did he not? She, he, might, she might have just had a heart attack. Would he be or guilty, guilty in, be in, 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 in a court? and not murder. So, I, I believe I just said killed. Oh, okay. So in a court, um, in a court, sure. would they convict him? We're off to a bad start, Dino. Probably. Then yeah, I'm taking my point. I'm guilty as charged. Well, what's your what jurisdiction? The high the high rule uh, court system or what? They have a Supreme Court, I'm sure. <laughs> a Crunchwrap Supreme Court, maybe. Hey. <laughs> the high rule Supreme no, Court. Will give save us the them. next one. All right. Tingle becomes a pirate with a gang of skeleton pirates. Yes. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. So Absolutely bad. true. <laughs> Absolutely true. Well, based on OC's reaction, yes, I have to. I'm gonna go with not. Ooh, MC saying no. 
I, th I think you changed the detail. Ooh. First, first it says real. I mean, real as well. Oh wait, sorry. Hold on, one second. No, not that. I'm holding. <laughs> I'm holding. Ah! <laughs> Died of cartographer arrest. Ayo. Oh, because of the maps. All right, that one is not real. Ooh. Tingle works with the pirates. He becomes an honorary friend of the pirates, but not a pirate because he is, in fact, not a dead skeleton. Ah. Uh, well, he, he can tremendous. get there. He can get there eventually. He'll get there eventually. One that was day. actually the second boss tries to kill him so he can become a dead pirate. And he doesn't want that? that that's the whole lore. He does not want that. Before we get to our next one, just uh, to recap some donations, by the way, we had uh, $5 from Soup saying, if minestrone is soup, why is spaghetti bolognese not? I've had some pretty liquid spaghetti before. Thanks for that. Because it's spaghetti, it's yeah, bolognese. Yeah, yeah. You're not just drinking the sauce. Right. Lemonade's a soup, but spaghetti's not. Like, there's a big difference between those. It's called spaghetti bolognese. You'd not just the bolognese. Yeah. Minestrone is by itself. Do we have to explain everything, MC Gamer? Spaghetti minestrone. We also had three dollars from Ree who says, Hi, I'd like to share a hot take with y'all. Morbius is to Gen Z what The Room is to Millennials. Take with that as no, you No, no, not even uh, close. Yeah, I the disagree. The Room is special. Listen, in, 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 in six I months, nobody's going to talk about Morbius ever again. In We're six years, people will still be talking about Tommy Wiseau. Yes, absolutely. It's been 20. Um, also, a three dollar nation saying deep fried milk. That is all. Fair enough. No. Well, it's che cheese literally curds. just cheese sticks. Cheese curds. Sure. Yeah. All right. Give us another real or not. All right. Real or not. In all of the Nintendo published titles, Tingle attends two weddings. Mm. Real. He he attended. Wait, wait, no, no. no I'm I'm, just, uh, I'm gonna go with real because. I think the actual answer is like more, but technically he would have done at least exactly two. two. Sorry. Exactly two? Exactly okay. two. Exactly two. Well, unless I can't count. Tingle's the kind of guy who would be invited to weddings, so I'm gonna say sure. Well, I think I think Tingle may have been present in the Majora's Mask like ending credits when Ooh. when you see Cafe and Anju, you know? Who? All right. I'm sorry. I don't. I don't play games. I apologize. I outed myself. Yeah. I shouldn't have said anything. Who for playing? Uh, um, Mind games. What about Lovey and Darling? Huz Fuzzy and Darling, what are their names? Is that I Love Lucy? No, the ones who Honey and Darling. Thank you. Puppy and Darling, Honey and Darling. Fuzzy and Darling. <laughs> Whatever. Listen, I just, I watched Jamie play Rando. That's how I get my Majora's Mad Knowledge, where he has like acronyms and, and like lingo for everything. I'm gonna say it's five, so, so no. It's five what? weddings. Five, five weddings. I say, I are say, there I say five not. weddings in Zelda games? I don't know, man. Wait, no, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm saying yes, that's real. How many divorces are in Zelda? Sorry, that's, go, that's go on. From my count, it is two. It is the wedding in Majora's Mask, and at the at near the end of Tingle, two oinkers get married, and Tingle throws off the fireworks. Two who? <laughs> oinkers. Oinkers. Pig people. Oh. Right, of course. Not related to, to, to Lil Oinks. Those are different. Is that a rapper? Those are from Poke those are from Paper Mario. Uh, yeah, little oink. Oh yeah, little, yeah. Little piglets. Wow, one dollar. Oinkers. How many Gorons live on this island? Fourteen. Everyone's doing trivia tonight. You, you can't just add Goro. I'm gonna say not real on that one. Give me a <laughs> Goro hint. <laughs> right. You can't you can't do hint. that. It's not a convention. Alright, what what do we got? What's next? Alright. Tingle purchases a train and calls it the Tingle Liner. <laughs> tingle Liner. I, I hope I hope not, but I, I just I'm gonna go with not because I don't think Tingle would spend the money on it. Let me let me look. Well, let me what, get... what if I add that the Tingle Liner looks like Tingle? That would make sense. Let me get meta with this question. Let me let me dive in on this. All if right. this isn't true, that means that you wrote that. Yes. It's not real. You wrote that. You came up with Tingle Liner at five in the morning, and you're really happy about it. Is Tingle in Spirit Tracks at all? No. Then the answer is no. Because that's the train game. There are no trains ever, anywhere in any other game. Oh, see, do you have an answer for it's this one? Yeah. What is uh, the answer? He doesn't purchase the train. Correct. Right. Uh, but the, the the train is called the Tingle Liner. Yes. Oh wait, so he gets it for free? So yeah. he finds a train in an abandoned train yard, and as soon as he gets in it, it transforms into his face. Ah. No, it, it's not that uh, it uh. from when he gets in. He has to find all the train parts first. Yeah. 
But then as soon as he gets it working, yeah. it takes some work to get, transform it. Is that, yeah, how, is you know, that all, how that... all the capacitors become sentient and jump out and go play hide and seek? Is that how that Whoa, works in real life? Official brother. Nice. Hey. That's how it works. In, that's how it works in real life. Because if that's how that works in yeah, real life, I'm gonna run Amtrak in like a week. Tingle, Tingle inherited the trend. <laughs> it was bequeathed. It was, in, it was in his dad's will. Yeah. Another, another. All right. At the beginning of Tingle's balloon trip of love. Someone poisons Tingle's grandparents. Real. Real. Well, every hero needs like some tragic event to start yeah. their journey, so sure. Always a backstory. Probably right, chat. Probably, it's probably gonna be his parents. It's probably, it was his uncle and aunt, you know. Some technicality. What's the average lifespan of Tingle's race? Help me out. Too long. <laughs> He's just, he's just a man. Wrap it up. Dark if if he's just false. a man, then what are we, MC they Gamer? Know. Fools. They just kicked out of the farm. They were not faking. Were they faking it? What's, that's a deep accusation. I will say, there is a poisoning at the start of the game. Is they, Tingle canonically in his mid-30s? They had yeah, munch, he's 35. Canonically 35, all times. Good. How? Ting Tingle actually lives forever. That, all as, soon right. as, as soon as you get 35, it just stops. But aging. what about his grandparents? All right. They're also OC. 35. <laughs> uh, technically, there is a poisoning at the start of the game, but we don't find out until we go back to page one yeah. uh, from after page uh, 13. I didn't know which page, but yeah. Yeah, uh, because uh, at, uh, at page uh, 13, you have all the ingredients for the... Um, all the other things. And, uh, to yeah, make you, the you make the antidote so at that point. at first you have to well, save you, the you princess. You go back at any point, technically. No, because you have to have the antidote. <laughs> and you don't get the antidote well, I'm learning. until I'm you learning. have gotten it at the end of so, page 12, when you save the princess. And then <laughs> you have uh, unlimited... Uh, and Sorry, you, you brought the Tingle nerds on couch. It's, 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 it's academic, so, uh, uh, academic uh, uh, scholars over you here. You know what's really funny is you just explained the answer, but I gotta ask, was it wasn't real or not? It was not. <laughs> it was actually not real because those were not his grandparents. Oh. Okay. So in a, in like a sentence, what were they? Uh, they are some other random guy's grandparents. Oh. Oh. Uh, well. That this witch that brought Tingle into the story, uh, put in that person's place. And then had him fire Tingle out of a cannon towards the city. Interesting. You know, basic Tingle stuff. Right. Doug, get off your phone! You should, you should play. You should play the game. It's actually pretty interesting. What game is this? This is uh, Ripen Tingle's Balloon Trip of Love. How do I get that? AKA the best uh, internet. Great. What? It was never have... released in America because they're like, nah. I understand. Do you have more on there? Um, let's see. Uh, in. Uh, Tingle's Bloom for Love, you collect, uh, cartridges. You collect game cartridges. Firearm. Yeah. <laughs> Merchant of Death, Lord of War. That's simple. Wait, is that the question? That's, that's, that's the real or not. What's a cartridge? You, you never played, like, a game? Okay, are we talking about that? Or Nintendo yeah, like 64. Ammo, or ammo, okay, yeah. No, video yeah. game. Yeah, video game ammo, cool. <laughs> No, yes. Is the game yes. on? Is the game on a, a system that requires a cartridge? The game is on the DS. Then yes. I now, now, by this point, I have no confidence in, in Dino, so I'm gonna say no because there's gonna be some type. Of, they're actually discs. They were discettes or something like that. So I'm. I'm. I'm gonna go with real because I feel like we've been faked out twice now. It has to be real. We'll see. You, you think I'd do the the two no's and a yes? I what? think you're gonna do whatever you want to do. So is it real or not? It's real. It is real. Real. I, 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 was gonna, go. I was gonna say specific cartridge, but I don't remember if it was. I think it's a SNES style cartridge. Uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, it's a SNES style cartridge. They uh, they even get blown in. Sometimes that's RNG. Yeah, it's, uh, it's RNG. I think. So you four. have to hand in different uh, different cartridges that you find throughout the game, and then you play play a little mini dungeon. To Dun and Jun. Uh, you you play a little a little maze game. With the cartridges. They, they blow on the inside, they put it in their slot, and they say, go into this mysterious cave of death. So was it like a promotion for the way the game was, like, put on? No, it's, a, no. it's a part of the, uh, the secrets that you can do in, uh, yeah. in the game. It's actually well, how you farm money. Welcome to the couch, Alyssa. 
Hello. 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 I'm sorry, loves horses, girl. Welcome to Team Galore. Keeper of the master key. Indeed. <laughs> the, only, the, only, the only reason I'm alive here is thanks to Alyssa. I'm sorry. That's, that's to about it. Hor yeah. Horses. <laughs> I am only alive because of horses. That makes sense. So Great what? Sentence. What is your experience with Tingle Lore? None. Precisely Perfect. None. Keep it that. But give us a real or not. All right. Real or not. Tingle's outfit comes from a deity. 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 It sounds like yes. It has to be real. Shiva. Wait, no. I'm gonna Vishnu. go false. He made it himself. Vishnu. Wait, is is, is Tingle a deity? <laughs> well, it, it, probably somewhere. No, I'm gonna be middle-aged deity. Yeah, no, I'm saying no. No, Tingle's definitely a deity on the front couch. <laughs> where, where, where in Roman mythology is there the 35-year-old, partially balding, man-child god? That's Saturn, right? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe, maybe. Depends on the game, says Dark. Look, I'm I'm saying I'm saying yeah, no. Yeah, I agree saying with no. Dark. There's no way. The game. Oh, there are so. Has everyone submitted their guesses? I sure. There are multiple ways from different games. The closest one is Rupee Land, um, but Uncle Rupee is in fact not a deity. I wouldn't have accepted. Uh, in uh, Tingle's Ballad of Triple Love, he gets the from uh, Grandma. Uh, he gets it. He gets from he gets it from the grandparents in Tingle's Ballad of Triple Love. Because they don't want him being fired out of a cannon into the city, not wearing green. Because you have to wear green too. You gotta, you gotta wear green the, to the party. The party. Yep. I would not Except worship the something who called blue. Uncle Rupee. I would never worship something called Uncle Rupee. No. <laughs> That's not a yep. deity. You, you say that before Uncle Rupee is in your house. It's not a deity. Before either. Uncle Rupee's touched your life. Well, there's that. Yeah, Uncle, Uncle Rupee calls himself a deity, he considers himself a deity, but he's in fact not. He's just some creepy old guy who likes money. Well, what do you need to be a deity? Don't you just need to just call yourself one and then you are one? Well, you probably have to back it up a Come little bit. Come on. Once, I'm somewhere. Not used to what? Yeah, like, if I called myself a deity, absolutely none of you would go along with that. Well. You've done this. Is this my jacket? Yeah, yeah but like. Is. Do a miracle or two, just, you know. Exactly, yeah. So, you have to. What, what is your definition <laughs> of, a, of a deity esque miracle? Well, give, give, us, give us one, another real knot. I think we have time for like one or two fine. more. I see God whenever right, I flush the I actually have <laughs> some lists now. So I'm going to name uh, three items from Tingle Games. One of them oh, doesn't crap. exist. Okay. Right? We got... The, these are... The first one we'll do fluids. <laughs> <laughs> we got... Tingle's we got blood... Title. <laughs> Tingle's blood plasma. <laughs> We got meat soup, seafood broth, and steamy oil. Steamy oil. Clearly. The seafood broth has to yeah, be fake. No, it, yeah. it's, it's B. Steamy oil is real. You think yeah. it's steamy oil? No. no There's no thing as steamy oil. Steamy oil is real. It's, it's, it's B that's fake. If the yeah. oil is steaming, that means it's going to be on fire. The broth is fake. The broth is fake. The broth sounds too normal. To be no, no, no! In a video game. No, 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 the broth is fake. <laughs> to the to the two normal strategy I see. <laughs> what, what, what do you think, Dan? Um, what are the options again? Meat soup, seafood broth, and steamy oil. Which one's fake? I feel like ah, that's so annoying because steamy oil sounds so dumb that it would be real. Exactly. They're all great band names too. <laughs> steamy oil. This is my band Steamy Oil, we're a crust funk ex experience. Yeah, crust um, funk. Yeah. I, I feel like I'm gonna go with, um, uh, I think seafood broth and Steamy Oil are real. Okay. Meat You're a wiener. Meat soup is minestrone. We just went over this. Oh my gosh, Jackson. Have you ever eaten at the Olive Garden? Get some, get some class. Get the salad. Figure it out, Dan. Do you do salad and soup? The Ultima says meat soup. Salad. Dan, Dan needs some unlimited breadsticks to cure this oh uh, funky disease he's got. So, Jackson, so Dino, what, 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 what do they not serve at the at the Tingle Olive Garden? They do not sued, serve seafood broth. Let's yeah, go. let's go. Oh. All right. Dang. Now, now to uh, regular items. <laughs> There's liquids and regular items in two categories. <laughs> Same thing. The, States of matter. The solids. So, oh. <laughs> the golden butterfly, mm. dragon fry, which is a deep fried dragon, and 
pickaxe. No pick. What was the first one? No pickaxe. Golden butterfly. That's not real. Golden butterfly. The fact that you had an explanation for the second one. Yeah, that makes it very clear. What was the second one? Dragon fry. Dragon fry. Fry. That one has to be real. Like a yeah. like a fish fry. Pickaxe fake. Yeah, I'm just saying that. Because pickaxe. you were playing Minecraft when you made this gimmick list, mm, so I'm okay. gonna see a pickaxe. I'm still sticking with A. A's fake. Whatever it was. <laughs> the golden butterfly. The golden corral, yeah. Natsu says golden butterfly. Natsu, get off your phone! Google says butterfly. <laughs> they say pickaxe 100% real. Yeah, I mean, I have one. How can pickaxes be real? What's, what, what, what's the deal? What do we got? All right, it is the golden butterfly. Yeah, oh, exactly. Oh, there is a bronze butterfly, that. not gold. Uh, golden butterfly. Tricky, tricky. Oh. Sound real. What do you use the pickaxe for? Uh, nothing. They're collectibles. <laughs> Wait, so you collect multiple pickaxi? No, you collect a. These are all. There's like 30 collectibles. Okay. Pickaxe is just one of them. Okay. MC still got Minecraft on the oh, brain. You just assume the pickaxe is a tool <laughs> for yeah. greater riches. Nice. What did I miss? Uh, fluids. <laughs> 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 yeah. We'll do another fluids round. It's just right? a funny right. word. Wait, did you say another fluids round? Another fluids round. I got lots of fluids for you. Oh, <laughs> oh, don't say that ever again. All right. Lon Lon ketchup. Treasure puree. Rupee tartar. It's rupee tartar. How do you, how do you eat money? The, uh, the second one, the, 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 the treasure. The Lon Lon puree. ketchup. Treasure puree, rupee tartar. Well, treasure, the, treasure, treasure puree. The, the is first fake. ones sound yeah. real. Lon, Lon, I mean, maybe that's how you make ketchup in this canon, and whatever the whatever the other one is. All ketchup is, is milk based. <laughs> right. Yeah. <laughs> ketchup bechamel. Well, I mean, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you ever had that mayo chup stuff? That's, Th that's what we're talking thank, about. Thank you, Skylarky, for the sub. Hey, there you go. Thank yeah. you very much. Big, fa big fan. No, no, no. It's the third one. The third one's fake. It's the only one that doesn't. Uh, I can't figure out the chemistry of. Well, I, I'm, I'm saying, I'm saying the second one is, is not, not. I've watched real. like four no and a half seasons of Breaking Bad. Yes. How can you puree treasure? Easily. Well, it depends what the treasure is. If, if the if the treasure is like fruit, it's like oh, the treasure of oranges. Then have you, you ever held a blender? So like you know what oh, a blender does? It just, yeah. yeah. I have broken one with a milkshake. Oh, oh so, wow. you, so you get it. You know how it's. Done. I want it extra thick. <laughs> it, was, it was brand new too. It was oh. the first thing I was making with this ketchup blender. Ketchup is absolutely oh, real. Oh, blend tech. I want my money I back. Believe in Dino, it's the third one, right? Ninja, it I got a bone to pick one. with you. There's yeah. no oh. rupee tartar. Yeah, you can't do that. Man, money. rupee tartar was real or not? It's fake. That's Rupee sad. tartar is fake. Also, tartar isn't a liquid. Yeah, yeah, that's not a liquid. It's you fake wiener? tartar. Or do you mean is it? There's well, that's no why it's e fake. The so, is there no e at the end. No, tartar is talking tartar sauce. Stuff on your teeth. Black. Tartar. Tartar control. Have you ever had tartar tar sauce? Do you I, eat fish? Don't look, both of you look at me at the same time. <laughs> I, I get quartered easily. These Listen. Are all, these are all things that you cook in a pot. You, you stir the pot a bunch, then you get something you put in a jar. What? Di Dino, tell me what a tartar is. Tell me what it is. A food. What kind of food? <laughs> the edible kind. Well, <laughs> right, how much research did you do for this? Listen, a tartar is raw meat. Well, there, there's it's raw there. beef then, or then, raw chicken if you're crazy. Okay. Then it's a it's not a liquid. Wait. Tartar sauce. You know, Don't no, show no, me your Excel. The, no, no, no. That's I know what spelling. it says, that's and it's the wrong. Solid spelling. That's the solid okay, spelling. That's I, not right. Then I spelled yeah. it wrong. Sorry. Uh, how about this? You give us the final one. Give, give us, yeah. give us our finale. Do, do we want more fluids? <laughs> yeah, yeah. They're, yes. They're really, yeah, absolutely. Really. Real fluids this time, not pseudo fluids. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's, yeah, there's your I love band, that. There's your band name. I love that. Yeah. We got sleep potion. Yeah. Hand potion. Hand. <laughs> An endless love. That's a liquid. And, endless love is a Lionel Richie song. <laughs> I'm gonna say sleep potion is fake because yeah. the other two sound too too absurd to be real. What what is the like? What's the viscosity of endless love? Oh, l listen to the Luther Vandross song and you'll find out. I thought it was someone else. I've, I've never bottled love myself. But th but Tingle probably has. I think right? Lionel Richie wrote it. I'm I'm gonna say no hand potion. I don't know what that is. Yeah. Do, you, do I grow a third one? Fourth one? Additional hand. It's 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 a sleep potion. That's that's from regular Zelda games, not whatever these are. 
<laughs> what Zelda game has a sleep potion? Dude, I don't play these games. What's the answer? It's a Final Fantasy item. Is it? It is the sleep potion. There you go. There, you there go. are two other sleep-based fluids, but not sleep potions. <laughs> See, that's the thing. You don't have to know stuff to get things right. <laughs> Nike will. <laughs> All right, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna step off a donation station. Yeah. Yeah. I have a little bit of stuff to prepare. Uh, for. Potion to yep. the uh, you summon a hand with the hand potion. Yeah, you so basically, dungeon. you summon the wall master, that sees comes and picks you up and then yep. eats you out of the dungeon. It's 2.30 in the morning, and you've got Abra on the donation it's station. Abs. Hey, yeah. what's your favorite, like, fluid sleep medication? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay. We got Benadryl, right? What, 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 help me. NyQuil? Is NyQuil Benadryl, Zoloft? Benadryl is not a sleep medication, but it should be. There's tra Trazodone. Ambien, if you, if you put in a blender. See, uh, I have ADHD, right. uh, so caffeine actually makes me sleepy. Same, yeah. So I'll, I'll just drink an energy drink and like just chug the whole bottle in like the course of like three seconds, and then I conk out for a half an hour. You you, you shotgun the yeah. the rock star just, and then I'm mainline. We, we were road tripping to, to Mag one time, and I got in the car and I slammed a Red Bull immediately mm -hmm. and fell asleep ten seconds like ten minutes later. Yep. I woke up in 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 Magfest. Hey, that, I mean, that, you you've invented time travel. Congratulations. That's why I sleep on planes. It's teleportation. Hey, you got some donations to teleport to their ears? Unfortunately, not at the moment, but mm. we're open for them. Yeah. Zeldathon.com slash stop me. Yep. Zeldathon. Https. Colon. Colon forward slash forward slash Zeldathon. Dot info. Dot edu. <laughs> dot edu. I wish. Zelathon University. <laughs> dot gov. Zelathon University sounds like a great bit, though. <laughs> I'll, st I'll, I'll script it. I'll script later. Ugh. Dot gov sounds like a great bit that we probably legally that can't doodle. do. Look, everyone in the in the chat is now a chemistry expert here. <laughs> Listen, everybody, just relax. Don't don't go mixing stuff you get from CVS, please. We don't want to be responsible for whatever kind of volcano or like you made carbon monoxide or something. If, Please. You, if you have a it's blender, I'm soup. legally not responsible for what you do with it. Soup donates $3 and says, how many of these tingle fluids are soup? <laughs> See? Oh, wait. Actually, this, is what, this is what you sat down for. Let me, do you have the list still? I, can I just, hope not. I can just no, pull up the list of tingle fluids. No, what no, did no, I no, come no. back well, to? Okay. I walked in you and was given the donation made, station by MC. Why are you have talking about tingle fluids? <laughs> okay, well, Dino knows a lot about it. Uh-huh. <laughs> did you Google the word fluid? No. Okay. <laughs> Dino, Dino teaches the class Introduction to Tingle Fluids. <laughs> no, introduction to Fluids. Introduction to Fluids. It's very specialized. FLU 1001. <laughs> you know, it, it's, a, it's a prereq for everybody, every undergrad. It, well, I mean, you're 70% fluid. I don't uh, know about you. Well, most days of the week. Yeah. It's, it's Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 8.05 a.m. You know, every freshman's got to take it. You got to start out with that? It's, intro, it's an intro, introduction oh, to man, Fluids. God. Not Fluid Dynamics. Fluids. Don't smoop on me. Liquids. Brother. Don't smoop on me, brother. Oh yeah, Papaya Indian strat match. Remind me. I had an I had an energy drink earlier. Uh oh. And it was like it was like strawberry apricot. There, there's your list of But I looked foods. at it and if you put it together, it says strapricot. You made, you made me think of that. The word strap is just, it doesn't have any place in modern society. <laughs> That's what you laugh at? That's what you perk your little ears up for? Play the game. I forgot you were Play there. Play the game. I forgot you were there. Do the bit. <laughs> Figure it out. The bit is me laughing at the word strap. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> it's, the, it's the best, the worst part of it. Do you find any fluids that you like? Yeah, I mean, half of these are just broth. This one's just called tingly. <laughs> it's a soda. What can I say? It makes it's just tingly. meat in a shell. That's not soda. It's meat. Meat soda. Meat soda. Good band name. Aroma. I mean, they do sell bacon flavored soda. Oh, crap. You're right. That's just wrong. It is. You know, let's be happy that the bacon craze is over. The bacon craze of 2008. Oh yeah, like bacon everything, meal bacon time toothpaste. Was like, we bacon strips and bacon strips yeah. and bacon strips. Here's ice cream with bacon bits in it. All this junk. 
Five apples and six steaks. That's meat soup. There you go. That's what it's made of. Apples? And apples and steak, man. Good. Six bones, four minced meats, two wakami seaweeds, and two pieces of moss. That sounds real. Well, seaweed seaweed is pretty doink. I guess it's a paste. It seaweed. turns into a paste. Ugh. Like a... A puree. Yeah, you, you like squirt it on there. Yeah, yeah pork soda is a Primus album. <laughs> it is, it is. Hey, how do you think you make steamy oil? What do you okay, think goes steamy oil. Okay. Oil and fire. You'd think, but no. That's that's fireball. Okay, here, here, here's the thing. If you're cooking with oil and it and there's like smoke coming out of it, mm -hmm. it's like it's really hot. And a fire could happen yeah. soon. <laughs> yes. You well, need to be oil, careful. So oil is not included in the ingredient list, just so you know. Okay, good. This is good. So let's figure this out. It's steamy oil. It starts with four thick meats. Okay. Keep going. What else you got? Four meats. Thick meats. Well, a thick meat would have a lot of fat in it, right? Which would render out when you cook it. Yeah. yeah. That's so the, that's oil. It's the steam. It gets. It's a fat. Right. Is there any mushroom? No, but there is four love carp, which is fish. So this is fish oil. Love like carp. Like omega, omega three. Okay, so we're, our, we're our, halfway there. Our fish oil is steamy. We're only halfway done. It's a complex item. It is. It's probably the most complex. So we got four thick meats, four love carps, six of something. This this is a, a Tingle Fluids 401 territory. Yes, this and they, they wrote a song about this one. Oh god. What is it? Baby Shark. Oh, man. And finally, you have two of something. What do you think what do you think it is? It's it's related to the things we've been talking about. Alright, meat, fish, it's a clam, some it's kind a of type seafood. Of, type of meat, type of meat. Pork. Rib steak. I was gonna say probably rib steak. That's very specific. Rib <laughs> steak. Rib steak. And that's rib how you make is oil. The worst item to get in the game. It's so awful. But you make oil with it. Yeah, you have to throw a bomb at a monkey on a cliff. What? <laughs> Twice? You heard it. Dino's the expert well, the, here. Well, it's like a fifty percent chance of dropping, so you have to do it multiple times. Gooey oh. tartar, which apparently that that is how they put it, isn't it? Like Gooey tartar. That's how they say it. It's seven okay. newts and don't, eight soft don't, eggs, don't which just sounds like ramen. Newts and soft eggs. You know, we got ten dollars from Stinkos. Good. They're asking, is mayonnaise soup? Well, okay. What are the ingredients of mayonnaise? Uh, mayonnaise is oil, egg. Oil and eggs. That's it. Is that it? And Seasonings. Yeah. Whatever crap so, uh, depending if you've got or... some sort of special mayonnaise, but that's pretty pretty much the basics. It's just. It's an emulsion. It's an emulsion, yeah. yeah that's, that's what emulsion. Wikipedia says. Is that it's the emulsion. fancy word for it? It's a suspension of oil particles and fat or vice versa. So... It does sound like a soup base. It, what's the... Yeah, it sounds like the base of a soup. It sounds like a broth. Oil, egg, and vinegar. That's a broth. It's not a broth. It's, it's a big... It's a thick broth. It's a ketchup. It's an yeah, emulsion. If you were to cook down mayonnaise, like you just took a bottle of Hyman's mayonnaise, <laughs> dumped it in a dumped it in a burner, and then you let it sit. Like you're, you're not going to be drinking, you're, you're not going to be enjoying that on a cold You have day. a broth at the end of the day. No, but you're but like a broth is not a vis. It's not thick. No, like, but if you're if you this, de like if you put your hand in broth and took it out, it would drip off. If you put your hand in mayonnaise and took it out, no, but we're talking your hand about is the, covered in mayonnaise. For we're the talking rest about of the post, the, the, the pre emulsion mayonnaise. I mean, he's been saying emulsion, right? So it's, it's yeah, a, but at that point, it's, it's still three separate things. Like I just like so you take the oil, the vinegar, and the whatever whatever else goes in mayonnaise, and you you, you don't solidify it, right? Yeah. You have it stay yeah. in its you know, in like a plasma a long form, long right? Like smoke. You you drink that. That's a broth. He dislikes. I want to leave. It's yeah. because of the texture. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's not a broth. Texture that makes trusted. a broth though. What do you mean? What do you mean? Like what's a broth? What do you, you think a broth? The, the broth fundamentals of a broth is, 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 really? it is a yeah. base used for building soups a good, a good for building. It's, right. It's flavored water. Yes. It's exactly. water. It's actually water flavored, but there is no water in no, this but, equation because no, but, you've got egg, vinegar, and oil. And what vinegar is basically is water? water. Vinegar and water aren't that no, different. Not vinegar and water are very different. Oil, vinegar, eggs. What part of that is constituting a soup when the eggs are in the form they're in? None of it, because it's none of it's water-based. 
It doesn't have to, does a broth have to be water based? Somebody. Yes. 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 How do you know? <laughs> yes. You what based it. on what? You can make it. <laughs> I can make a You lot can of take things. water and add crap to it and make a broth. I don't want that kind of broth. That's how it works. Okay, fine. So if you do that with you oil, have, what do you have? You like mayonnaise bouillon cubes that you can buy at the and store. And why not? Why hasn't somebody done that? <laughs> because that's not how mayonnaise works. So the oil and the water would not do the well, thing. Well, no, of course they would. So what do you yeah, call an oil stuff. broth? Oh. You gasoline? Don't. Gasoline? You don't. What do you mean? He, well, we have to. Oil, not a broth. No, we have or to know. Can't use oil, not a broth. What's a vinegar broth? Uh, vinegar. vinegar does not turn into a broth. It's then what's, like, how is it turning into mayonnaise? It, because it's mixed together into the state at which oh, well. point the scientific well, thing that happens is the oils it. and the good. fats essentially get to the point where there's enough air traffic well, I don't even know between where to them go from right. that it allows them to be suspended so we're talking in a about air state traffic. of matter. So mayonnaise is an instrument. Someone please donate. Don't do it. Like please the, put us uh, out of our suffering. Please, please, for the you love of God, donate so we can talk about anything else. The horses <laughs> left. Look, you scared, you scared the horses. Is, uh, where's my, where's my strapper cot? Temples. I've That's never so, done the, that before. Yeah. Drink. I just go straight through. I Susie, don't die. Dan, Dan's, <laughs> don't die. Dan's stage name is Susie Strapper <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God. Welcome to the stage. Wait, I need help. I forget. I'm gonna have to retrace my steps through the entire. Oh no! Am I, is it gonna make me redo everything? No. Abra, have you ever have you ever made a, an, an hollandaise sauce? Your door is unlocked. So yes, I know what a hollandaise sauce that is. Bad. I've never made. You one, guys didn't say the same to. thing. You not work You said hollandaise. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm being I'm being Wait, a snooty, I... dumb French. Speaking the, the, Holland, there's a there's a H thing? there. Ho Hollandes. But see, no, the the the, the, the jacked up thing is, how come eggs Benedict became like a breakfast staple? Uh huh. And uh, when Hollandaise sauce is very that's not it. easy to make. That's the that's the last thing you want to make when you wake up in the morning. Make this really complicated emulsion sauce. What would you, you rather you, put on there? You've well, made Hollandaise, no, yeah. It was no. mainly eaten by rich people because you know. You have the you have the servants. Someone else so you, makes it for you. You, you yeah. had someone else make it for you, yeah. Did someone else wake up an hour before you were going to wake up and make it for you? I guess if you have the luxury of that. Then but, you got your head chopped off because France, you know. But but good old revolution. It, but in the real world, when people wake up, they bear, people barely have the energy to like put cereal and milk in the same bowl. Like that's yeah. that's too much. Anything more complicated than that? Pancakes. When did pancakes become? Just put ketchup on it. A staple. No, 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 no. But like even pancakes. Even if you make the the dry mix ahead of time, make your own dry mix. Well, remember, this is an era before like you know m entertainment in most forms that we got in standardized ways. There was no radio. There was no television. No internet. Yeah. Anything so like that. So people had to experiment. So basically, the moment the sun went down, you had nothing to do. So people just went to bed then. <laughs> right? Yeah. Okay. So if, if that's the case, I then mean, you're you up early in the morning. Again, By the time breakfast actually do. rolls around, you're right. like, I've been awake for two and a half hours. What did I do at that time? Everything. You know, <laughs> I might as well, please. you know, go ahead and mix some lemon please, with bro, some bro, egg juice and see what I, you know, make Egg it, juice. Get I like that. We should, we should think about egg juice more. That's, that's <laughs> I think you should not. No, it's a good topic. <laughs> I think you should not. We'll, we'll learn. <laughs> you know, Dino, this is all your fault. Thank you. You, you brought, I, I've you introduced brought. the couch to fluids. Yeah, we didn't know what those were yeah. until you started talking. We'd never soup heard donates $3. Can you make fruit-based soup? Absolutely. Yeah, I have, yeah. I've had a, I had a great strawberry watermelon gazpacho tomato, the other tomato day. Tomato soup. Minestrone. Yeah, tomato, Anything tomato with tomato. Yeah. Well, tomato is tomato fruit or vegetable? Fruit. Fruit. You know the answer. Yeah. It's a fruit. It's a fruit. Yeah. Yeah, it, like, to, uh, the, the great D&D &D thing is intelligence is knowing tomato is a fruit. And wisdom, wisdom is knowing it doesn't belong in a fruit salad. I'm pretty sure my grandma said that, and I'm pretty sure she thought D&D &D was satanic. <laughs> Listen, Abby, you know who says that? People who have never had a super duper sweet cherry tomato. Those, those are more sweet than like, you know, a lot of strawberries or other or orange or other sweet things. I mean, if you're eating a tomato, like, when I'm thinking of tomato, my brain doesn't go to the cherries, though. I'm thinking of like the, the, big, the, big the beefy ones. ones. The yeah. big beefy ones. Mm -hmm. And those are generally less sweet yeah. than the smaller ones. You see, you see, Abra, over the past like nine months, I, I, I've been growing my own stuff in my garden. And like, I just go to the store, I buy every tomato seed they have there. So I have like 40 different tomato seeds. Yeah. So yeah, see some <laughs> big some big beef steaks, some big producers. Yeah. The, you know your Paul your Paul Robesons, your beef steaks, 
uh, uh, tropical sunset. A bunch Are of, you a anthropomorphizing a bunch of weird tomatoes? Ones. Brandy wine. Ooh. Brand, yeah. This. Yeah. Uh, brandy wines, uh, mortgage savers, things Ooh. like that. Yeah. But the biggest variety is in cherries, and most of them are yeah. very sweet. What was the what was the so, point there where so you stupid. talked about mortgages? There's one. There's one called the mortgage lifter. What? It, it, lifter it, or saver? It, 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 it's lifter. It. Okay. Because the guy that bred the seed originally grew mortgages. Like one row of tomatoes, and he made enough tomatoes from these plants, and he sold and them. Took care and of his mortgage. Took care of his took mortgage. Care of his entire mortgage in one year. Man. Because they're big, heavy producers. Yeah. So when a tomato is a heavy producer, does that mean that that it has a lot of juice, or that it can spawn more tomatoes? More like, tomatoes. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> more tomatoes. Big ones and more of them, and very easy. How does it? How does a tomato create another tomato? It, it's a more plant. Flower. It, right, it, it, it makes more vines. Hair, how do you grow more hair? Well, it, it just happens. Collagen. So tomatoes use collagen. Oh, it said yeah. the plant version. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's not done. They have. Hey, oh, it's not done. There's another stuff, phase. You know? Yeah, but it's in a different room. Oh, you beat no, a boss not. while we were talking about this nonsense. <laughs> Partially. I learned a lot. Goro rat. You cross the bridge and then he goes, ha ha ha, you thought. <laughs> and you have to fight him more. There, yeah, there's a, a, a uh, Aber, there's one specific type of cherry tomato. The, the, it's called the SS100. That's a ship. And you'll be happy to know that SS stands for super sweet. Ah. And they live up to it. It is like, it is like uncomfortably sweet. You, you taste it, it's a, it's a little it's cherry. A it's like an explosion. Compare it to cheesecake. It's like a hand grenade. I don't need cheese. Uh, che right. che cheese is a nightmare. Okay, compared to hand grenade. Cheese is a nightmare. No, like like sweetness, like it's much sweeter than a grape. Okay. Like eating grape, grapes are sweet and they're fun. Well, I mean, but they're you can eat a grape or three and be fine. Yeah. Like I didn't like like the imagine the sweetness of an entire milkshake. Sorry to bring it up again, <laughs> but like in one bite, you know, it's it's uncomfortable. That sounds awesome. But like you can't yeah, top it up to a salad and you mix it up, then it's not so bad. Right. Put some, put some Italian dressing on it? Yeah! Yeah, you really don't need a sweet dressing if it's that sweet. Absolutely. Yeah. Right. Sun gold and sugar oh, tomatoes. Sun gold are popular like these. little gold ones, yeah. And what's a, what's a sun sugar tomato? That sounds like a new one for oh, me. Oh crap, yeah, I don't have any Soup continues, this, this asking another flowers, question. Yeah, milk soup. I'm just gonna have to... Huh? Milk soup. Cream -based like soup all the time. Oh yeah, no, there's yeah. tons of cream-based soups. Right cream of mushrooms. Have you had mac and cheese? There, there's a milk, <laughs> thick milk sauce, or che cheese and milk sauce. Be, oh, yeah, Don't I, call I, that I, a soup. It's soup. basically a bechamel. I, I've been having a lot of fun with. Um, I bought a magic powder that. Uh, <laughs> a magic powder. It's, okay, so it's called sodium citrate, oh but basically God, it's a it's a type of salt that they use in processed cheese. I'm gonna cheese have a freaking aneurysm. That preserves it. But when you use it with cheese and milk uh, in the proper ratios, you basically create permanent cheese whiz. Uh, so like, <laughs> the, you know how when mac and cheese gets like old or at least to room temperature, it becomes a solid mass and becomes hard, Don't do it again. and you can't reheat it because yeah. the milk and fat, oh, yeah, you know, the fats and the oil go, separate go. out. Yeah, it's a cave. So the sodium citrate prevents that. Yeah, the moment you heat it back up, it just returns back to cheese whiz. Or like okay. whatever cheese you come use. On, come on, come on. Yay! Yay. Hey. Oh. No. <laughs> oh, we're being summoned. Oh, They're scheming. Good luck. Oh no, no you have been brought to the principal's anyway, office. Keep telling the people. Let, let them know. Let them know. They need to know. Yeah, so like, that's the uh, fun thing about that powder is basically you can use whatever cheeses you want and make your own cheese sauce. Awesome. And you don't have to worry about like, oh, this cheese it's isn't so good for this. Oh, this, you know, this, there's not enough fat content in this cheese. Or this, yeah, you just do what you do. Is mac and cheese cake? No. Yeah, that's a solid. Oh my god, I got bombs. Just, is it? Oh. Let's go, let's go, let's One go. more hit. Let's go one more hit. Good hey. God. Thank you. <laughs> to the G. This is the stupidest boss. I, I, Same. every time that I play this game, this is the only boss that I ever die on. I never have like any other, well, besides the final boss. The final boss I always die on because it's hard. <laughs> but, Get but that this sand. Is this one is evil. I thought you said you, you didn't die. Hmm? 
You said that you, don't, you said you don't die, so you don't have to I usually the, don't, one. but if I do, it's always this one. Okay. You got some more sand. It's the sand collecting game. As the sand runs through the hourglass. So it goes Woo! to long lives. They're scheming in the other room. Yeah, they are. It's scheming time. I'm actually in on the schemes. Give I'm me not that participating metal. because I have a game at some point during the schemings. Oh boy. You know, you know what hour's coming up soon? The witching hour? It's, it's oh boy, 3 a.m. Oh boy, 3 a.m. <laughs> God, I could go for a crusty crab. Crusty crab pizza. Is it time for random SpongeBob quotes? Ooh. East? Oh, I'm I thought you said weast. Status report, Mr. Squarepants. The whole ship is underwater, Captain. Aye. We're marooned, then. Tech desk, I know. I was I, I was in a, a, most of those planning meetings. Same, TBH. No, you aren't even in this stuff on Discord. No, I am. Are, are, you, are you in the? I'm you, in the. I'm in the. I'm the. I'm in the chat for this. You're, hour. you're in the twelve team. Yeah. You're team twelve. Yeah. Oops. So team twelve. Oh, very nice of them to return the incredible original Ocarina of Sounds, uh, Ocarina of Time sound font for this. Yeah. Yeah. Never mind, that is not the Ocarina of Time sound font for this. No, we need to go talk to the elder. Ugh, just let me leave. Slight variation. Discussing tingle fluids at 3 a.m. Please, be careful with your tingle fluids at 3 a.m. Let's pull up more tingle recipes. Yes. Does that mean tingle's recipe system forged the way for the Breath of the Wild's cooking mechanic? Yes. Probably. Yeah. You kind of throw up to 15 things in a pot. But I assume items are much more. I mean, Breath of the Wild you can only use. Yeah, it's actually five. fancier. It's fancier than Breath of the Wild. Yeah, but you have to buy the big pot first. Yes. All right, the long, long ketchup was, of course, seven sweet potatoes. Five, five crisp tomatoes and two aroma toadstools. And a partridge in a pear tree. True. The tingling, of course. <laughs> and the recipe for endless love. If you want yourself a bottle of endless love. Five aroma toadstools, four heart meat, three love carp, and a pong flower. Not a pong flower. Pong flour. There is tomato in the ketchup. There's more. There's more potato than tomato. Oh, we're gonna have to fight Jolene again. Jolene, 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 Jolene. Can you warp somewhere? No, we don't have any warpies over here yet. No warpies on this on this C chart yet. Line back, your girlfriend's making us have to take longer. She might uh, sail past where we need to go, which would be excellent. No, Breath of the Wild is entirely based on the Tingle games. The whole the thing. Nose. Yep. Breath of the Wild's entirely based? Yep. <laughs> I like how this game comes after Wind Waker. If we just made a game with water and islands, it would be fun. More water! 
More water More islands. islands. And then spirit tracks. You know, people don't like water anymore. What do people like? People like trains. Let's people make a love game trains. entirely about trains. Just everything is train themed. Final boss, train. To be fair, trains are pretty dang cool. I know. I'm, I'm not disagreeing. I'm just. It sounded like you were having some dissent against trains. Oh, come on. I, I was describing the Nintendo meeting. When they figured out spirit tracks. What do people Why like? People like trains. Everything is a train. Do you know what the best train is? The train that you're on. No, the donation train. Hey. Yeah. Oh, man. Anyone want to spam a three dollar donation train? The three a three dollar train for three p.m. Yeah, three a.m. The other one. Are we getting closer? That's yeah, in, we that's are. That's in three minutes. In three minutes. Three minutes to the three dollar three a.m. train. Okay, so it's donate at telephone. Stop name. Go three at three. Three at three. Who, who, who is my character going to be this time? I like the little previews. I forgot there's the other tingles. Also, sus bus for um, a link between worlds, please. What a name, the sus bus? The sus bus. Sound like a donation. Yeah, there's my there's my donation all ready to go. Fire Yoshi with twenty dollars and five cents. May we get the current game lore update? Current game lore? We just beat up Limebeck's girlfriend. Where are we going? We're we going in a circle. We're going to the. Oh, you have to break the the can the canopy. Right? Yes. Going to the, the, I don't know, what, I can't remember what it's called, the Isle, not the Isle of Ice, I don't think. Maybe that's what it's called? Um. So, we're going to sink Antarctica. Yeah. Again? Because it's had too much time living. Uh, so, we're gonna go, we're gonna sink it. It's, it's been far too chill for far too long. Jackson. Uh, there it is. Jackson There's Antarctica. Free. We're gonna beat it up. I, I like how you try to course around it and they stop and say, please try to course around this. Are we going? No, it's still a minute. So, yeah, we are in those late night hours, but I know a lot of you guys over in the EU and parts of the world that, you know, aren't America. You guys are, you know, bright, early, bushy-tailed, ready to hit the day. Yeah, if you want to talk about ZeldaCon in uh, your communities mining, where, uh, you know, it's, it, it you know, Basically, you show the Americans that uh, that Zelophon's strong support exists in more than just. Go, 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 go! go. Oh, there goes. So, sorry, sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm cutting you off because it's 3 p.m. A.M. A.M. Well, sorry, three, I don't know what it's time it's. 3 p.m. somewhere. 3 p.m. somewhere. Thank you for donating. Can you please change the donation form so if you go to donate.zelophon.net at the end it says thank you for donating. Hi, we have a three in the morning special. Can you translate us? So we have a three in the morning special. We were told that uh, we we we've got something happening three in the morning. So wow. uh, yeah, yeah, I get, feel get, like get, uh, I feel like it might be time get, for uh, get your clip buttons ready. Yeah, th th it might be might be something happening. I, I'm not sure. I you know. I know, but you, I'm you, ever, you ever watch it. TV and like you, you left the channel on and by the time you wake up you're always like what is this show in front of me? Yep. You know? Get ready that, for that's, that. That's, you, know, you know, maybe you know, maybe we can channel some of those vibes. I'm, I'm trying to give them a lead. And so here's the thing I'm saying about soup. Here's the thing I'm saying about sauce. You see... When you order food with sauce, why do you need the sauce? 
if the food was good to begin with, it wouldn't need any sauce. <laughs> Everyone goes crazy over sauce. Oh, what kind of sauce does it have? Does it have a white sauce? Does it have a red sauce? Does it have a wine sauce? Does it have a milk sauce? I just say, give me good food to begin with. You don't need the sauce. <laughs> you see, whether it's ketchup or mayonnaise or mustard, who needs it? I don't need it. Nobody should need it. Well, here we are in a world with sauce, and we can't get out of it. It is a bad time for cuisine, I tell you. <laughs> well, anyway, I'm going to give the sign to tech right now and do that. and I can't find the sauce. Hey, slow down, MC Gamer. What sauce? When I was a kid, I used to go to this wing place. Every, every, every Wednesday with my family, we wing them. And we would have this amazing chicken, and they had this sauce. It was like a honey barbecue sauce. And you know what I did? I ate 20 of those wings every Wednesday. Well, that explains a few things. <laughs> <laughs> But they had this sauce, Jackson. This sauce, it was so sweet. It was wonderful. It was delicious. Well, let me tell you what, guys. Jerry George, listen to me here. I got your sauce right here. It's hot and spicy. Those people in Buffalo, they rip me off, man. They rip me off. This is your what sauce. What are you doing right here, here, Zach? This what are you talking you about? This is your sauce right here. Here, have a, have a little dip. Have a little dip. Have a dip. Have a dip. Come on now. Jerry, have a dip. Don't include me in this. Jerry, have a dip. You know you want a dip. Have a dip. Come on. Oh. Yeah, right? Have a dip. I'll See? pass for now. Oh, he ain't passing. <laughs> what do you think? This ain't even close to the sauce. What's wrong with it? What's the issue? It's not sweet. It's not tangy. It's hot and spicy. It's all you need. I tell you what. the manufacturer, Jackson. You called the manufacturer. Yeah, I did. I said, 20 years ago, I was a young lad and I walked into the wing place every time I gave them the address. And they called up their supervisor. Can you believe that, Zach? Wouldn't you be a sauce advisor? <laughs> and what did they say? What did they say? They said I was crazy. Well, they were right. <laughs> and? They told me they'd sell me the sauce. How much? They only sell in 12 barrel gallons. How many, how many barrels to a gallon? <laughs> 12 gallon barrel! Oh! <laughs> so did you buy it? Of course I bought it. It expires next week. Oh no. Well, we got to eat it. What are you going to do with it? I'm gonna put it on my chicken tenders, I'm gonna put it on my fries, I'm gonna put it on my ice cream. I don't really care. Yeah, yeah. I have to get through this ice cream by next week, Jackson. And this ain't gonna cut it. You're gonna spill it. I'm sorry. Well, you got quite a problem, <laughs> MC Gamer. Well, if only Elaine were here, she'd tell us what for. That's right. Oh, good. Here comes Elaine. Yeah. Yeah. Come in. Come in, oh, Elaine. It's Elaine. What do you got there, Elaine? Zach, why did you borrow all my paint thinner? What did you use it for? It's hot and spicy. They don't my look that good. Get up! Oh! Get up. What's up? Nah. Give us an applause. Yeah. We don't know what happened. We didn't hear any of that. <laughs> I, I think I think you all heard it. Please please donate what just happened. 
Yes, please tell us. We miss the shenanigans. I hope you enjoyed Three in the Morn, part one. Yeah, that was weird. Anyway, it, we got some donations. Sure, there was a bucket and there was a, a wall that got broken down. I, th I think someone had an intervention because they're obsessed with buckets and breaking down walls. That's my prediction. The Realist Yoshi donates $5. Been watching for many years. Love all you guys do. Help me through some rough times. And now deployment love all you do. And don't forget, stretch and drinks one water. Thanks, the realist Yoshi. Oh my goodness. I've, I've, I've stretched a single muscle. Love Forces Girl gave do uh, donated $3. Dino donates $3. 3 3. That's me. Palm donates $3. Oh boy, 3 a.m. No, see, one donates $3. Let's go $3 train to 3 a.m. Hype. Short little train. It was sauce felt, also paint thinner. Yeah. That does not you, tell you me know, anything. As, as I said, sometimes when you wake up at 3 a.m. and you're not really all that conscious and just there's something on the TV, you know, you, you, you get sauce felt. Sauce felt. Sauce felt. You want to do, do that again? No. I didn't do it. What is this? What happened back here when I was gone? What is this? I don't know. Unroll it. It, it was taped to the whiteboard. Here. Oh. That's not it. Oh! Oh, look at this! Oh, wait! Is that what I think it is? Yes! Blank! Well, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Dan. I appreciate you. <laughs> look what it is. It's blank. Dan, what, Dan what's <laughs> plopping over there? Oh, we're about, um, like a third of the way through the okay. second half of the game. Okay. Um, we're about to enter the Wait, we're a third of the way through the second third of the game? What? The second half. What's okay. So what is that? Like 60... Like 60. To quote Jiggy, I we're don't like, want to do man! I don't know. <laughs> we're like three-fifths of the way through the game. Ooh. Okay. How are you feeling? Feeling all right. Um, the the previous boss to this section of the game is my least favorite boss in the entire game. Why? Well, so because it's awful. Okay. <laughs> it's what, awful. Which one was that? It's this Dodongo one where you have to control the Goron child. Oh and yeah. At the same time. It's not that hard. It just sucks. It just sucks. How are you doing, Nosey? I'm doing great. Feeling well? Yep. Did you like our terrible skit? We didn't hear what we was hear going on, but... Oh, did you like what our pantomime? Uh, absolutely. <laughs> That's what I said. I, I think you had an intervention because someone was obsessed with buckets. Uh, That's it. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what happened. An intervention with... <laughs> someone so, likes kicking cardboard. I feel like children are a bad game mechanic. <laughs> My favorite thing was the, the, the live studio audience was so shocked by you kicking the, the boxes <laughs> that they forgot they were supposed to clap they didn't you clap, and, yeah. like cheer you and they're more like, oh god, what just happened? <laughs> like, I, I, knew, I knew that's what the boxes were there for, like they're gonna knock that, that tower box. Oh, I was too transparent. Next time I'll have to build my own door. Yeah, it, 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 Zach actually asked me, he was like, where's the door? And I was like, what do you mean where's the door? <laughs> so within seconds I built a door. I mean, we have a tree. I'm sure we can get a door. I, I, I never want to talk about the tree again. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Did you actually watch back the footage of it falling in, though? It, I saw it on I saw it on screen. It it's sick. amazing. It looks sick, yeah. It, when it fell in, I was like... My entire unscripted monologue when you guys made me be four people. <laughs> but the tree, great. Four people. Wait, I, I think I missed two of them. Well... Uh, Cletus counts for like three. Oh, okay. He's a figure. The realist Yoshi came back to my phone to hear paint thinner and was confused. The math isn't adding up here. Also, hashtag shave the jiggy. Do, do we have that as a... No. No. But keep, gonna, ta keep, keep talking it about it. Way, yeah. keep it. Keep it moving. Keep, yeah. it in, keep the energy in the air. Keep, keep, keep the shave energy. Where's the door hole? What does that mean? Somebody asked me that in chat. I'm, I'm probably not supposed to ask questions like that. But. No, you're. It, it's a meme. Don't worry about it. What's a, explain it. 
Know your meme dot MC. Okay. In an episode of the the, the infamous uh, tween uh, show, The Vampire Diaries. No, Drake and Josh. Oh. Uh, Dr Drake and Josh are building a treehouse. Oh, the treehouse episode, right? And, and and they're up in the treehouse, and Josh finishes uh, ha hammering in some some pieces, and he turns around to Drake, and he's like, uh, or, or, uh, "Drake, go get the drill or whatever." And, and he's like, "Okay, I'm going to." And then he can't get out because there's an door hole. J Josh is like, "Drake." Where's the door hole? Yeah. And he's like, I, 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 I traced it out there with the magic marker. <laughs> you're, you're I'll show, I'll you're, show no, it to no, you no, some no, later. No, I like it. Your Josh voice was the exact same voice you just did for George Costanza. George C. <laughs> George and Josh. I like that. Oh, uh, I, I guess a, a tidbit of information about uh, that horrible thing that, that, that just occurred, that I we like, just did. I liked it. I know, I actually did like it quite a bit. Um, that's a real story of, of how I called the manufacturer of sauce and bought four gallons of it, not 12. And for the I Seinfeld fans. The realist fans. comedy comes from true places. Yeah, it comes from the heart. Oh, and, and I also, when I wrote the email to the manufacturer, I signed it George C. because I realized it was a George Costanza moment. Yes. The um, the hot and spicy thing for, for the real Seinfeld fans, that's a, it's a deep cut reference. His, his tomato sauce he makes while he's shirtless in the kitchen is hot and spicy. That's what he says. That's also one of the only Seinfeld references I know, so I just said it 19 times. Hope you liked it. Oh, I hate bubbles. Link's ability to like no shot side and like no look side shot side slash people, so sick. I definitely just had a moment where. I realized that the end of my shift is coming because I was just staring at the Zelda game. Yeah. I kind of felt like I was watching a Twitch stream at home. Like, good thing I don't have to do anything. I guess I can watch <laughs> Zelda. And then you started talking. Like, oh, like a second later, I was like, what's going on? Remember, Who's you, that? You remember your, Who's your, that? <laughs> you're in content. What's that guy down there? The, the, the wiggly bug? Yeah. The, that's a wiggly bug. What's he do? Actually, OC, what's the name of that monster? I'm pretty sure it's a wiggly bug. Okay. Wiggly bug? It's canon now. Is, is there context to this? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes, there is. <laughs> yeah, there is. That's great. <laughs> okay. It's, 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 it's an image of the wizard pondering his orb, but it's me it's pondering the magic yeah, eight ball. I, I, I was about to say just zoom no, in, no, like no, pinch no. zoom to show it closer to the camera, but that's not how that works. What's your favorite orb? Oh, it, it rotated. We have a game sphere. It's spherical. It's empty space. Zoomed in. Hey, what's your favorite orb? The the orby kind. Ooh. Oh, wow. I have an answer. I have a different answer, but I'll see if anybody else answers. I, I gotta I gotta think of some good orbs. Soup orb. Right yeah. now, I like I like Alyssa's the best. She turned it into a, into like a verb. Anybody else have any favorite orbs? Or adge adjective. I'm, I'm trying I'm trying to think of some good orbs. I, I have one good one. Please. The orb of confusion. What are you? That? Yeah, 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 it's from I'm SpongeBob. Now I'm confused. <laughs> it's from Bullet SpongeBob. Sponge. What what episode? The same no. network as Jake and Josh. No. <laughs> That's the name of the episode. Wait, wait. We used we to still sing the... have the Orb of Confusion. There you go. I know. You see. Somehow the world will change for me. I, I mixed it up so with the iCarly theme song oh. for a second, which yeah, I yeah. sang about six hours ago. Hey, can I see that? <laughs> Just for a moment. <laughs> Wait, it actually it actually rolled in a really cool way. It like, How it are we like supposed did a to whole... create our hot new YouTube comedy? Will it plunge? <laughs> is, is that a thing? Yeah, it will be. Now. I'll make it. Oh, see, so do you want the plunger back? No. Okay. I, I, was like, I, I will bring it back because I start to <laughs> feel bad afterwards. I will script that. Okay, we gotta, we gotta record episodes. Anything. That's not true. Uh, uh, we gotta record 30 second <laughs> clips and make them all into individual episodes, each with a, their own dedicated sponsor segment. Dedicated wham. Dedicated wham. <laughs> <laughs> I, love, I love what makes Dan arrive, you know? It's, it's never the things you'd expect. 
Dedicated Wait, we talk, wham. I heard the word wham, and my brain just went to last Dedicated Christmas. Dedicated wham. Dedicated wham. Oh, oh, I thought you were talking wham like the band. Last Christmas, like the, like the <laughs> wham Christmas. is very confusing. I gave I you my heart. Like that one? I mean, it, we've, we've entered August, so all of the search results of all of the Christmas songs have begun their little crawl upward. Did wham do that? Yeah, la la was that last? Week? It was just George Michael. No, it was George Michael. Bluth. One of my favorite things about this dungeon is the fact that you get the grappling hook and you just get to start snatching wigs. <laughs> <laughs> From the, the wiggly bugs. From the, the wiggly bugs. Wiggly bugs. The realist Yoshi Actually, donates their favorite Drake and Josh skit. Delivery for Josh. Josh, thank you. Have a nice day. Delivery guy, don't tell me what to do! You had three unique voices there. Good job. See, see, what I love about that is, is, is you change the scene because I very more distinctly remember it was all very subtle where it was like, have a nice day. Don't tell me what to do. And, and he walks out like, so he doesn't I, yell. I never watched the show. Yeah, he, he doesn't yell. He just says it very <laughs> casually. It's very good. Oh, you know, he hasn't capitalized in the donation message. Uh, oh, I gotcha. It's what? what it is. What happened? I like, I got... I grappling hooked a bug on accident and then like sent it over to like the post so it like ripped the bug's mask off and it slammed into the post. <laughs> <laughs> so dumb looking. You needed the mask. I was like, what just happened? Also, I'm now realizing that because the wiggly bugs have uh, masks on, they might be of the Helma variety, like Helmosaurs. Is that a, is that like a species? Oh. Yeah, Hel Helmosaurs are a species. Is of... it, a, or is it a genus? Kingdom Palace. <laughs> that's not it. That's not it. That's not it. That's not it. It's a pleasure having you here. <laughs> Hello, and <laughs> <laughs> What is it actually? Phylum. Content you can get exclusively at 3 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> Remember to send this to your parents <laughs> so they can watch this too. He, he runs it. He runs it. He made that. Why were you up so late last night? <laughs> uh, <laughs> this. Oh. This is why. Oh Let's no! <laughs> you did it, dude. You did it. You did it. We did it. We all did it together. One day I'll get back up off the ground. It's gonna be a minute. Yeah. Hand? No, I'm, I, I, I'm just waiting for the chat to scroll up enough. <laughs> all right. Hey, how are you? You got something right here. Probably. No, I'm such a dumb idiot. <laughs> You're not a dumb idiot. You fool. Everybody's good. Me and my little feces. But he's fine. <laughs> My stomach! I must be thinking about the sauce. The Hot sauce. and spicy. No, sweet and tangy. Oh, that's just what you need. Like tang. Were you a tang guy or a sunny D guy? Uh, Coke Zero. What is tang? What do you mean? I know it's what like, sunny D is. It's like tang is like a is like a powdered orange drink. Oh, so dehydrated sunny D. Kinda. Yes. Were you a were you a Tang guy or a Sunny D guy? Any of you? Uh, mom always bought Sunny D. Yeah, I don't know what Tang is, so Sunny D. Tang? See, I D. I like. Any Tang or Tang is like, right it's like in the same space as like Kool Aid in my brain. So like, okay. it's not even equivalent to Sunny D. Unleash the power of the sun. It contains five percent juice. Yeah, it's interesting. I went to uh, the Netherlands, and uh, the Fanta over there is actually clear. Like, like not fully clear, but like... What's it taste like? Water? Uh, orange juice. Same. Like, it's it, it, it's actually fundamentally built with real orange juice rather than, you know, whatever so, but, it is over here because of laws. You can't have a piece of... You can't have orange on the label with it not having orange as a primary ingredient. Are you trying to tell me orange juice is naturally clear? Uh, well, no, more transparent. Like, you can actually see through the bottle and, like, see your hand on the other side. What's the difference between clear and transparent? Well, clear would be, in, like, you would basically, you would, you so, would like, water. So, look, it's kind of like apple juice. Yes, apple like juice apple juice. Clear. Clear's that thing at the airport you get so you can go through faster. I wish I had that at JFK. It's pretty great. Cool. Oh. Orange soda. 
The Netherlands doesn't have orange Fanta. No, it has orange Fanta, but that orange Fanta actually has orange in it. But isn't Fanta orange soda? Are you saying yes. orange or orange? The same thing. They're not. Orange. Yeah, I know what that is. Orange. Oh. What's the difference between an orange, orange and an orange? A lot. Vowels, probably. <laughs> yeah, you say Fanta, all I think is orange soda. I don't think orange juice. They have grape, don't they? No, but like, it's orange soda that is built with orange juice. Is yes, it, but... As it, opposed to... Orange soda here is clear. No, it's not. No, it's not. It's, it's, it's orange. It's bright neon orange. You can't see well, bright. Well, it, it's, 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 it's orange. apple juice-ish. What do you mean? Yeah, it's what? Like, no, it's translucent, but... What do you yes. drink? Bright... Orange. What, there's like, a like you're, you can't see through that bottle clearly. Somebody's hand on the other side. There it are might two be like a skin like soda. blob, but like that's it. Yeah, no. Sure. There's two types of juices. There's two types of drinks. There's apple juice and orange soda, and and apple juice is is not clear, right? So it's it's like not right. Orange apple juice, juice is clear. Orange soda. No, it's what? No, it's apple colored. Yeah, it's, it's apple, apple colored, colored, but you can see your hand through it. It's colored like the inside of an apple. That's not clear. That's translucent. Oh, that's the word. Right. Yes, it's trans. Yeah. So, it, like, Water Fanta over there is much more translucent because it's not full of junk. It's just, it, it's more natural flavoring. It, it's more natural. It's that like, there's less additives. So, so ne Nether Netherlandian orange, orange drink. Yes. Is an orange. Well, no, it has to. It has more orange in it than our I'm orange. Sure Oranges aren't them. clear. No, but Wait, if, okay, if you were to get a glass of orange juice, I, not from a Sunny D bottle, yeah, but, but from like you squeeze the down. oranges yourself. That's going to be orange. The it's not going to be a, as orange as a bottle of Fanta, though. That's fine. It doesn't have to be. But but it's, but it's as but that orange juice, that real orange juice, is as orange as the Fanta over in the Nether. But it's not as clear as water. No. So it's translucent. It's, hey, there you go. I'm glad we're all on the same page. But it's we not have to go outside and squeeze an orange. Oh, do I have to set a bomb upstairs out. and then come down? Do you have an orange? I don't have an orange. Oh. Right. Someone have an orange. Well, I know Dan. I have, I have Mandarin. There you That's go. Pretty close. Dan has <laughs> stuff. Dan, what do you have here? Donation goal to go squeeze it outside and figure out what color the juice is. That's <laughs> like if I uh, see. I, I tried to transition away, and you just started talking about manual labor. That. You okay. are going to perform. You, you don't. You don't like squeezing no, things. No, because if you I, leave a bomb, then we. So I, Dan, how is the game? It won't. It's uh, going good. They're working on it over there. Hey, did you know we've got shirts and merchandise and stuff? Wow, hey, really? Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. Not oh, it's this one. The, it's this this one's illegal. So we've got some pretty neat head. merch. If you're interested, if you head on over to zelathoncom slash slash uh, store. You can find some wonderful merch that we have. We've got hoodies, mugs, all sorts of fun posters, um, mouse pads, wonderful things over there. If you are interested in getting yourself some cool, wonderful Zeldathon swag, um, I believe right now uh, the shirts, $5 of every Yeti shirt goes to uh, goes back to the charity. Uh, the rest of it goes to, you know, actually producing the product. Um, I do not know offhand um, what the store percentage is, um, but there is some wonderful things over there uh, that you can get. Uh, either way, it goes to support uh, Zelathon and our, uh, the things we fundraise for. My brain is a little tired at the moment. So Couches are expensive. We are also, we've also got some wonderful things from <laughs> um, Heroic Replicas. We've got our classic. Oh, okay. Did not show that. Show, show me the kinstones. Show me the kinstones. It's not showing me the kinstones. Okay, so we've got these wonderful kinstones. Basically, these lovely weighty coins that you can get twenty-five dollars uh, for. Is it twenty-five for the kinstones? I don't remember. Fifty for the kinstones. Twenty-five fi goes to the charity. Fifty for the kinstones, and twenty-five of that fifty goes to the charity. These are wonderful, wonderful. Um, Coins made by heroic replicas. There's there's a lovely weight to them. They have a great feel. Wonderful work. Heroic replicas is also doing these mini megaton hammers. Mini ton. Mini ton hammers. My overlays don't seem to be working at all. Go mini ton. Uh, it's being weird. Okay, cool. Yeah, I, I don't know if any of my overlays are working. I might have to reload the dungeon notifier. But look at this disc. 
these mini ton hammers, there's only are being loaded later. Here you go. Alright. So, cool. Nice solid metal, you have a triforce on one side and a silver on the other. Very weighty. Very nice. Can you whack it against something so we can hear the metal sound? Now on the ASMR mics. Yep, and I know that the mini ton hammers, there's only 250 of them. So you gotta get your hands on them ASAP. Um, they are one sixth replicas of the uh, megaton hammer that is part of our grand prize giveaway. So you can grab those up as well those are in a limited quantity so yeah if you buy one of the kinstones you can lick it yeah you we're, can, we're not going to stop you yeah we can't stop you whatever you want to do with the kinstones you're free to lick them you can try to turn it into use them as pogs whatever the whatever your heart cookie. desires you know you are free to do with them as you please we we, we oh recommend gosh. that you have them as a display item Why did we do we've that? also got I some I was trying to get down and it wouldn't let me get down lovely shirts at the yeti.com we have forward. first oh kid God. from artsy rosie this wonderful shirt features majora looking at the viewer Skull Kid scarily floating. Don't accidentally. Part of our oh, wonderful yeah. marathon yeah, based around Majora's yeah. Mask. I as well as Moon, Moon Phases by Marzake. This design oh, has a cute. lovely moth the... with uh, oh, its wings oh, that look like uh, Majora's yeah, Mask. Can. Wonderful no, little, uh, wonderful little design. Thingy. We have Kingdom Souvenir by Rain T. Wakefield. A bit more of a, a general purpose Hyrule oh, advertisement that, trying to that, get you to visit the countryside. Awesome. Hopefully between uh, Ganondorf yeah, attacks. On one, and then... oh, We've got gosh. the wolf. With the bow to the wolf. switch. By Riposta 2T. It's Lovely a, shirt. A, if a, you a, are enthusiasts of Twilight Princess or just good uppers in general we've got a lovely reprint of our classic pulling shirt by rain t wakefield if you enjoy going fast on boats this is the shirt for you or not on boats oh. or you know just in general if you enjoy speed running by flicking the control stick back and forth and then swimming at very high speed I'm gonna have an aneurysm. we've got the four goddesses shirt by evelyn jane all four of them all four of them once again, you can visit the yeti.com or zelthon.net slash store to pick up these wonderful oh, items. And of every $15 shirt, $5 goes to the charity. So even when you're not directly donating, you're still supporting direct relief. If you're not directly reliefing, you're still supporting directly donating. Huh? Yes. No, what'd you say? I don't know anymore. Was it about how if people buy a shirt it's and the money goes toward the charity, it's like they donate, yeah, and they get a shirt for it? No. Okay. Well, if you buy a shirt, part of the money goes to the charity. That's pretty cool, because then you get a shirt and you still donate it. It's like the yeah. best of both worlds. I said that entire thing talking to Link. How much does it mean it's on the camera away? Um, well... It's uh, scale pounds. one to six, and the uh, three megaton hammer weighs no. But what is so that? Is that scale pounds? each dimension? It'd be like six pounds or so. Yeah. Is that is that each dimension though? Like, because if you scale every dimension down by six, you're scaling the volume down by two sixteen. I don't know, but buy one and measure it. Let but us know. Please, please get one and tell us. I think a lot of people here are getting them, so. Wow, the bar just reloaded. Wow, that was cool. My next. Oh, is your game next? Yeah. Oh heck yeah. Wow, OC, OC combo. Yeah. Heck yeah. I'm just yeah. I'm just, I'm, I was puzzles, looking for like the right time to ask Dan like how's it going, and then I got actually really interested. Oh my God. It looks like a face, two eyes, and I was. Well, that's what I was saying. Like when you oh, activate no. the face, and then it cuts around. You're making six five hundred. I really hope so. 
We were less than fifty dollars away. I hope we can get fifty dollars in the next six days. Before end of game, that is easy mode, guys. Yes. Yeah. You know. If you want to do something at sixty-five hundred, and record the first episode of Will It Plunge. No, we need to be more more than that. We need, we need to plan things. You have yeah. You don't have items. You don't have yeah. Well, every episode is just one item. There you go. It's like a lot. We, we're, 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 making, we're making a YouTube channel. We need content You're going to stretch that content as far as you can. I love it. Think of it. Just looking around this room, we got like 100 episodes here. You sure do. Some of them are, I already know the answer to, but it's about how you sell it, you know? Yeah. Actually, I know a lot about what you can and can't plunge. Accept the bomb into your life, please, sir. <laughs> Radical acceptance. Good at um, extruding from myself a pizza man. What does that mean? Uh, I don't know. Pizza man like what like, Lena does pizza. Yeah. Man? Like that? I can't do. I can't do it like she does. I don't, I don't even remember it. I'm not a pizza. I don't. Pizza I'm, I don't I'm not really like a. Wait, that was good. Pizza man. Yeah. Oh, see, yeah. yours was really good. I like. That. I wanna be a pizza man. I wanna be a pizza man. Pizza man. Pizza. I just remember Toucan Sam. Ooh, pizza yeah. Man. Jackie Chan. Jackie Chevy Chan. Van. What else is there? What else, Ryan? Pepsi uh, Man? Pepsi Man. Is that from Chuck? Pepsi Man. Ocean Pepsi Man, the, the lean song. Stand on the button, Link. I thought I'm it was going to rhyme. Van. Peter Pan. Peter Pan. Jackie Chan. Uncle Dirty Sam. Dan. Dirty Ooh. Dan. Good. Ah! Strawberry I Dan. say I'm Dirty Dan. No, I'm Dirty Dan. I'm Dirty Dan. No, oh, this is Patrick. Who are you calling Pinhead? <coughs> oh my gosh, doing that voice was not good for my throat. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, you're good. You're safe. He sent you. Evil dumb bug. Stabbed his butt. I did. I sliced him in half. That means you have two smaller evil dumb bugs. What have you done? I said, say goodnight. Say goodnight, girlfriend. Goodnight, girlfriend. <laughs> True. I like that. Good morning, everybody Just who's waking up at you? this hour. Whatever hour it is in your part of the world. Good morning to everybody in the whole entire universe, specifically people watching Zelda Phone at this hour, but <laughs> all of those people except for all of the bugs in this dungeon. Are they people? Good morning to everybody. Uh, I don't think there are any bugs in this dungeon waking up right now. Are bugs people? Who knows? I would say like if they're sentient or. Okay, do you think all level. sentient beings are people? I would say that Let's we should probably dolphins. be respected as close to people as we can manage. Okay, in yeah, society. I completely agree with you, but. Like, in terms of semantics. Can you activate the well, switch? Well, it depends. Uh, are you using people as if just, if it's only back. people who are <laughs> humans, or people as in a broad Good term talk. for those that get equal rights and respect as if they are in the level of a human? Obviously, the species categorization. Well, well, if you're going with the species that, categorization, right? then it's just limited <laughs> to humans. Like, or people diets. referring to persons, <laughs> plural. But, when you, but with other times there person, have been things in media, in like, pocket. are AI people, like... Oh. Is that, it, that isn't telling you that they're humans, it's saying that they're, you know, do we give them the same respect as if they were a human? Well, sure, but nobody's nobody's talking about that with a scorpion. Right well, now. I mean, if it was a scorpion that was sentient in that sense... Of course. ...then it would be people in that sense. In that sense. But we're, we're talking semantics. We're being prescriptivist here. Prescriptivist? Or, or yeah. Dictionaries. Dictionaries. Okay, okay, okay. You know, uh, this that's, context... That's a new one. I... I 
was not Crap. aware that that was something. I Oops, don't know if I should add that to my lexicon. Or not. This content is is just me arguing with nothing to the viewers because they can't see. You. So, no, no, you don't, you don't, you gotta, you gotta read the things. Yeah. Well, uh, hey, if people donate, then you can stop this conversation any moment you'd like. Look, we're we're just telling you guys how to do it. Come on now. But yeah, no. Uh, I'd say yeah, bugs. Uh, bugs at any life form deserve respect oh, really? in a way, but I don't know. If it, you know, if a wasp is flying in front of you or a fly lands on your food, you're not gonna be like, well, he's hungry too. You know. You don't have time to get philosophical about that stuff. Yeah. You're like, please, I don't need a wasp flying in front of me to go to crap. I screwed that up. It's crazy that we have the name Phil and we have philosophy. You know. I'm sure it's some, it comes from something Latin. Well, it's like you're just getting like a genetic buff, you know, when it comes to thinking. Nice. Nice. You're exposed his face. Oh, I wasn't paying attention again. I hate the way that this is. Like, the way that it works on the Wii U. You have to like constantly be looking back and forth, left and right. I didn't know that it hurts you. Now I know. I forget how the second phase works as well. I think it's basically the same thing. No, uh, you don't have to like. Oh no, you you slam you their faces them through the pole. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just remembered it. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Not like that. <laughs> Not like that. While I'm here, I should probably just like take this potion. Fluids. 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 Oh, now you're stacked. Look at you. There you go. That's all you need, a little power up. Wait a on. Just run back and forth a little bit, and then they stick their tongue out. And you just need your steamy them. oil. Yeah. That's, that's true. What does that do in game? I have no idea. I never use it. I don't use like any of the fluids in game. You know a lot about them. Mm-hmm. It's because you have to make all of them for Yeah, yeah, make all of them 100%. We don't even know, need to know the recipe. You just get the recipe item, and then like tap the things and make this. I recently successfully. Got the absolute perfection achievement in Stardew Valley. And you I beat never the game. Look at Stardew Valley ever again. Does that mean you beat the game? Yes. It's crazy. I actually I have beaten Stardew Valley for real. What happens? Do you like get your own valley? Um. It doesn't say what it does. The end of the game. Um. They show you the summit, and it's just like this really heartfelt cutscene. That's cool. It's good. It's a good ending to the game. I, I like think that. it was worth it. Although I did spend like a jillion hours. Right, approximately weeks. But, you know, it's worth it. Oh my gosh, I've never gotten that attack from him before. That was insane. It's now a speedrun. It's never happened. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Woo! Woo! Oh my gosh, Taylor, hi! <laughs> Hi Taylor! Taylor, Taylor. I, the only Stardew Valley achievements I don't have are the ones for Junimo Kart and uh, 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 the, the, the other arcade game. I can't think of what it's called. I, my brain wants to call it Lonely Ranger and that's not what it's called. <laughs> Journey, <laughs> or Journey of the Prairie King. Walker, a, Texas Ranger. Right. Can we get some love in the chat for Taylor and the development team? 100%. Yeah, the dev team. So killing great. It. Go dev team! Yay! Two minutes have been added. TY. Wow, that's a lot. Two whole minutes? A lot of sand. Yeah. Jeez. I forgot that like that's how much sand they gave you. 
That's kind of crazy. Second row. And we're going back to the temple. Oh, sure am. Back to the temple of the Ocean King to get that final C chart. Let's go see that chart. Um, was that a pun on C? It was. Crazy. Did you just see the letter too? Could you get too? me back to the island? Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. You're the best. Oh, Wait, which right island do you want to go to? Ocean King. Temple of the Ocean King. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, Dan, are you all right? Yeah, I just need to run the bathroom. All right, well. I'm going to go release some fluids. You're in more of a jog right now. Speaking of fluids, I'm going to obtain some fluids, which is right over here. All right, OC, what's going on here? You're going to I'm going to go back to the Temple of the Ocean King. Why? Is he there? They were sipping some stew. Uh-huh. Do they not do they have spoons in this game? Uh, no, I think so. Hey, welcome back. I have fluidized. How was yeah. it? A lot of us just right. departed really quickly to hydrate up and make sure you're hydrating as well. Get some fluids in you, stretch your legs. Just do a little wellness check for yourself. Stretch your legs. You're welcome to stretch your fingers as well uh, by typing in donate.zelda.com. Uh, all of your donations go directly to Direct Relief, uh, helping with humanitarian aid all over the place. You know, ev everywhere that humanitarian aid is necessary, but especially spots like Ukraine and areas that are hit by uh, heavy natural disasters. So, 100% of your uh, donations, that's where they go, directly to Direct Relief. And my all-time top fluid, according uh, uh, answering this question in chat, is uh, water. You should drink some water. Uh, water, or maybe like, what's the saline solution they put in like your IV drip? That's something the that Direct Relief does. They help uh, provide medical supplies. But like maybe the saline solution they put in like an IV, because I've been, you know, I've been down and out before, and that that stuff has saved me. So if you wanna, if you wanna help some people that don't have access to that stuff get access, uh, donate.zolathon.com. That's what's up. Ooh, is, is this the ocean time? I like ocean time. Uh, let's see. I know that's one. Backwards end is one. Backwards that's an N. Backwards end. Uh, Backwards end is a, is a... Wow, okay. All right. Oh, is it N for Northwestern? 10,000 IQ here. Million. Wait, that, that sounds like math. Yep. Wait, where are we going? I think I'm going to... I don't know. I think it's south of where you are. Yeah. I, I think it's the bottom half of the hourglass. Right. Let's three, three, three. try that. I don't know if we got all the... I do remember seeing get that one. In straight lines. What is that? What was that? I'm trying to figure out uh, <laughs> which warps you got. There. What even was that shape? An hourglass? Bottom hand. Uh, no, no, a uh, lidless hourglass. The hourglass uh, that you turn over to switch it, but you realize there's no top, so you so just throw it you all the sand. So if you complete it, if you complete oh, it, is that so the much. Phantom Hourglass? Is that how you beat the game? You, you beat it by completing the, the hourglass, though, yeah. Wow, that makes sense. You gotta fill it with sand first, so we're going around collecting sand. That's pretty cool. We have so much extra time to go into the, the Temple of the Ocean King now. We're gonna start with, I think, 18 minutes now? I'm getting massive Hall of the Mountain King vibes. Have you seen Line Rider synced to that? Sure have. It's very mesmerizing. Yes. I love Line Rider, it's so good. Can we have like a donation goal for Line Rider? It's just me watching a, a video of Line Rider and crying. And like occasionally saying like half of a word. Yeah. Oh, see that's pretty quick. Three minutes and 34 seconds. What happens if you run out of time? Uh, you start over. Like canonically. You die. Okay. 
<laughs> Can- canonically? The, the, the metaphor is pretty straight up. Got it. <laughs> canonically, whenever whenever you <laughs> run out of time, the, the hourglass stops and goes, a new hand touches the beacon. Mm. And then your life is ruined forever. Where, where's the, what's the beacon? Or is this a metaphor? That's an Oblivion reference. Uh, I thought it was Robert Frost. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> My brain just processed that. I took the road less traveled by. <laughs> uh. Yeah. I love going the quick way. Hey, let me tell you something about that. Oh no, rats. Alright, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna get closer to a mic. But not this mic. Oh, okay, I guess it's just us. Actually, it's just us now. This yeah. works. Yes! Couch donos. Couch donos. dinos. Couch donos. Couch dinos. We have, we have the technology. Mm -hmm. Your donations will appear on this small device. Stun scream. I can't say. I all can the also words put I pictures in front say. of us too. Like, wow, look at those prizes. So, so we can we can we can do stuff behind the pictures. Oh, nice. I think girly girly gal pal. Oh wait, crap 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 crap. The issue with this is it says our total is currently zero. So please donate so we no longer have zero dollars on this page. A new hand touches the beacon. <laughs> I think that's such a funny meme. What is it from? Uh, Oblivion. Or Skyrim, uh, one of the Elder Scrolls games. The goal is beat the game and be entertaining. I think we're yeah. succeeding at at least one of those things. I, I got Donos don here. Hey, VJ. What else we got oh, on no. this? You got any games on your iPad? Don't got any games on your phone. You got Mario Run. Ooh. You got Hearthstone. Hearthstone. I think you take pictures, that's true. Wow. This camera's awful. <laughs> I just made the crummiest face. But you couldn't see it because my face is covered by a mask. What did I have open that had the donation? Oh, everyone in chat, Skyrim. Thank you for correcting me. I couldn't remember which Elder Scrolls game the the bit was from. What was just open? Was it Safari? It was, okay. Oh heck! Oh, I have... so so that one's logged into donation station. This one's logged into tech. Uh... I have more controls here. What background do we want for the donation bar? Where, <laughs> where we want to go? Want to go into water? Wait, we can do we can do old yeah. old, old nice. quick gal. We can do one of these. Oh, it's gonna hit the it's gonna hit the girly whirly. We have to avoid her. Oh, can I not? Oh, rats. Get too far. Yeah. Well. Just run up to the... Yeah, we'll just go right here and pray for the best. I played this game like five years ago now. I don't remember much. I remember these having really cool puzzles, but also being the most annoying thing ever. Yeah, and now we have to run back down here because of they that. They take forever to 100% though because you need all the ship parts. Uh, the first Ooh. time that I ever, whenever I was learning this game, I was like doing it, like f getting all the ship parts on accident. And I was like, this is unnecessary. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I think, I think the I goal think... of the game is to complete the ship. Right. Like, I think OC, you actually came into my stream and you were like, are you getting all ship parts? And I was like, 
am I getting a push? <laughs> I was like, I don't know. I'm just doing what seems like is the correct thing to do. Yeah, but if you if you don't care about chip art, you can skip so many. Hey, if tests. we all if we all stop yeah, making yeah, yeah. making sound, then Gamaltima can go to bed. <laughs> I heard a giggle from the other room. Crap! God. Oh my god, Miss Woman is so quick! Hate her. She's getting shot in the back. <laughs> Watch out for the... For the phantoms, yeah. No, I meant the... Uh, the Reaper. You know, the invisible ones, they give it to you, uh... Just shove Zelda into it. Oh, yeah, the, yeah, the, the, the... Yeah. That's what I meant. I, I just said the wrong thing. The little time stealer guys. Yeah. Little rancid... POSs. Okay, you got two chasing you there. Oh, I need this so this I can go one goes and in get the my square circle. Hole. Yes. And then I have to put them in in a very specific order. Oh my he's gonna, god, he's gonna, gonna poke you! I'm gonna get... <laughs> yep. Yeah, that happens. Oh <laughs> Your dungeon is a jerk. Isn't it like you did all this ten minutes ago or something? Yeah. Yeah, but That's now I have to do it again. Now I have to do it again and slightly differently. Who changed the who changed the thing? We're in, we're in the Temple of the Ocean King. Waterland. It's very it's very slightly different. And every time you have to do one or two extra floors. So you have to redo everything you've done six times. And do it a seventh mm -hmm. time. With a slight variation. And it's rancid. So I have a tech shift starting in seven minutes. Ooh. Can I just like tech from this laptop, from this iPad? Is that Probably legal? Good if you wanted to. Okay, I can't switch to challenge cam from here. Oh, so just okay. don't, just don't do anything on challenge cam, and then I don't have to move. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I, I, I think my, it's a worthy sacrifice. I need my notes. It's a uh, square, circle, triangle. Guy Larky, hello. Oh my gosh, thank you for the raid! Welcome, welcome in, friends. raiders! Welcome, raiders. Welcome, welcome. Should you talk about what the heck's going on? I keep, like, waiting to... to go and then, like, not paying attention. Welcome! We're, we're at Zeldathon. Go, 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 Zeldathon go, 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 Daybreak. Go, go, go. For a six-day charity marathon, faster. raising money for direct relief. Whoa. Oh they're a fantastic humanitarian aid organization committed to uh, sending di di relief directly around the world to places that need it most. Uh, that's where your money's going. Great cause. Okay. She going. You, you can yeah. win some prizes. Look at these cool prizes. Donate $50 for this stuff. Look at these cool prizes. Donate $20 for this stuff. That's it. Let's play some more games. It's that simple. Who's playing the game? Hi, I'm Starmie. I'm playing the video game right now. Hey, I'm OC. I'm not playing the game right now. <laughs> Hi, I'm Dino. I have the Magic Tech iPad. Uh, I'll, I'm, unless Abra wants three donations, I have donations here. I'm playing the next game, though. Yeah. We, we got Couch yeah. Station now. Hey, maybe we should talk about the file names for that. I don't have a slideshow for the, file names. Um, no, right. but you've got a thing that shows, it tells yeah, us. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Who, who's got what file names? Not rat. not rat. Let's go Not Rat. Not Rat versus Rat. So rat is behind not rat by how much? Fifty dollars. Fifty dollars. The the issue is, Jiggy wants rat. Jiggy wants rat. Well, we already had but one. We rat. have rat for this game, right? Do we want more rats? The, Le mean, the Legend yes. of Zelda. We have two hundred forty dollars for not rat. Two hundred three dollars for rat. 
$30 for duck and $10.20 for stash. So. OC, you are the runner of the game. Yeah? What do you want the file name to be? Oh, I screwed that. I think it's pretty funny that it's not rat. What, not rat? All right. There you go. Easy. Done. Yeah. So or we you can just donate $241 and get a totally new file name. So he, he, here's the next issue. I play A Link Between Worlds. Is it showing up on this list? Um, but I want Susbus. But there's there's a uh, I think a rat army trying to take over the Susbus. If you're donating, I like Between Worlds Susbus. So, hey Laura. I got a whiteboard. No, not rat. It's not rat. Let's get some donations gone. It's a little early. We seem to have slowed down a little bit, and that's understandable. Not everyone can donate, not everyone's awake. But the people who are here and the people who are awake, would like to see some support if you can if you've got a little bit and you'd like to have some fun. We'll do uh we'll do uh five dollar doodles. Will you give me five dollars? I was actually gonna say but yeah, that works. Oh, you're gonna do Pictionary? Well, I, I was thinking let's draw things for money, because that, that's always pretty easy, but if you just want to draw things for money, that's, that works too. I mean, we're drawing things for money at the end of the day, so... You just don't tell us what you're drawing. Yeah. And then, should we be able to figure it out? You're probably, you you're, you're really good at drawing, so, easy. But I'm thinking like $5 doodles. If, if you guys want to do it $5 doodles, I'm down for $5 doodles. WJG999 donated $10.08. Very specific. Thank you very much. Nice, thank you. Six four many, six four six five. How many whiteboards do we have up there? One. One. We we are we are in short whiteboard supply this marathon somehow. Please, I'll start, please with, donate a, I'll start with a little doodle. I don't know what you can get out of WJG. No, mm. it's not that. I'm just doing a doodle in general. The lights are on. Lights are turning on. Is there something happening, or did somebody just have fun with the app? I'm gonna go see if I can find another whiteboard. Oh, go for it. You know, more people doodling is more fun. Yeah, because I can have this draw. Yep, we got a bag full of markers. DeVito needs his stash. Whoa. <laughs> True. There we go. He just got his stash. Five dollars from Nemenya saying, draw me a snow leopard. A snow leopard. Okay. Let me wrap up my drawing really quick. Oh, this room sucks. Oh, I hate this room. I believe. DeVito believes. Turn. Danny DeVito believes in you. Do you believe in Danny DeVito? Believe in the power of DeVito. Do you believe in our Lord and Savior? Is, is the Danny DeVito cult coming back? I don't, I don't, I don't want to be in the DeVito cult again. If I'm summoned, this man is getting shot. Get him. There we go. This is what it's all about right here. I've made Zelda but a rat. Now Zelda, I've... look at my rat. Show the chat your Zelda rat. My Zat. Press rat to see the rat. Yep, we need some rats. This is an artistic skill you're starting off with. The Zelda rat. It's a dry erase marker. Here comes Zat. Hey, fast. listen, you guys know how roads work? So, no. I was just out there when we were talking. We, uh, so. <laughs> so boulevard, in order for it to be a boulevard, you know fr boulevard, French word, boulevard? Sure. You heard of them? I, I, I've heard of a boulevard. Yeah. yeah. In order for it to be a boulevard, 
You gotta have, uh, you gotta have streets here. No, you gotta have trees, like, like that. You gotta have trees on both sides. You just have the, tr the tree on one side, that's only like a, you know, like a street or a okay. road or a drive or an avenue or whatever. But if you have, if you have two, if you're flanked by trees, that's really like cool and high. So high what you're saying is if the lumberjack didn't chop down that tree, we'd have a boulevard back there. Correct, we'd have a boulevard, but instead we've been downgraded, we've been demoted. And if, if, you're, if you're in certain spots and your tree dies, like on one of the sides, you have to replace it like right away. Huh. Otherwise you lose your boulevard status. You literally lose boulevard status. You get downgraded just like an avenue, so. Like. What, what do you need to be a parkway? Okay, so what was that donation? What is a parkway? Uh, Five dollars from Dominia saying snow leopard. A snow leopard. What is a parkway? Uh, it's a way where you park. That's not true. No, it is not at all. All right. I'm just lazy. Okay. You park in the driveway and drive in the parkway. What about the boulevard? We already established boulevards have trees. All right, I'm out of I'm out of content. I learned in the hallway, so you can go back to whatever you were doing before. What we were doing is watching you run across the room to tell us about streets. Okay, but before that. Uh. Let's see. What was the thing? Somebody asked to draw us for me to draw a snow leopard. That's it's Mickey it. Mouse. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I'm out of here. Oh heck, my tech shift was supposed to start. Whoever's on tech, please please come here and pull me off couch. Because no one else is on couch right now. Listen, hey, 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 if you want content, I got some content right here. Alright. Alright, here. Get in there, get in there. Get in there. This is donation station. Oh, hello. Alright, listen up, everybody. She's British. And that, yeah. means, that means she's going to say Boulevard and it's going to be really fun. Here, go. Three, two, one. Boulevard. See? Ooh. Crazy. I feel smarter already. <laughs> I'm gonna go run tech. So have fun. Go around the tree. So they trusted me with producing this hour. Yeah. I'm drawing cats. That's production. You are producing drawings of cats. Look at that. That's a that's a cat, and now it has some spots. It's, it's a snow leopard, I guess. Sure to push tweets on stream and make the light show. You have power in your hands. You have a bunch of us. Oh my god. Yeah, spend time exploring your interface. Oh my god, that's really nice. You'll be fine. <laughs> it's 4 a.m. No one will know if I ruin it. <laughs> it's uh, just, you yeah, know, it's just been, it was broken. Hey, it was broken when I got here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the ears are too big. I'm gonna de Mickey Mouseify this. <laughs> Zach was right! <laughs> Someone turned my cat into Swiss cheese. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Look, they're aerodynamic holes. It helps it chase down predators quicker. There <laughs> you go. Snow leopard. Yo! Yo, Danny's got a mustache. I'm so sick of this. Is floor. there a bag of marker things back there? There is. Behold. Yo. Extra colors. Whoa. Colors. Yo, five dollars. You can have colors. <laughs> yeah, you know, we go right past line art. And you get right to the. You get right to the colors. Like I'm just gonna. I'll, I'll do it like it's a uh, samurai jacket. No lines. Just colors. Please ask me to draw something with no color whatsoever, then. <laughs> You're like, there it is! I got your snowflake! I've got this, 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 uh, I'm trying to think of other things that are white. Look, I made a self-portrait. <laughs> I'd always ask what to draw when I was little, and uh, my grandparents would say, draw, draw a plane that's gone into the distance. And so I'd be like, cool, thanks. <laughs> I'm done then, I guess. <laughs> This, the, the good old technique of drawing a seagull by just making an M that's like really low. There you go, seagull. Wow. Oh, the gamer move. Pro strat. Speed running art. This is the, uh, you ever see the Twitter account of uh, low poly birds? No. There's a Twitter account that's just low poly birds from video games. I need and, to find or, I think it's other low poly animals as well. 
Low poly animals. Oh, okay. Low poly I've animals is good. I've never needed anything more in my life. Oh yeah, the cover of the White Album. Well, there you go. Um, yeah, so five dollars. You know, we're having a little fun here. Keep it, you know, nice and easy. Have some fun, you know. Because right now I know a lot of you guys are kind of in low effort times, low power, you know, just kind of chilling, vibing with Zelda-thon, whether your sleep schedule was destroyed or you destroyed it for us, which means a lot. Or, you know, you're in a part of the world that isn't America's, and, you know, you're vibing with us in times that are actually pretty normal for you. Ooh, Laura. Laura Morgan, $5 saying, Abby, please draw an Abra doing their favorite activity. Taking a nap. Excellent. I don't have yellow. Mood. I don't have yellow. Uh, so let's get creative. Let's get deviant art with this. <laughs> oh <my God>. Immediately <laughs> picked up on the, bum, bum, bum. the horrid vibes. Um, yeah. All right. So <laughs> what what color shall I make my Abra? My OC Abra. What color is the shiny Abra? <laughs> Oh, like the same yellow, but a little whiter. <laughs> God, it's one of those shinies <laughs> where you're like, is that shiny? Man. It's not leafy on levels of bad where it's like essentially the same damn Pokemon. <laughs> it's pretty up there. Oh, they've got brown. I can do the, oh no, wait, that's. Yeah, uh, we're gonna have to get DeviantArty with this. Yes, the DeVito pillow does have a mustache. All right, so Aura Morgan asked for an Abra asleep. Uh, we're gonna get creative with our colors. <laughs> Yo, there's a Dorito. It looks like we only have one white board for now. We, remember we, we years used to ago, have like ten ish, and now there's only one. Years ago, back okay, in the day, I'm gonna draw in the little corner the, here. The supply okay. chain of whiteboards has been interrupted. But this Zelda phone, we're very sorry. We got some pointy ears. Oh, you're going making an abra too? Yeah, and I can draw, so this is gonna be fun. It's fine. I mean, I, I, I couldn't draw, and then I did a daily like art thing where I was like, you know what, every day I'm gonna draw something. And now I, I can kinda draw, I guess. Look at that, it's an Abra. Does, does the Abra have no tail to draw, right? Yeah, it's got a tail. There we go. Commitment, one could say. Commitment. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Hello. Don't worry about it. Hello. Don't worry your pretty little go. bonnet about it. We've got two Abras. We've got OC's Abra in the corner. I don't know if you want to take it up there and show the people. No. <laughs> okay. It's not camera worthy. And uh, another quick uh, Abra asleep right here, just giving the classic, you know, two arms to the side sort of. Pose. Cool. All right, five dollars. Get you a doodle. We'll, we, we will. We will split the whiteboard. Like two roommates in a sitcom who are fed up with each other, but signed a three-year lease. They draw. <laughs> they draw a white line down the middle. Abra, I've told you a hundred times the thermo the thermostat stays at seventy-six. How do you survive in that heat? No, I need it at life. seven. How will they get along? Oh. Look, you can't fill four seasons of content if they get along. Ugh. Ten dollars and eight cents from Fire Yoshi. May you draw an orange Yoshi with a flaming shell? Colon uh, I will do the best, but we don't have orange. We've got red. Is that okay? I hope so. Because <laughs> I can't really give you is, much more than that. Is Pepsi okay on your whiteboard this morning? <laughs> <laughs> it's a blood orange. A blood orange. Uh, <laughs> 
I've never drawn a Yoshi, so... Me neither. Uh, Alright, so... I'm just gonna do the MCG Watt emote. I've made the Loch Ness Monster. Mine is just gonna look like an alligator now. He has a round body, a little tail. And little armies. Oh. <laughs> oh, you are so cute. Oh. And he has like little, little Oh, that's right, little lumpies. I think they have spots? I don't know. Do Yoshi spots? No, he has like a... His egg has spots. Oh, the egg spots. tummy thingy. Right, he does have a tummy thingy. What is the charity for? We are raising money for direct relief. Tell them about direct relief. Tell them about direct relief. We relieve directly. <laughs> direct relief is a humanitarian aid organization that helps in all 50 states and over 100 countries. Uh, they've been responding to uh, the uh, um, situation in the Ukraine, um, as well as, uh, oh gosh. Oh, you're on camera, Betsy. Oh, good, <laughs> what, what? That's okay. Um, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, and as well as uh, they provide uh, medical supplies, um, for There's disaster relief all over the globe. That I gave it. Um, very cool organization, and very happy to be raising money for them. Huge, huge humanitarian aid. Huge, huge like humanitarian aid. Boop. I donated a minute ago, and I was like, "Wow, it's taking a while to come through." And it's been, it's been caught in the filter because I said, "Please draw Shelda," and it has been filtered for the word L. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah that Bloody L. Adjustment Bloody has made this L. Bloody Yoshi by giving it big nose. All right, ready what, to. What are we, we drawing? Shelder. Shelder, my with, favorite Pokemon. With, which he's is purple and he's green. <laughs> yeah, oh, purple okay. and green. I have no idea what, what that if Pokemon you is. Yes, yeah, purple. Draw I will from give memory. You... All right. No, I have no idea. So I'm just gonna draw. Uh, uh, also, you you'll need Gosh, the tongue. Just remember, it's got the tongue. Okay, it's a Pokemon with tongue. Got it. <laughs> it's a Pokemon with a tongue. You know. It's a shell. Thank you. With Nine a tongue. It's an angry dollars. shell with a tongue. Okay. Yeah, it might, a, it's a clam, a but it's screaming at you. You can't say what it is. <laughs> <laughs> My sincerest apologies. <laughs> Okay, and that's hot. Interesting interpretation. Here's there he is. There's my fave. I'm so sick of these men. I hate them. <laughs> Same, huh? What a mood! <laughs> I'm sick of them. They're the worst. Yeah, you better sink, you little. Please, finish. No, I can't. <laughs> oh, I wasn't that far off. You're drawing a Quinn up from get. Final Fantasy IX. Yeah. Somebody's still this chasing. This is why Shell was my fave. Look at that. How can, you, how can you not love something so adorable yet disturbing? We've got depth. It is Wednesday, my hands. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Look at that. So we've got uh, OC's shelter, which is. Uh, on, uh, uh, screaming on the left, and then mine, which I, I we have to rotate, I guess. Yes, rotate. rotate. Yep. Over there. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, how handsome. My boy. Mia Moore with forty-four dollars and forty-four cents. Good morning, Zelathon. Good morning, Mia. Good morning. Good morrow. Welcome to Zelathon's the big breakfast. Oh, yep. We can do our own BBC breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, can we do a radio show? And this morning on BBC Top Shop, <laughs> Zelda Thumb Breakfast. <laughs> oh, Zelda Thumb Breakfast. Hotel Brecky. There you go. <laughs> Hotel Brecky is not free at Jupiter. And tonight, the proms. <gasps> yeah. They are soon. 
What's there a doodle with the me and Morris? Was there a doodle donation? with that donation? Or was no, it just it a was, general it was, greeting? It was just good morning. The wild, wild card. Good morning. Well, it's always fun just to have a friend around and say hi. It's almost dinner time. BBC dinner time? <laughs> BBC dinner time when? <laughs> I mean, five hours from now, we put it at nine, <laughs> so in like ten hours? At noon? Yeah. Noon. Uh, Any more donations? Ira, I, Ira speak, well, speaking of Britain, one of the few reasons I still have a Facebook.com account is, I, fo I forgot why, but when, but I decided to follow the Facebook page of the Isle of Man, <laughs> Isle of Man Constabulary. The, 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 the police force of the Isle of Man, and it's so funny to see the things they post. It's like, drivers beware, like a flock of sheep has migrated onto this road, avoid this road in Douglas, until the, you know, like somebody lost their car, please, if you've seen this person's car. It's so like, just provincial Aww. and small town, small do, island. Do you guys know what the symbol for the Isle of Man is? Is it just a dude? No. Let, can I draw it? No. Quickly? Oh yeah, please. Let's, let's have us draw it. Yes, oh. you describe it to us. Okay, right. Okay, how can I describe this? Also, I'm only going to use these three colors. I want you to imagine if somebody amputated three legs <laughs> and then stitched them together yeah. and tried rolling them down a hill. <laughs> That's the symbol of the Isle of Man. Go. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like a Is that a binding of Isaac enemy? <laughs> Binding of eyes with an enemy, mommy's foot. <laughs> <laughs> but it's the, the symbol of the Isle of Man. It's, it's three legs in distress. <laughs> <laughs> one toenail painted. Yeah. <laughs> I think there's I one. I don't have red, so this is gonna be purple Ooh. blood. It's gangrene. And this. And Yo! Oh yeah. my lord. Even Whoa! No, I hate this little twink. I hate him. <laughs> I pick the bottom. Man, is that what Ganon says every night? He's looking out and sees Link running around. He's oh, the mustard. worst. Anonymous donation, ninety dollars and one cent. Oh no, from Spirit Zelda. I I I know how to read this. Thank you, Spirit Zelda. That's that's rad. That's very cool. Ninety dollars is so many Starbucks. So, so we had similar but different interpretations of three legs stitched together. <laughs> well, can I say so, uh, uh, oh, Abra kind of nailed it? Yeah. Together. Oh, let me there see. Okay, so OC's interpretation is oh. a sad man whose legs are have been removed and put into a caterpillar formation uh, down a hill. Uh, mine. Mine, mine is the hill, and the three legs have been stitched together at the hip. Why? On camera, there we go. Ah. <laughs> Abra, there... that actually is it. Wait, what? Really? Here. Pull that Here. up. Here. What? You... <laughs> Abra, Abra nailed it. You oh my god. Me? It's it's pretty good. My explanation was on point. It was. <laughs> sure was. Uh, full credit for that. I'm sure someone from the Isle of Man can explain the yeah. symbology. Yeah, so points to Gryffindor, I guess. Yeah. Yeah! Good work. Donate now for your obscure... Oh, donate obscure flags and I'll, I'll <laughs> describe them to I'll us. And we will have... We will, vexology nerds, now is your time. Oh, oh please, someone give, someone you, give us Mozambique. Uh, give us South Africa. Give us Nepal. Well, the complicated ones. If you yes. doodle at home, make sure to tweet um, at Salathon so we can retweet them. Yes. Oh, I so hope that somebody else heard my description of the island. <laughs> Arc, Arc Hour. So... I'm, Arc I'm, is about amputated legs. <laughs> Art is about amputated legs. Art is all about the leg, it's let's not, be real. It's not about how many amputated legs, it's how you use them. <laughs> that is true. He put some Frankenstein creation together, some <laughs> horrible mad science. Stank and fry. <laughs> Stank and fry. Thank you. Stank and fry. That sounds oh. German. <laughs> oh my lord. I can't stop spoonerizing. Help me. Ugh. It's a condition at this point. <laughs> oh, can we get some, some game ones? lore? Oh yeah, Saudi Arabia. Let's let's, I wanna, <laughs> let's, have, let's have these fellas write Arabic. 
What do I Let's do see for that. Time Lord? Like I, I feel like that might. Mm. That'll be good. Oh, um, oh, that's so but wrong. Vague. Answers only. Wrong answers only. Yeah. Oh God. Who's this guy? This guy is, um, the ghost of Christmas past. The ghost of Christmas past. <laughs> He shows up and he's very. If this wire doesn't get off my shoe, I might actually throw myself out a window. <laughs> um, he's the ghost of Christmas past, and he's like, "Hello, my name is Aquanine. My name, my name is Aquanine, and I need you. Yo, we got Aquafina. I need you to oh remove gosh. the heavy metals from my blood. <laughs> <laughs> Aquanine sounds like some kind of like moisturizing skin foundation, some kind of cream. This is the new Aquanine. It cost me at least fifty dollars. Aquanine also, by by Kylie Jenner. Aquanine you, by no. Now right. available at your nearest Target. Side effects may include loss of all skin. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, a strong enough magnet could pull the iron out of your blood, so maybe yeah. that's what he needs. Yo! Let's figure it out. So, what's on the donation queue? Currently nothing, but for five dollars, <laughs> give me any symbol within reason, and I will badly describe it, and our lovely couch members will doodle it for you. What's a, what's a really complicated one? Oh, the state flag of Virginia is, uh, is pretty fun. Oh, it's rad! It's pretty cool. It's very rad. Yeah, there you go. That's a fun one. I like. The, oh, it's a flag that's not just a crest in the middle. Yeah. Oh, oh thank that's, goodness. That's what Pennsylvania is. Yeah. I think the flag of the state flag of like Oregon has a beaver on the, on it or something. Oh, it's got just a little, little beaver. Do, a little dorky beaver. Hello. That's cute. Yeah. Welcome to Oregon. Yeah. Don't move here. <laughs> Do you like Starbucks? Mm. Oh. It's a donation. Do you Yo, like look Starbucks? At that Ooh. Dino. 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 Oh, here we Dino's go. Animation. Dino, please describe and draw the flag of Eswatini. Okay, right. Oh, here boy. we go. The flag of what? Uh, Eswatini is a country in Africa. I'm pretty sure. Eswatini. Oh heck, this is going to be fun. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Did he provide um, the link? I have googled it. Okay. So. Um, okay. Uh, think of a regular flag. Uh, and somebody has painted the top and bottom of it with big stripes. Okay. So big main stripes. Then a thin stripe. Have you seen Zulu? <laughs> Starring Michael Caine? There we go. Yeah. No! We're going, no. In, we're going in, a, in a battle. Leave me alone! Now, in that space in the middle, I want you to imagine a lozenge. <laughs> <laughs> in the middle between like the thin stripe and the thick stripe? In the, or... last, in the last bastion of, of, of places to draw, in the middle, the very middle. Okay. As Oops. if somebody, somebody's dropped a lozenge on this, on this flag. Wrapped or unwrapped? Um, unwrapped lozenge. Okay. Cool. Maybe, maybe I need more stripes. The lozenge has been dipped in oil on one side. <laughs> it's chocolate on one side and vanilla, <laughs> vanilla on the other. Yeah. <laughs> it's a zebra cookie. Um, and then there's flecks of oil on the side that has not been dipped in oil. <laughs> What oil that has not been dipped in oil? <laughs> half of it's been dipped in oil. The other half, it just kind of yeah, was near the splashes, oil dispersion device. Splashes a bit. Um, <laughs> and in the same pattern on the oil side, it started dripping away, and you can see the lozenge in the Behind the lozenge <laughs> are two spears pointing east. <laughs> And then a third spear that has the murdered corpses of little Karibos from Yu Gi Oh on it. <laughs> Where is that one located? Okay, it's also behind the lozenge. Oops. This is a cool place. <laughs> and yeah, it's. It, 
It's like a it's like a balanced a balanced pole with two dead Karibos on each end. <laughs> I don't know what the Karibo is, so I'm just gonna. And then somebody it's a tribble. somebody has also dropped another dead Karibo slash tribble on the lozenge. <laughs> I'd like to take a moment to apologize to all our viewers in Espertini. <laughs> We're doing our best here. <laughs> okay, and let me know let me know when you're done. Okay. I think I'm done. I'm a fan of this there's, development. There's, there's no saving this. Oh wow, you got some details in. This is This good. is very good. Okay. Okay, so should we show the crowd or should we know what it actually looks like okay, first? Okay, let me hand it to you and show you what it really looks This is the flag of Eswatini. <laughs> oh, the, I see. You can see what I mean about the little dead Karibos? Yeah, the they little pelts, like yeah. Yeah, and I'm super, I, they probably should be leaves, but to me, dead Karibos. And then the big <laughs> lozenge in the middle. Yeah. And now show the audience what you have created. So... OC, do you want to go through your design process and then I'll go through mine? Uh, yeah, so the stripes, uh, some lovely neon green and purple, and the big lozenge wasn't quite centered, so it's on the right here. And then there's spears upwards here behind. Uh, yeah, and the, and the oil trail is the big purple here. Okay. And, uh, so, so for mine, on the theme. We've, we've got the stripes, uh, you can very well see them in red. We've got the lozenges in the middle in green, which is, uh, you know, kind of covered up by the half side of the black and white cookie that is it, uh, covered up in blue. Uh, two spears going across. I didn't know that the third spear also went across, so it's horizontal, and like a, like a... I guess a, a you know a stereotypical 1930s dumbbell just has the Karibos on the end. Um, also, I didn't know it was their pelt, so I put the whole Karibo. And then there was one just <laughs> sitting on uh, sitting on the lozenge as well. The lozenge. Lozenge. <laughs> lozenge. Uh, okay, we have we have a couple of donations. Gaia with five dollars. Describe the flag of Jean. Jelesnogorsk. Oh boy. And Captain Trima, great minds think alike. Also five dollars, the Russian city of Jelesnogorsk. Oh, this is good. This has got to be good. Uh, it's going to be. Awesome. Whoa! Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> okay. Okay. Here that's. it comes. Um. The first shape you need to start with is, is a speech bubble. <laughs> okay. That's coming from the very center middle point of the bottom of the screen. Bottom of. Bottom of the drawing. I mean. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes. Good. And um, yes, leave yourself lots of space in the uh, in the beat bubble. Okay. Now I need you to draw an angry bear who is tearing a sphere asunder with his <laughs> with his upper paws. And he's mad. He's mad at it. He hates this sphere. This sphere has wronged his family. <laughs> this will be good. The bear has also trapped. The bear is trapped in three hula hoops. <laughs> he cannot escape. He's trying, but he cannot escape. <laughs> this, is, this is solid. You're going to see some good stuff here. Yeah. He's got big claws as well. Big claws. He and yeah, he hates this spear. He wants this spear to die. It's genuinely one of the coolest flag designs I've ever seen. That's, that's quite fun. <laughs> okay. And I think that's it. What is it? That's it. It's uh 
And here you go. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> He's going at it. He's going at it. I mean, I'm guessing it's something to do with splitting the atom mm -hmm. very clearly. Uh, but yeah, now let's <laughs> let's see what you guys came up with. Oh boy. So Oh, see, you want to go through yours first? Yeah, here's the bear. Uh, very big claws here. <laughs> uh, the, the sphere is sadly on the ground here, ripped in half. And then three neon globes. Alright, so mine goes this way. We've got... We've got our bear here, very angrily eating the sphere on the ground. <laughs> Like, he dropped them, his M&Ms, but was not done with them. <laughs> Around his hips, he's got three hula hoops that have trapped him because he ate too many M&Ms while hula hooping. <laughs> and now that's just his fate. Uh, you can see his little toes out the back. And big claw on top of the sphere. Yeah. With a Don't eat too many M&Ms, kids. You get trapped in three hula hoops. There you yeah. go. The fates will send hula hoops after you. That's, that's a nice oh, little fable. Oh, this game is rancid. Yeah, please, please more five dollar donations for me to describe. <laughs> Do you live somewhere obscure? Do you have a, a weird, a weird county or state flag? Bring it to me. <laughs> that is my demand. Oh. Local, provincial flags, cities. Ah, they were established for plutonium production, hence the bear. Well, you got to make it somewhere. <laughs> I will think it comes from Pluto. <laughs> it's in the name, innit? Well, imagine, imagine, the, well, imagine the dummies who named Pluto. Imagine how they felt when Pluto was uh, relegated as a, you know, oh. a minor, you know, a minor Hyperbelt pl object. Yeah, geez, <laughs> not, you know, there's no take backsies. You never take backsies. Can't rename it. There's no. just a rock out there now called Pluto. Oh. Yeah. At least it's one of the rocks that still has a cool name. Oh yeah, no, we there are other there are other rocks out there with cool names. Yeah, but most of them are like XL76, and I'm like, well, that's just uh... yeah. It's not we as a species, we're not we do not have only a small number of of m creatures of mythos oh. that we could use to name planets, and yet. We've decided to just go with a naming convention of of madness, of somebody falling asleep on a keyboard. Ugh. It's Pluto, <laughs> can't you see? Are there are there elements named after like the moons of where we are right now? Yeah, there. I mean, our moon is titanium. Our moon technically has a Titan. name that's not moon. Luna. Yep. Luna. Just like our sun has a name that isn't sun. Which is soul. So, are there, are there, there are no elements named after our sun and moon. No. Solarium, so you, lunarium. Yeah, I was literally about to say solarium. Lunarium. <laughs> Io, Europa, and Cal Callisto was one of Artemis's, uh, one of Artemis's like nymphs or one of her great hunters. Um, I know this because I'm currently neck deep in back in Greek mythology because there I'm you playing go. Hades. <laughs> <laughs> There's a uh, well. There is there is Europium, Europum. There is a, but it's probably it, you name it for Europe. Dino. Heck yeah. Oh boy. Okay, Dino with five dollars. Koroshevo Nevniki. That flag. Oh okay, I'm gonna, my let's god. Find out. We're going what did you say to me? <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna mispronounce some Russian and somebody will be like, how dare you, you have wronged it me. It sounded like you were asking directions for the bus station. No. Yeah. Here we go. Welcome, friends. Europe, 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 Europe. That's Californium. California was cool enough to get an element. Okay. <laughs> okay. This, I don't, I don't trust this, so I'm going to Wikipedia. Here mm -hmm. it comes. It's gonna be like a city that was made tw like ten years ago, and like it's an anime girl or something. Okay. <laughs> it's like millennials okay. that founded the, the city. The millennial city. This is my waifu. She is the city. There In the background, there is a river going from bottom left to top right. 
There's a wall. Is there mountains or anything does it go to, or is it just across just the whole a, flag? just a river across the whole flag, bottom I, left to top right. Iris, are you starting a D&D campaign? <laughs> you, find yourself, you find yourself at a river, flowing <laughs> east to west. Flowing east to west. There's a town in the distance. There are three sphinxes. One of them says, I only tell the truth. The other says, I only tell lies. The third one says, oh god, I'm a sphinx, why? You go to the merchant. You go to the barkeep and talk. <laughs> Brusher, we have it. Okay. In front of the river, we have a creature with the shape of a bear mm -hmm. and the teeth and tail of a beaver. I didn't. I didn't believe this was the real picture, which is why I went to Wikipedia. I would have thought that this came from a drawing that they did, <laughs> <laughs> and you made it official. Uh, the, oh, the bear beaver homunculus <coughs> has one foot up on a stack of bricks and is holding a very tall tree out in front of him as if brandishing a sword. So a bear, bear like body. But beaver tail. Bear, it's a horrible bear beaver hybrid. And let me give you some more details about the face. Um, the face only has one eye. Oh, okay. It's like it's been drawn in MS Paint. It has very little. Uh, uh, so we're ahead of the curve. Yeah. Uh, instead of proper ears, uh, this creature has two little nubbins. <laughs> You're killing me. I've already drawn the ears. I'm so fast. sorry. Retcon, retcon. Um, and then, yeah, uh, one foot up on a pile of bricks, and and his back arm is on his hip as if he's so proud of himself. This bear beaver chimera is so pleased to have both bricks and a tree. <laughs> So it's one foot is on a pile of bricks. The other one is behind it, like it's brandishing a sword of wood. It's, I don't know how much information to give you. Jackson, help me out here. <laughs> I'm trying to put words to the, Jesus. You see what I mean about beaver bear homunculus? How do I, how do you describe this? Is there a famous US statue where somebody's doing this? Doing this pose? Yeah. Oh, hmm. it's up. Is it upright? Yes. Okay. Uh, so it's standing upright. Uh, it's standing bipedal, and one one foot is in front of it on the pile of bricks. Yes. Yes. I'm trying. I'm trying to think of like a the name for this. The it's kind of like the flag of Virginia, the six. I per perhaps yes, except you're not standing on a person. Or something. Yeah, you're standing on a pile of bricks, and instead of holding a spear, you're holding an entire tree. Yeah, I will. I will show the original for this one. I oh, won't. oh, Irish. No, might, might be. It might be like you know the picture of the astronaut on the moon with the flag. <gasps> yes, yes. Instead of a flag, it's a, it's a tree. It's a tree, and instead of the moon, it's a pile of bricks. This is this is good. OC is done. This is this is valuable. I'm, I'm going above and beyond. Okay, oh me, my god, I'm so I'm sick gonna, of this. I'm gonna show. Here we go. Yeah, this I'm is. I'm gonna show chat what this looks like. <laughs> I don't want to do this. I really don't want to. It is so dorky looking. Your friendly neighborhood bear. Bearver. So, uh, you want to go first? Tell the class? Uh, first of all, <laughs> I will show you what it was well, supposed I to was, look like. I saw it on the Oh, yeah, there you go. The yeah, here's a, here's a better closer look. Oh my god, he's a chat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes. Yeah, you... yeah, so here's my drawing. <laughs> we might want to get a little closer so they can see the details of this. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Uh, 
I'll, I'll, I'll join you over by the camera. Oof. Oh, it's show and tell time, yay! <laughs> yes, so here's my beaver. <laughs> Don't laugh. Don't laugh. He has a tree. He's standing on a pile of bricks. Just as described. <laughs> Throwing you under the bus. Uh, so, yeah. Um, yeah. Here is, uh, here is my beaver. Uh, he's standing on a pile of bricks in front of a river with a tree. Just as described. Oh, come on now. <laughs> to be fair, I, we're both kind of there, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Oh no, your butt left an imprint on Danny. <laughs> <laughs> your keister. Okay, while while all those shenanigans were going down, we had a one hundred and four dollar and eight cent donation. Wow. Yo! Anonymous. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. Thank you, friend. And Relius with five dollars twenty seven saying, "Let's go, Dan. You're doing great." Oh, thanks. Yeah. Let's go. This is this from Relius? Yes. Yo, let's, let's go, Dan. Go. Let's go, Don. Let's go. Go. Let's go. Clear. I'm, 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 I'm also going to extend it. Um, so $5, describe, give me your favorite album cover, and I will describe it <laughs> to, to our wonderful artists. Oh, we have a limited cover. color palette. Please do not give Pink, Pink Floyd as a... <laughs> <laughs> the Sgt. Pepper album. Oh my god. <laughs> You're killing me! I need you to start by drawing 500 people. <laughs> oh my goodness. You get that half, I get this half. We'll, we'll meet in the middle. Here's a good one. Someone someone donate for Steely Dan Aja. That's a good album cover. It'll give our artists some good ammunition. Indeed. Yeah, five dollars. Donate.zeldathon.com and you too can have your state flag or favorite album cover turned into a new version of it. An, an improved version. <laughs> oh, here we go. The hit begins. Five dollars from Nemenya. Please have them draw the flag of Nepal. Okay. Okay. All right. I think I think I know about this. That's the one that's. Uh, is that? I'm thinking it might be. Mm -hmm. I think. I think. It's fun. Yeah. Okay. To start by drawing the flag of Nepal, I want you to forget everything you knew about flags. <laughs> I think I know which flag it is. Um, and now I want you to imagine two conjoined Doritos. <laughs> okay, I know, I know the flag, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna do wrong answers only. I don't have orange for Doritos, but are they Cool Ranch? Uh... Or are they nacho cheese? They're the British version, which is cool original. Oh, <laughs> Literally. There's, there are no, there's no ranches in, in Britain. <laughs> they haven't gotten to that, gotten there okay. yet. Okay. Uh, in your top Dorito, I would like you to draw a sunshine nestled in a hammock. Yo, this is a great looking bird I have so far. <laughs> or maybe a fish with a really big eye. And on the bottom Dorito, another, another sunshine. Even spikier than the first. <laughs> <laughs> Two conjoined Doritos, oh dear. Uh, and that's it, there you go. Um, Here it is. Here's the flag of Nepal. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's let's show the class. <laughs> okay, so here's the bottom. Here's Abra's. Yeah. And here's mine. Two Doritos. It's a rhombus. Dang, that's a shape. Rhombus. Yeah. I mean, I knew, I knew the flag, so it wasn't it wasn't 
Uh, <laughs> 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 I thought you would. Yeah, know. I, I remember this shape because I always see like when I see like the list of all the flags and then Nepal's there like oh I'm the I'm original I don't like flags that are square man. <laughs> I'm, the, I'm the spiky one. <laughs> oh yeah, but I didn't I'm know not, anything like, other past that. <laughs> But here, okay. quadrilateral. Dino with five dollars. Okay, I think I've topped weird flags. Iofa County, Liberia. Oh Let's, boy. We're go. We're going in, lads. My my Google search history. We're gonna get home, and it's gonna be like how Are many flags? Are you a vexology like nerd now? <laughs> Dude, do you want to know flag code for like Southeast Alabama? The hammer is the best item in this whole game. You just take out all your anger in like the last 15 minutes of this game. You just go, slam! Soup! This is terrible. Who, Whoever designed this. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, good luck. Uh, in this flag, there is another flag. Okay, so... Top, okay, so you have your regular flag shape. Mm -hmm. You can remember what flags are now. You're finished with Nepal. Thank you. And in top left, you have something close to the flag of Texas in that it has your stars and stripes, but instead of stars, one star. I just draw Israel's flag. <laughs> Close enough. Um, then, in the main portion of this of this flag, there is a. Wait, river. Are, we, are we talking about the big flag or the, the, or the Texas the, flag? The main flag, not the little top okay. left flag. The, the nest, big, the big main the flag. The nested flag. Um, there is a river running from top left to bottom right. Gotta look at what Marcus Aurelius, Marcus Aurelius was Al, played by Albus Dumbledore in the uh, in the hit uh, Russell Crowe documentary uh, Gladiator. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, yeah. Joe Joaquin Phoenix was the other fellow. Um, okay, uh, in the middle of a flag, there is an arm that has been severed at the elbow. <laughs> Which way is it pointing? Um, the amputated part is bottom left, and the hand itself is pointing up to the right. And in its terrible, badly drawn fingers is a, is a log, <laughs> a torch, an unlit torch. It's it's just a it's just a it's a it's a it's a tube. It's a, it's, it's like when a poster comes in if you buy yeah, it in the mail. Yeah, it's a, it's a it's a cardboard tube. Um, it's copper. What is it? <laughs> it's a ground rod. You put an electrical system. You bury it in the ground. All Solid. of my various flags were made by first graders. <laughs> Changed my mind. Well, you know. a can of Pringles. Yeah, it adds They're character. Holding, holding a can of Pringles. <laughs> mm hmm. A torture flash. Um, don't, don't make fun of, of Iris' as English. Iris is speaking English. Come on, don't be like that. Actual torch. Come on <laughs> actual now. Torch. <laughs> Come on now. No, I, I meant I meant torch torch, as in like the, the wooden stick that you like. Mm -hmm. Um well, here's what it's supposed to look like. Oh, that's a Starbucks cup. Oh, somebody, come did, on. somebody <laughs> just got a mochaito. It's a venti. Uh, and now let's show with the class. Oof. Here it is. <laughs> so you've, you've got the flag in the top left yeah. corner. Flag with a star and stripe, a river across, and an amputated arm with a torch. Obviously. So good. Mm -hmm. So good. And then uh, I, I've got some. Uh, I've got the star and bars. <laughs> Don't know. <laughs> There's the river. And uh, here's the arm holding out a, a tube that kind of looks like a massive Pringles can, we'll call it. Good. Uh -huh. Cool original Pringles. <laughs> cool, you know, believe me, those are the, the Pringles you eat at 3 a.m. when you we, can't we, figure out what life is. We, um, start, we, we started with severed legs, and now we've upgraded to severed arm. Okay. 
Five dollars from Soup. Not my favorite album. I just want to see them draw it. Queen the Miracle. Okay. Um, uh, they, they are asking for a roll call as well. Oh, Who's yes. Who's playing the video game? Hi, I'm playing the video game. My name's Starmie, but you can call me Dan. Hi, Dan. For my friend to I'm call me Dan. I cannot draw, so that's why I'm drawing. I'm Abra. I cannot draw, so that's why I draw. I'm Jackson. I'm Iris. I am reading your donations and badly describing your favorite flags and or album covers to our, our lovely resident couch artists. And we are awake at this hour. We are awake. Okay. So, this album cover, Queen the Miracle. Are you familiar with the concept of animorphs? <laughs> yeah, a little bit, yeah. I, I think want... that that's what we've been drawing, like bear beavers. And... I would like you to imagine that on the far right, there is an animorph. There is the, your final evolution of your animorph, and the man has very huge 80s curly hair. Is that, so the man is on the right or the man on the left is the man? Uh, the far right mm -hmm. is your final evolution and it's a man with very 80s hair. Okay. And then from him working back through the Animorphs, you need to get him to a man who has very 2000s era hair <clears throat> and looks older. So I want you I want you to age up a man animal style. <laughs> and we're bringing to Brian May. Brian May is the final evolution. <laughs> Brian Brian May's hair, you know the you know the wigs that the, the old British hoity the judges, like the judges' wigs? Yeah. That's Brian May's actual hair. Yeah. It's actually that beautiful curly ringlets and whatever. Hello, welcome. Um Oh, how close are we to it's where? Currently 452. Like, when is our game supposed Five. to end? Oh, uh, it's 450. It's supposed to end right now. Yeah. yeah. Um, how long do you have left? Like another 40 minutes. Ooh, do you want? Do you have a file save that's at the end of the game? Yeah. Do you want to just go for it? Yeah. Sure. All right. Let's just end this. All right, so what's the facial structure of the man on the left? <laughs> um, severe, but he's smiling. Is very pointy? Yeah, pointy but smiling. And on the far right, um, your, final, your final man with the big Brian May 80s hair. And what do you mean by 2000s hair? Because there's a lot of hair like from Dan? there. Um, like Dan? Like 2000s it... businessman hair. So aggressively normal. A, C a Caesar. <laughs> a crew cut. All my crew get the cut. <laughs> you wear socks to match. <laughs> Oh gosh, I don't remember how this boss battle works. <laughs> oh, you'll figure it out. <laughs> While you guys are animorphsing, I'm gonna look up the next one. We, we have we have two in the we have two in the hopper. Uh oh. Everybody hey. have a question on the monitor. Uh, so the transition event. Uh, I was going to interview the prizes. Uh, but the problem is, uh, I'm also producing and I need to transition us into the next game and get you up and running. So, if anybody wants to just talk about prizes on the, uh, set, I'm more than happy to have you over there. After this game's finished? Yeah, just talk about what today's prizes are. Relius, you've missed uh, magic. <laughs> Dan, Dan pushed the start button, and uh, one thing led to the other. Yeah, I know, it's crazy. We played the song of double time. There you go. All right, so uh, you want to show? Oh, up? there's there's more more men. No, oh, they no that's it. There you so go. You... There you go. There's your there's your your animals. Okay, I think I'm done. Okay. Do you, do you want to uh, show yeah, off? Yeah, because you, we've we've got so many more. 
Oh no, boy. Oh no. Okay. I, I only got two it. two guys. One with Aedis hair and one with Naomi hair. I've, I've, I started, uh, uh, so our curly hair man's blue and our sharp, uh, not curly hair man is red. And the, the <laughs> green men between are the transition point. Um, I, I, I don't know. Man on the left kind of reminds me of Giovanni. <laughs> It's a progression of being a rock star. You start yeah. off as a normie with a day job, and then, uh, well... Okay, then we're speedrunning. What does it look like? Oh, oh gosh, I forgot to show you. Um, it literally just is the members of Queen as an animal. <laughs> I see. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, we're speedrunning the next one. Uh, Nemenia, five dollars. I've done one of my favorite flags, Nepal. Now I have to do one of the worst. Milwaukee. Good luck, Iris, Abra, and OC. You're killing me. It's gonna be a crest with like a billion different like uh, yeah. animals in it. I want you to imagine a boardwalk with a big, uh, with a a Ferris wheel at the end and a big city below it and a big piece of corn. Go, go, go. <laughs> Oh, and down the side in huge letters it says 1846. All my homies love 1846. It was a good year. In the middle of the Ferris wheel, put four of your favorite flags. I'm not even going to bother trying to explain what these are. Just pick a four of your personal favorite flags <laughs> and put them in there. Of course. <laughs> Milwaukee, baby! It seems we have some Milwaukee fans. Iris. Are, are, you, are you familiar with the Milverine? No. The Milverine is, is a Milwaukee, was a Milwaukee legend. You know, you know, local town legends. Yeah, local cryptids. Legendary creatures. Yes, local cryptids. Milwaukee had the Milverine. I'm sure maybe our friends there can tell some stories. It just put in short, he was a dude who walked around shirtless with jeans. And he sort of looked like the, wow. you know, Hugh Jackman. The Milverine. You'll see blurry pictures of like him in a park, <laughs> sort of sleeping. <laughs> okay, so. Okay. Right now we've got OC, you've got the corn, you've got AT for AT46. That's what she said. Uh, and the, Wait, the camera, 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 camera. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we got. I'll, I'll show it to them. Yeah, I'll, I'll point at things, you tell them what it is. Yeah, so this green corn and some popcorn as well. AT, literally, AT46. AT! <laughs> That's good. Oh, oh no, my accent. Yeah. I'm so sorry. And, uh, we got the, the city, uh, 1846, and I hope it's corn. And the Ferris wheel has some weird flags in it, I guess. That's this is good. That's supposed to be a great person right there, but. <laughs> hey, Abra, do you know what corn is? It's amazing. Oh. Oh. Here you go, here's the Milwaukee flag. Oh, I had them on the back. Oh, They're it back. has a Oops. lot going on, doesn't oh, it? Oh. Yeah, they were backwards. My corn's on the wrong side. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, oh. Okay, we then have, we had two quite close to each other. Um, $5 from Anonymous. Please have them draw the album art for Dead Man's Party by Oingo Boingo. And five dollars from Magic Marshmallow, uh, Coheed and Cambria, the Afterman Ascension album cover. And because we're running out of time, we're going to do a mashup. I'm going to describe both of these oh, at the same time. Here it comes. <laughs> this will be good. Okay. Wacky and bad. Here we go. <sighs> Oh yeah, there's a lot going on here. We'll, we'll pair this down, don't you worry. Don't you, don't you worry. And then Cody, Cambria. Uh, worst case scenario, we can, we can figure. GG. Is that it? Is he dead? Okay. Yeah, he's dead. Whoa! Oh, yeah! Good, good game. Good job, Danielle. Woo! You did tit. You dint it. You dint Congratulations. It. If 
you can't figure that out, uh, maybe we go to Challenge Cam uh, and somebody brings up one of the prizes and just like, hey, these are the prizes. And do a Jerry Seinfeld voice. Hey, uh, okay. what's the uh, deal with uh, today's prizes? Yeah, for your incentive, yeah. so, okay. All right, whiteboard's being requisitioned for our important things. So thank you guys for donating. Yes, thank you. We'll uh, let you get to thank work. Thank you for hanging. Um, T.Y. If somebody wants to go to challenge cam and just grab... I'll figure it out. What is today's prizes? What are somewhere they? Somewhere? What is today? I think today has the Mask of Truth. Oh, and is there a list with this somewhere? No, it is not. Uh, wing it, Jackson. We'll wing it. Yeah. I, it, Pick a random piece of the set. That is also now. I mean, we nice. can't get... Ugh. Yo, line back got butt. Line butt. Line, line butt. butt. Line booty. Okay, I'm gonna go grab stuff that I need from my uh, segment. Yeah. Right, go, do your yeah. go, go, go get yourself ready. Uh, and you guys stick around for The Legend of Zelda, the original. Yeah, that's gonna be fun. And we're gonna be doing that on Switch? I think so. Cool. Oh, so. Alright. Do we have a Switch? There's one right down there. Unless you wanna bring yours down. Nope. Then. Okay. Yeah, give Danny DeVito wind eyeliner, please. Yes, go ahead. <laughs> Clam up our DeVito. Yeah, twenty bucks. Welcome. Hi. How you guys doing? Thank, thank the Lord for these laminated sheets. These. Not these kindly if, people have if, helped us out. If you've got a friend who's got a laminator, they've got superpowers. It, re it really is a, a next level thing. Yep. So, Abra, let's talk prizes. Prizes. Didn't you know you could win them? Prizes. Every day on this earth is a prize. And you and know, you can get yourself a little bit more of a prize by donating to Zelathon. More than a few. We have a whole bunch of these things. So let's talk about... These are the prizes for day one. It says it right there, I can't read. Our prizes for day one of the marathon, it's still day one, it's hour 13, and if you donate $20. Let's bring up. Oh, we got, we got, some, we got some demos here. We got wheels, we got wheels. $20 during a, during a game block here, during a game block here, you're eligible to these certain prizes, and one of them right here, the Mask of Truth. Created by Sababo. Thank you, Sababo. Look at that. It fits you almost perfectly. I hate, I, I can see the truth, and the truth is uh, Twitter was a horrible website. I should never have signed up. You know, Friendster really was the way to go. Honestly. We, we abandoned it too early. We did, we didn't. I mean, <laughs> MySpace is gone before its time. It was teaching people HTML and really yes. obscure bands. Yes, you know, and now everybody's using CSS every day. It's, yeah, exactly. it, it was ahead of its time. So the Mask of Truth I have here. Donate twenty dollars during each game block for a chance at these prizes. There's a whole bunch of them all throughout the marathon. And in addition to that, what's always going to be up is the grand prize of the marathon, which you can be eligible for with a donation of fifty dollars during the entirety of the marathon. Fifty dollars in total of donation. And boy, the pack, the grand prize package is quite mighty. And Abra is here has got just one piece of it here, which is an OLED Switch, an OLED Nintendo so, Switch. So, like everybody at this point probably has a Switch, right? But do you got the OLED? Do you got do you got the fancy screen that you could see sunniest day outside, worst conditions ever? No matter what, this baby won't do you wrong. And it comes with the hottest Zelda release, Skyward Sword HD. So you can catch up on the lore of how the Legend of Zelda series began, canonically. There you go. It doesn't get better than that. Except it does, because you're also eligible for the... the okay, this, this is one of the coolest prizes we've ever had. That hammer. Okay, I'm not... I'm, for safety, I'm not going to lift it up, but... 
This Megaton Hammer by Heroic Replicas. This thing, yeah, you can you can see this thing. This thing is a, this thing is a mighty weapon. All right, and it'll be a mighty addition to your gamer den. Yeah, it's 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 an incredible, incredible piece of metalwork. And Oof. here's the great thing about it. What is it? You you don't have to just go for the grand prize to get that. There are currently auctions yeah. that Heroic Replicas is doing right now. You can win yourself the Megaton Hammer if you really want it. And you've got that ability to get it. You can get that Heroic Replicas Megaton Hammer and it will be supporting charity. Yeah. Half of what they get from the auction will go as a donation to what we're raising here at Zeldathon Daybreak, but if it's someone is generous enough to put a bid in of four thousand dollars or more, Heroic Replica is just going to give us the entire thing, which is crazy. That's pretty. That's pretty neato. The auctions are kind of powerful because everyone's like, "Man, I'm so upset. They only made one of them, and it's like a random chance." It's like, if you got the money, right there, you can win some awesome swag. So go to zelathon.com for more info and the links to the eBay auctions for all of those. You also get entered into when the Hylian Shield neon sign. Do we have that around here? Uh, no, I the don't neon, think we have it up here. Neon sign. We'll, fi we'll figure that out. You got it a Hylian be, Shield. It might be in safety because uh, it's a bit fragile. It we is, want to make sure. It? it is, isn't it? You also get uh, uh, entered to win a Mojo headband and scarf. Here we go. Look at that. Oh, man. Everything Mojo makes is wonderful. Like, for, for being somebody who makes them out of her home, everything Mojo makes is wonderful quality. You can see this has more than enough length to wrap around you, and you know, maybe if you're sweet on somebody, you can wrap it around them too. Perfect. And stay close on a cold day. Perfect. Yeah, I'm sure you've seen the zealous people that we have uh, our hats. Everybody's got a hat uh, made, made by Mojo. And so now you can be entered to win a scarf and a headband by Mojo. Uh, also, a Song of Storms music box by Marie Lum. This is cool. Is that it? Is this it? Look. No, that's, a, that's the Rue 4 pack. Is this it? No, that's a 3D printed Hylia set. Well, it might be around your summer, but that sounds like fun. A Song of Storms music box. Yeah, this is the Rue 4 pack. I don't know. Maybe it's maybe it's kept in storage because it's fragile. Mm -hmm. Some uh, abstract Majora's Mask art by <laughs> Sheik as Zelda. Oh. Who doesn't need, need some more art? Listen, if you're watching well, this right now, your room, it could use... Some brightening up. Look, it's if, a little even, bare. Even if your walls are fully populated, you got a ceiling, right? Put it up there. Exactly. You got uh, more you square know. footage. Exactly. Not only that, but when you wake up, first thing you look at, <sighs> maybe it's Majora looking down back at you, and you're like, "I'm, I'm gonna get you." Today's it, the day I take down the moon. And it makes you smile, and it motivates you. Yeah. And I know if you're all watching it this time, you need some motivation. So let's get motivated with this grand prize, and finally, you get a tingle wood carving. By Pink Penguin, friend of the show, longtime viewer, Pink Penguin. So a whole bunch of fun stuff. That's just the grand prize. But every day during our game blocks, we have a whole new host of prizes every day into which you can be entered to win. I believe the prizes are U.S. only, but yeah. we do have things for international viewers, like the auctions. I believe there's also social giveaways as well through Gleam. Uh, I believe we'll be tweeting those out throughout the event. So make sure you follow Zelathon on Twitter and any other social channels that you think uh, you will participate in. I know not everybody uses, I mean, I don't have a TikTok, but I know a lot of the, a new, a lot, a lot of the new generation does. I don't have an Instagram. I know a lot of the new generation does. You're, you're better off for it. It's, it's nothing but people selling like protein powder and like, you know. What? Okay, Jackson, you gotta explain to me, what is pink sauce? What is pink sauce? What is pink sauce? You, well, you've, I'd have never heard those words in that order before. You tell me. Obviously, you're more familiar. Okay, so what I've seen is, like, apparently it's a TikTok trend to just order strange food from people. And, like, there's this TikTok trend of just, like, here's this pink sauce. Put it on everything you eat. It tastes amazing. And it turns out it's giving people salmonella. So don't <laughs> order pink, pink sauce. It's... Uh, well, when I think pink sauce, I think of like the pink slime. It's basically a it, bottle of Pepto Bismol they send you. I'm like, what is this? Why well, is that's, this? That's fine. Pepto Bismol does the opposite of make you sick. It usually makes you feel well, not better. Not if it's been sitting out in like the hot car for a week. <laughs> hot car? Is that the process for making the pink sauce? 
Got to ferment your vegetable this Well, see, yeah, what happened for someone who doesn't have this, you sure seem to know a little bit about it. So he, you tell he, me. It keeps showing up in my feet. I'm like, why is this? It's like you, you never... You ever get any of the advertisements in your feed of like, why am I getting this marketed to? Like, you were at work one day and somebody in the background was like, oh, you know, I gotta feed the baby. And then your phone picked up on that. Baby. And it's like, well, hey, I guess you need diapers, hon. I'm like, stop this. It's creepy, isn't it? It's horrible. It's creepy, isn't it? I want to know the, the look on the face of like the, the Google software people who, who made this happen. Are they burying their their head, head in their hands in shame? Yeah, under because the Abra's pile, getting under, under, under the pile of money. Oh, we're ready to go. All right. Well, we are ready to uh, head back over. Uh, so we will see you guys back at uh, the VRB screen, and then we'll start the Legend of Zelda with OC.